Yo, 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 Friday, yo, yo, gaming in DBD playing Survivor. Yo, 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 it's a clown. Sick. Hold on, chat, hold on. Background player beam save coming up. See what we can do here. Hold on. <laughs> hold on, he knows, man. Hold on. Wait, maybe. Hold on, chat, let me cook. Give me a sec. Okay, running back in. Oh, fuck. No, 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 no. I, well, I wasn't here. I wasn't doing it. Didn't even think about it, man. Not even slightly. And uh, yo, what's going on, Elias? Welcome in, dude. Hello, chat. Hello, happy Friday. Uh, I really want to get that save, but it's not an angle. Fuck. If it goes hard, thank you, man. Th this right here is the OG, like Lilithoman classic. It's the uh, combination of the festive pants with the, uh, yeah, the paddles and the, uh, and the straw hat. It's pretty good. I'm, I'm running, sorry. <laughs> I probably shouldn't have thrown that, but it's okay. Don't worry about it, shout, we're buying time. And uh, yo, Daniel, happy Friday, man. It's good to see you, dude. Yo, 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 gaming. Uh, Sra, so that's Shan. Hold on, wait, who's Sra? Oh, that's, <laughs> that's new to me, dude. Also, Sarah, it's good to see you, man. Hello. Chat palette with five gens. Yeah, yeah, I mean... We, we bought a bit of time, though. Maybe like 12 seconds or so. It, it could have been worse. Oh. So, Strawberry, much love, dude. Hello, happy Friday. Hello, uh. Sarah is Sra. We spelled our names wrong once. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I, I, Okay, admittedly, I didn't think that was intentional. Okay. <laughs> I thought that was a, that was a genuine mistake. So I'm lurking. That's okay, Sarah. No worries. Now, yo, Rain Monster. 22 months. That's almost two years, dude. Fuck me. That's wild. Uh, thank you, man. To many, many more. Thank, thank you. So, trans. Good morning. It's. Uh, I'm trying to think of time for you. Uh, is it 11 a.m.? If I'm not mistaken, something like that, right? Uh, it was the first time. It, oh, wait, wait. It was the first time, but now it's intentional. I see. Okay, I was kind of sat there, like, who the fuck is Sra, bro? <laughs> this is a name that I do not recognize. And uh, yo, shade of ashes. Giga Chad. It's good to see you, dude. If hiccups again, bro. Okay, uh, number one little Thoman pro tip for uh, getting rid of hiccups is, uh, I don't know, the old classic like hold your breath for twenty seconds tech. Okay, if we run into the corner, big spin, almost out of the man. Oh uh, yeah, but it's uh, eleven a.m. Dude, I'm just so geographically adept, dude. I'm like the best, <laughs> clearly the best. Uh, while the add-ons get changed, you mess up the PTB. Um, they change Soul Chemical, they change Summoning Stone, and they change Shredded Notes. Um, Shredded Notes is basically the same, it just doesn't have a downside now, which is kind of weird. Um, and then Summoning Stone and Soul Chemical are like completely different, basically. It's been had potential? I, I thought so, but clearly the clown is just way better at the video game and decided not to swing, you know? Uh, the awkward moment where, yeah dude yeah exactly right you spin them like up the wazoo they have no idea what's going on and then they just decide to stand still and don't even swing it's insane uh hello i am here what's up you what's going on amarillo good to see you dude uh, we need to crank some gens though man this is not going ideally like fims is fucking death look oh god i was saying you gotta uh yeah dude of course make some breakfast enjoy sarah we'll see you again soon uh, for every blight nerf, wait, wait, sorry, uh, dude, I, I, I swear to God, I can't uh, read today. Uh, for every nerf the blight gets, uh, he also gets one buff or two. Like, I, I, it still doesn't make any sense to me. Why would you nerf double speed and then just give him the speed back, but better with other add-ons? It doesn't really compute in my brain, dude. I literally reached an eerie one ten minutes ago. Nice one, man. I don't even know where I am on killer. Um, admittedly, I haven't played as much. Uh, this reset as I typically do. I gotta be close though for sure. Uh, more speed. I'm, I'm I'm not gonna complain about it. It's not a bad thing, at least for blight mains. It's just weird, you know. Like hey, uh, we decided to nerf blight speed because clearly it was problematic. Um, and in compensation, here's just way more speed. I I don't get it. Also, hold on. Oh shit, Fims is down. Oh god, this is bad. Okay, pick up a uh, missile. I'm gonna miss the summoning stone. I'm, I'm really hoping that they don't go through the changes. Like, 
I mean, yes, it's better. Ultimately, having, you know, extra speed is nice. But, like, I mean, the summoning stone was so unique. And even if I didn't like it, also, almost a great shot there. Even if I didn't like it, also, we got a fucking smooth dude. Like, Soul Chemical was also really unique as well. I'm not going to be so... Uh, uh, wait, hold on. Uh, so sad if something stone changes go through. Same. Like, I mean, even with a uh, Soul Chemical, I didn't use it. I didn't really like it that much. But, like, at the very least, it was unique. You know, it kind of added, like, a different playstyle uh, to Blight. So, backpack is huge. Oh, it's fucking massive, man. But everyone knows that the uh, the more outrageous the uh, Survivor cosmetic, the more likely you are to survive in a chase. It's a statistical fact. Okay, sick, sick, sick. Getting somewhere. Uh, I'm going to try and go, like, around. Maybe he doesn't see me. And at your singular, it's going pretty good. You know, vibing, chilling. Attempting to not get destroyed by a uh, monster clown over here. Does he know where I am? Always oh, doing the old classic camp tech, man. You love to see him. Uh, can I go into the save? This is a bad idea. I feel like this is probably a bad idea. Big miss. Hey, pretty good. I, I also realized I don't have any pallets back here. That's really cool. Um... Oh, I've got no pallets back here. That's even cooler. I guess I go for the old corner rock tech. Yeah, you love to see it, man. Very cool. <laughs> Very cool. Cheers, Mr. Clown. Uh, you clown. He's not the worst killer in the game, to be fair. Uh, Lilith does a kayaking stream when? Like an IRO kayaking stream? I mean, that would be great if I knew how to kayak in the first place. Uh, chat, is anyone in here good for 3D printers? I am not. Uh, my older brother is. I could always pass on the information, maybe. Com corner time. It wasn't even by choice, though. There's just nothing here, man. I got a tile there with two windows. And then no filler pallets. It wasn't, no, not even in the corner, dude. A kayaking gives me nightmares, bro. What, like, from experience? I'm very curious. I'd love to know what happened. Oh, so solid. So, how dare you go live, Lilith, whilst I'm busy? I miss uh, precious minutes of vibe time. I'm sorry, dude. You know, sometimes we do actually go live on time. Uh, do we get saved here? Probably not. I kind of feel like Ace might just leave us to die. Uh, he might also be AFK. He might be ordering pizza. No one really knows. Uh, I, I, I guess we give up here and attempt to give him hatch, maybe? Is Ace doing? I don't know, dude. He's just standing there. Menacingly. Uh, fair enough. Oh, uh, you're not the ace, by the way. Of course, dude, of course. If it was you, you wouldn't be AFK ordering a pizza. Also, uh, yo, Spirex. Hello, dude. Welcome in. Happy Friday. Just imagine getting stuck in the boats. What, like, like you, you, you imagine being in a boat and the boat gets stuck? Or you imagine that you physically are stuck in a boat? Because that would be kind of terrifying. Um, admittedly... I don't know. I, I, I'm, am I scared about getting stuck in a boat? Maybe? <laughs> it's not really gone through my brain, to be honest. And uh, yo, balls of iron. Thank you for seven streams, dude. So, like, stuck in the kayak and you rotate. Oh, I see. Um, yeah, it doesn't sound ideal, but again, th th that fear hadn't really gone through my head until right now. Uh, hey, Lilith, uh, which place is your favorite? Yo, uh, how do I pronounce your name? Somboro? Uh, Miro, hello, dude. Um, my personal favorite, it is in the FAQ, is the, um, how do I describe it? It's the vegetable face, like the true blight, and then also the, uh, what is it? The prestige body and iron bone cane. Like, the, that triple wombo combo is like the Lilithoman standard. And, uh, yo, Ray, hello, dude. Welcome in. How, okay, by the way, chat, since I wasn't live, uh, Wednesday or Thursday yesterday, um, how has everyone's week been so far? Uh, you physically get stuck in the boat and then die, bro. <laughs> well, fingers crossed. What we'll do, Zoe, is we'll get you like an extra super big boat that you can't get stuck in. Build today? No? Well, uh, for sure. Here, is it anyway? You. Well, Amarilla, thank you for throwing a bit. You know what? Whilst we're here, I think I actually will, if I can find the uh, overlay, which is probably somewhere like that. <laughs> there you go, man. Uh, yeah, if anyone has a build um, or a, a killer that you want to see me play today, man, since it is Friday, uh, we'll do some open builds. Uh, thank you again for 500 bits. That is so, so kind. Uh, stuck in the boar? Wait, wait, wait. The boar? Wait, what? what? 
<laughs> Why are you stuck inside a boar, man? That, 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 that's not how you're supposed to treat the boar, dude. Uh, let's see, hold on, mate. So good, played some football today, feeling healthy on a Friday. That's sick, man. That's awesome to hear. Are uh, you curious how the voice says, uh, oh, with the umlau? I'm, I'm not sure if I caught it, dude. There's an incredible POV kayak video of this dude kayaking in Chile. Um, watching him go over waterfalls and stuff is so epic. Okay, but has he ever been stuck in a kayak, though? To be fair, uh, I, I, I do feel like Zoe brings up a pretty good point here. Look at the prediction. Wait, what's happened? Well, little escape this time. Yeah, easy. Now, <laughs> now stuck in the boat. I'm not getting stuck in the boat, dude. As you can clearly tell, I have two wombo combo paddles, okay? And so even if theoretically I did get stuck in a boat, I could like wedge it between my legs and just like, you know, pry myself out, right? Surely. I know where the pebble plot twist to survive a game. That is an awful idea. Uh, Missa has clearly put points into me dying here. Uh, also, you're weird. It's good to see you, man. Happy Friday. Let me see if I missed any um uh, stuff. Actually, hold on real quick. Uh, you'll fly. I've missed you as well, dude. It is good to be back. And as of next Monday, uh, it will be back to, you know, total normality. Monday through Friday, 4 p.m. through 10 p.m., six hours a day. You know the drill, dude. Uh, also, yesterday you played the most painful game ever as a Swift. They had four adrenalines and four distortions and had aura reading builds. So you played a match without perks. That is really based, and I respect it. Did you at least get one kill? And uh, you're dead. GG's, man. That clown fit um, is probably one of my favorites in the game. It's really, really cool. Imagine getting stuck in a boar. I mean, <laughs> like, I mean, it, it seems relatively unlikely, but like getting stuck in a boat seems... It seems somewhat viable, maybe. Um, getting stuck in a boar seems like a way harder... Um, <laughs> it seems way harder to explain, you know? Also, imagine, dude, thank you so much. If you have a build or a killer you want to see today, man, please do let me know. Scars and I rule. Enjoy the emo's death for viewing. Also, Joe, in YouTube chat, my dude. Um, a week so far has been going fine, sorting out my backlog of uh, OBS footage, mainly consisting of footage of your nurse. Sick, dude. Uh, if you have any, like, footage you want to show me, by the way, feel free to post it in Discord. That'd be awesome. Uh, thank you, Imagine. You were too kind. Uh, wait, hold on. Sarah actually played DVD yesterday. I don't believe it, man. That's insane. Uh, Cade, Cade grabbed your controller and, um, made me teabag the killer so you got tunneled. But <laughs> it sounds like everyone's had a pretty sick week so far. That That's all that matters. Okay, it's a spooky Larry's match. Hello. Also, not running no either. Thank fuck. And uh, yo, hug tech into DMs. What a great username. Uh, hey man, how do you feel about behavior and removing the ability to hug tech as blight? How does that affect your gaming experience as blight? Um, like specifically the hug tech being removed. Oh fuck, it's a doctor. It's doctor. Actually, I'm going back on the gen. Fuck you, dude. Uh, specifically, the hug tech being removed does kind of suck. It's something I had a lot of fun with, so... How are you doing? Now, yo, dude, the 100 bits, I'm doing pretty swell, man. Uh, like I was saying earlier, um, for anyone that was in stream, I guess, at the end of Tuesday, it's been a pretty rough week uh, for a lot of reasons, but, uh, you know, we're, we're, we're getting by, man. We're vibing, we're chilling, we're healing up Ace Visconti as he's bleeding to death on the floor. I don't know if you got three calls yesterday for three separate job offerings. That was quite a day. That's sick, dude. Nice. Um, uh, do, you, do you know when you're going to be hearing back, potentially? So have I played uh, RDR, as in like Red Dead Redemption? You know, funnily enough, uh, the one I have the most memories playing was uh, Undead Nightmare. I think that's what it was called. I think back in the day. Um, I haven't played the second one yet. A happy Feral for... Oh, fuck. That's a skill check. I think maybe I can go for a beamer save here. Hold up, champ. Okay, hold on. Okay, uh, if you could, like, move into the pallet, that would be wonderful. Um, Claire? Oh, my God, Claire. Let's move into the pallet. There we go. Good shit. Cool. Okay, um, if he continues to chase, I can just go for a pick here. Unless I can't. Okay. Wait, hold on. CJ? Oh, wait, why would he pick? <laughs> why would he pick? This guy's insane. What the fire? Fair enough. I mean, no CJ for me, dude. That's wild. 
The impossible skill check dock. I mean, on Larry's as well. Home field advantage. Base stock. Why would he pick there, dude? I mean, it was the best thing he could have done. There was no way I could have saved that one. But like, fuck me, dude. I got yoinked. Yeah, my bad. Uh, anyway, I'm going to go do some gens because we still have five remaining. This ain't looking too great. Lightball, maybe? Uh, possibly. Well, he, he did seem like he shat his pants a little bit when he saw my beamers. So, also, uh, none of these rooms have gens. That one doesn't. That one doesn't. Where are the gen? Chance. I am lacking gens, but never mind. Found one. Uh, bro, I got that Dwight skin, but it's impossible to see anything with that backpack. Oh, yeah, it's pretty brutal. Um, but that's kind of what adds to the, uh, the skill, you know, the, uh, the expression of the match. Is that, like, you can see about as much as, as the killer can see, which is nothing. Uh, one of them, uh, cyber- oh, wait. Oh, sorry, one of them is a cybersecurity job for the government. That's sick, dude. As long as you don't hack into my mainframe, we should be fine. You right, Doctor? Uh, Doctor watches your streams. Uh, he demon picked. I mean, it, it's respectable to be fair. I just wasn't expecting it, man. The backpack tech it works every time, man. Also, yes, spooky. This is indeed real, and I think you are as well. Also, that's some skill check, dude. Fuck me. Wait, has this guy got Huntress Lullaby? Oh, fuck. Okay, champ. Um, if, if there's one thing you'll come to learn about me, is that, like, I don't look at the screen very often, right? The vast majority of the time that I'm streaming, I'm reading messages, right, in chat. And so, Hundreds Lullaby is, like, the ultimate counter to me as a person, because I'm never actually looking at the screen. Oh, fuck. Don't come over here, buddy. Don't come over here! Nah, 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 nah. No. <laughs> fuck! I thought I could maybe convince him to go the other way around. Was that pop? No, I think we're fine. If I noticed a lot of Huntress Lullaby recently, really? Are you sure? Alright, uh, did they change the map collisions or they changed Blight's collision? Uh, they changed Blight himself. The problem with changing map collisions is, I mean, it would be a long task. There are many objects, there are many things and walls and cars and flooring and whatever, right? It would take years. Um, it's, it, it'd be way simpler to change Blight, which is what they've done. Also, at Mesa, my dude, number one Blight doodler of all time, the 45 streams. You are insane. Much love, dude. That, that, that is so, so kind. Is that we're doing this game? I think we got to get some gens done. I feel like we're probably not going to get any gens done here, dude. Uh, not necessarily. Wait, hold on. Not necessarily. Has Billy got less collision with his buff? True, but that is more of like a um a Billy change again, right? Like with Billy, what they did is they modified it so you can't. Also, I just wasted my endurance, didn't I? Fuck. With Billy, they made it so that like his um collision detection is uh more lenient now, basically. Oh fuck, dude. Oh no! Don't go for me. Oh, that's a pallet. That's not even a fake one. Oh, shit. I shouldn't be running towards downhook, should I? How have we got zero gems? <laughs> oh, no. Okay, we're going to run over here. Oh, I've got to snap out of it, dude. I'm so fucked. I don't know who's chasing right now. Maybe Miss is on that gem. Yeah, I probably saw the stats behavior posted about skill checks. Oh, probably. It was like, wow. 13% of all skill checks are missed with Huntress Lullaby? Sounds like a great sound to me, dude. Which, I mean, I, you know, admittedly, I'm surprised that, um, people hit that many great skill checks. Like, that, that it was, what, like, 20% or something? It's your big moment? Yeah, the part where I die, dude. Okay, back in the gem. Here we go, champ. Yeah, Brazilians, well, we, 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 dude, as long as we complete this gem, I think we can say... That's an escape, personally. Uh, Y'all are on a docks map, home foot advantage. You're not wrong, but also I'm going to prove you wrong by totally escaping this match. Was, 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 that, was that a DS or a save or something? Not too sure. Oh my god, it's a cringe that's blocked. Wait, the word cringe? Is it? Wait, why, why did we block the word cringe? Wads, I don't remember that one. Did something happen? Probably. Uh, all these people have a PTSD from old ruin skill checks. Also true. I guess it depends like how far back the um, statistics go because old ruin skill checks were brutal. 
Must be something. Yeah, that's, that's kind of what I'm thinking. Did someone come in and just spam the word cringe like a hundred times, and instead of banning them, we just blocked the word cringe because it was funny? Maybe. <laughs> Maybe I don't remember. Uh, uh, sums up this game. Yeah, the old, uh, the old Steve scream. You know, like typically speaking, most survivors when they get put on the hook, you know, make a sound that kind of, you know, is. Oh, oh, fuck! Nah, 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 nah. Nah, nah. Anyway, right, chat, that's one gen down. That's pretty good. What I was going to say is most survivors make a sound on the hook that, you know, would kind of make sense with them being stabbed in the back with a large rusty meat hook. And then you have Steve, um, <laughs> who sounds like he wasn't paid enough to be there. And his honest reaction is just kind of like, ah. <laughs> it's incredible. Also, this gen has progress. What's the first gen I was on? Oh, fuck. Oh, Doctor. Yeah, don't need to do it, man. Yeah, don't need to do it. Okay, what do I have to work with here? Uh, he's got some range, for sure. Do you think I have a window vault that I can use here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bro, this guy's just shocking up the wazoo. This guy's shocking up the wazoo. I can't even blind him here, can I? What the fuck? Okay, uh, I'm going to try and run actively away from all the survivors that are working on gens. Which I think is one of them. Okay, back over here. Let's see, is he still committing to the chase? I think he may have left. Or not. Nah, never mind. This guy has not left. Not even remotely. Oh, shit. Okay, looking through the window. Nice. That's pretty good. You know, I'm not sure if I've ever used the window. It's my advantage, but that, that does actually work quite well. Yeah, try and shock me from pre-throwing my pallet, big man. Big pallet vacuum. Do I have anything to use here? Uh, he's left again? A bit of juicing? I mean, it's going, it's going okay so far. I want to make sure that he stays away from Missa, though. That one's down. And, uh, yo, Demon John. Good to see you, dude. I'm doing pretty swell. Attempting to not get destroyed by this doctor. Strong chase. Thank you. I can't tell if he's still chasing. Is that just, like, my tier 3 madness? Oh, it must be. It must be. Actually, why is Red such a cutie? I think it's the, um, lack of, uh, you know, human features. <laughs> the real window tech. Yep, the one and only. Come on, we can totally bring it back. Just keep working on gens. We can do this. Uh, Ace is working on a gen over here. To be fair, I am the only one that's not death hook, so I could always take it down here if I need to. Bring it back on this one, maybe. You know, we, we might actually survive this. Like, maybe. If um, Fims can stick to that gen in the corner, if I can complete this and not get hit by Merciless... Maybe it's doable? I uh, Dredge is a cute dog for sure. Absolutely, man. Agreed. Oh, look, if you might actually get the Victor Real because you're, you're such an OG. Thank you, man. I try my best. Don't run towards the ace. Claire, whatever you do, I'm, I'm believing that you are running Bond right now. Don't do that. Oh, fuck. That's bad. No! No! No, 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 no! Fuck! Okay, that's honestly fine. Don't worry about it. Um, we have one more hook set remaining. We can do this. And that right there, chat, is why it's absolutely imperative that you are running Bond. So otherwise, you run the killer into the survivors doing the gens. That hit, I think he has the extra um, super long double arm Pocos perk. If the turbo tunnels, y'all do. We're going to be tunneling all day long, man. So the doctor reminds me of Jamie with how much he's shocking. Oh, yeah, yeah. I mean, you know, dude, as soon as the M2's, like, off, off a cooldown, you just got to do it again, right? <laughs> Bond over Kindred. Bond is, like, the best perk in the game, dude. It's incredible. Okay, we heal. Player, well, yeah, don't run over here. Unless you're not being chased, in which case, run over here. Yo, hold on. What do you mean, skill issue? We've, like, effectively brought the game back. We're super close to winning this one. Come on, the Shen's so close. 
Wait, so if I'm not mistaken, after you, um, how can I word this? So when you miss a skill check with Merciless, you, uh, the, the gen gets blocked, but it doesn't start regressing, right? Ah! Actually not that bad. Uh, Bond is the best way of playing the game. It seriously is, man. Like, for no other reason... Oh, fuck. Okay, dude, nice skill check. Like, for, for no other reason than the fact that you know where your survivor, you know, your, your, your teammates are, and therefore can not take the killer towards them, right? It's amazing. Ah! Oh, fuck. And yo, Joe, welcome to the Discord server, dude. It's great to have you. Am I hindered? Oh, that was so close, dude. We can totally do this. We might not be able to do this. I don't know, dude. Um, so we have one gen in main. Also, I've got oh, one gen in here. Oh, fuck. No, 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 no. Stop shit. <laughs> not again, dude. I thought Alert was the best survival perk. I mean, Alert and Bond, you know, one and the same. Although, yes, I do ultimately agree that Alert is still the best survival perk. Or at the very least, the most underrated. There we go. Nice. Yeah, let's go. Ah, uh, Missa, do you think you can choose to kill off, like, uh, 90 seconds, maybe? And also, specifically, not in the direction that I'm currently running. Uh, where did we see that gen, by the way? Was it over here? Yeah, sick. And, uh, yo, Blink! Dude, your hero? You are my hero, dude! Uh, meow, 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 day 2192. That is wild, man. It's good to see you, dude. Are uh, you guys sleeping on my boy Sprint Burst? Sprint Burst isn't bad, okay? But, like, Sprint Burst isn't the same. It's not even remotely comparable to, you know, uh, super ultra base perks like, um... Well, I should probably move, shouldn't I? Like Alert or Bond, you know? The hatch, watch this. Shit, I was hoping it would spawn there. Um... Is the hatch more likely to spawn around the outside or the inside of this map? Or is it kind of 50-50? <gasps> Yo! Hold on, chat! Easy peasy! No, 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 no! That's mine! You pre- <laughs> You ain't taking this win from me, dude. GG's! Fuck that guy! Uh, let's see. So we had a uh, Unnerving, Huntress Lullaby, Overcharged, Merciless. The classic wombo combo. GG's, dude. Well played. Let's go. Dude, we almost had the gens done, though, right? Like, considering how much pressure he had for, like, half the game, it was insane that we almost came back from that. That's, that's nuts. Also, Shade, before you mention anything, I'm going to be spending points. Don't lose your shit, dude. It's fine. He's uh, guarding Lullaby in the beginning. Oh, really? Oh, that was why we didn't get the gens done. I see. I uh, can you jump in for the last spot? Yeah, of course. Yeah, Um, I mean, slot's ready if you want to uh, hop in, for sure. Uh, by the skin of your boat paddles. Yep. <laughs> the very same. I'm trying to think. that There was, like, another set that I was running. That There was that one. And there was... What was it? Was it, was it the... It wasn't the dino one. Oh! <laughs> Chat, look at this masterpiece! Okay, so, like, between the two, right? Let's say you're playing as killer. You've just loaded in. And then you see a full lobby of X, right? Would you rather the X be this Dwight or that Dwight? Which one is more intimidating? the hell is that it, it's it's uh, i mean okay so at the very least um in in my opinion okay i think this might be the greatest cosmetic in dvd history <laughs> and no it's not crusty dwight fuck off dude he ain't crusty he's doing fine um the the kind of like head cannon that i've got this guy is that like he's a mechanic but also he has to like get to work um at the theater but he finishes working um, in the garage at like 5 p.m. and the job at the theater starts at 4 p.m. So he doesn't really have any time to change. Um, and so, yeah, it's like a weird hybrid of the two. Uh, the hat spells trouble. I'd be scared. I'm, I'm so glad you agree, Seahorsey. Welcome in, dude. I, I would personally be terrified as well. Uh, bro, I don't want to chase someone who looks like that. So the first one. So, so, so the second one is more intimidating. You would rather have this guy... No, wait, wait, sorry. You would rather have this guy in the lobby than this guy, right? So I would probably agree. With a, with a hat that looks like that, I kind of feel like you could just, um, like, put your head down and then run forwards and use it like a battering ram, you know? And, uh, yo, Google, dude, thank you, man. Yo, yo, Lilith and chat. 
been a while since I was able to hop in, but I wish you all a fantastic Friday and a wonderful weekend. Thank you so much, Google. Uh, 32 months is, well, like 17 years, uh, if my math is correct. Um, I really, really hope you're doing fantastic, man. Have a wonderful weekend and some many, many more. Thank you, dude. Uh, Nat, it's uh, not pointy enough to be intimidating. True, but like, have you seen, okay, really obscure, really random reference here. Have you seen like the third Lord of the Rings movie when there's like that huge fuck off battering ram and it's trying to get through that, that massive like castle door? Imagine that, but instead of the battering ram, it's just Dwight's head, right? Like, I, I, I kind of feel like, you know, blunt force might be the way forwards here, dude. Also, 45 streams with no clothes, bro. <laughs> Are you trying to tell me you've been naked for the past 45 streams that I've done? I'm not sure if I needed to know that, man. But but now that you've told me, um, I, I really appreciate that, dude. That, that is pretty based. Uh, what did I just zone back into? I, I'm not too sure, man. What oh, streak? Oh, I see. Oh, 45 stream streak. <laughs> I love you, Blink, bro. What the fuck? Uh, look, gonna be gone for a while. Uh, gonna get some spicy flicks while I'm gone. Of course, dude. I'll see what I can do. And to uh, skip the line, uh, he wears the Twitch shirt to get VIP. Of course, dude. Everyone knows that uh, being a Twitch streamer gets you, you know, um, a, a, a first class tickets to everything, right? What's about your trends? Um, have I sent myself to Greenville Popcorn Dwight yet? Uh, no, in fact, I've only played that map like twice, I think. One hell of a healing. Cut out the cancers corrupting your soul. Barely breathing recovery by bleeding. But the rot will go. Dr. Sin is in. Apples. Um, admittedly, okay, so purely between me and you, no one else can hear this right now. Um, what the fuck? <laughs> what does that mean, huh? The cure is screaming? Dr. Sin? Something about rots? I, I must admit, I am slightly perplexed, uh, but thank you for the 100 bits. That is incredibly kind. Thank you, dude. Uh, no one has ever tunneled or focused a Twitch streamer in the history of DVD, actually. It is true. Like, statistically, a Twitch streamer has never actually been tunneled, ever. I felt like a Lorno from Amnesia. Yeah, exactly, right? Like the old Penumbra games or something. I'm a little bit perplexed, but also kind of based. I feel like the more random your uh, TTS message can be, the better. Uh, for one minute, what the fuck is this outfit? Why does everyone hate my DVD cosmetics so much, man? There's nothing wrong with this, right? It's Dwight the mechanic, but also has like a part-time job at the movie theater. And he's got to get to his second job, but it started like an hour ago. You know, so he kind of has to like wombo combo the builds. Ugly ass fit, okay. Now you guys are just being mean. Also, fuck, dude. Uh, I have a pallet here, but she is 115. A fine slap to the face, big blinds. No light, Bond is good. Like, uh, remember how I said I was running Bond so I didn't run into survivors? <laughs> uh, oh, shit. Uh, you want to go for a heal? Uh, it looks like something out of the Grand Budapest. Um, yeah, I mean, I'll, I'll take you, dude. That ain't too bad. Could be significantly worse. Uh, running bond equals running into people on purpose. I completely agree. You are a worm, though, time. The thunder song distorts you. Happiness comes. White curls, but yellow and red in the eye. Right. Through a mirror, inverted is made white. Right. Leave your eyes by the door. <laughs> Push the fingers through the surface into the wet. Yep, into you the wet. Yep, I do that all the time, man. Uh, Amarilla, is everything okay? Should I um, be in contact with a psychiatrist for you? I'm genuinely concerned. Uh, but thank you for the 100 bits. You are way too kind. What the fuck does that mean? Uh, it, it is relatable, though. Uh, I, I, too, often um, push my fingers through the surface into the wet. <laughs> anyway... Is that control reference? I don't know, dude. I think my, 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 my favorite part, the most relatable part of the whole thing, is, um, yeah, uh, white poles with yellow and red in the eye. I completely, I completely agree with that one, man. Uh, Dwight looks like he gives zero fucks. Completely agreed. Uh, control is awesome. Best 7 out of 10 game I ever played. I remember, like, hearing good things about it, but I also remember hearing bad things, and I think that was enough to, like, put me off of playing it. Also, two gens done. 
is she attempting to like condemn tech on Coldwind? Because I, I feel like it's probably not going to work that well, to be honest. Um, because all we got to do is just like, yeah, go and like take a hit for Shan. Also, hold on, background player save coming up right up, boys. Yeah, I'm, I'm not too sure if this is going to work, to be honest. Oh, you've beaten Control four times, really? Is it recommended? I, I I presume you feel like it's a good game, right? Oh, shit. I'm, I'm not too sure if the Condemn is going to be working too well on this map, but maybe I'm wrong. My Control is a love it or hate it, and you loved it. I see, gotcha. It's a masterpiece, actually. Like, Bioshock level masterpiece? Ain't gonna work on a map this big. That's kind of what I was feeling. I mean, it's what, 60 meters, I think? Yeah, she ain't nowhere close. If you don't look at people's faces while they talk, it's a good game. Wait, what's, what's wrong with their faces? It's not a masterpiece, but it's pretty good. Okay, gotcha. I also remember there being a game... Oh, what was the name of the other one? Um, The Medium? I think... That looks pretty good, but I heard mixed things and I never ended up playing. I think that's by Bluebird, right? Can't remember. I don't know if I've been recommended to run. Um, Hex Ruin, Hex Undying, Deadlock, and Barbecue and Chili to practice Blight. The add-ons I was told to use are Shredded Notes and Combat 21. This is good at practicing. Who the fuck told you to run that, man? Um, I mean, I'm, I'm not trying to tell you that whoever told you that is wrong. But I kind of... Uh, yeah, um, in my humble opinion, completely disregard everything that person could ever tell you about playing. <laughs> uh, Compound 21 is bad. Don't run that. Um, Shredded Notes is really bad. Especially don't run that one. Uh, Ruin Undying, I guess, could could work. Deadlock's a good pick. Barbecue is okay. Um, I still think it's worth running, like, Lethal, though. And also maybe, like, No Way Out or something. What would I recommend? Uh, lethal, Barbecue, Deadlock, Grim Embrace with, uh... I mean, honestly, at this point, probably, like, Green Speed and, um... I don't know. I mean, as of the new update, I think Shredded Notes would be a good pick. Like, right now, though, not, not a chance, dude. Deadlock and Grim? Yeah, Deadlock, Grim, um... Like, right now, probably Green Speed and Kankathorn, I'd say. Rose Tonic. Now, so the, the, the problem with Rose Tonic is that, like, learning your slam duration is really, really important. Um, and it kind of does the opposite. Also, where are the pallets, gamers? There's one here. That's fine. Bro, what? What? That's like two Pocos with three pallets in a row, dude. I think she commits. Nah, not a chance. Okay, well, uh, see you later, Bozo. Let's run this way again. Nice, okay, I don't know what we're cleansing. Oh, Pentimento, I see, gotcha. Well, rip in peace. Uh, the ping is strong with this one. <laughs> Bad connection you are. Uh, not Rose, because you need that slam duration knowledge. Exactly, yeah. Like, I, I've never seen someone learn Blight with slam duration add-ons and then not fuck up their basic slam duration afterwards, you know? Like, once you have a good understanding of slam duration, um, feel free. You know, Rose Tonic is fantastic. You run a double area barbecue, uh, lethal, dead man's pain res almost every match. That's fair. Oh, shit. He's back. Actually committing to a chase? Onrio, what's gone into you, man? That's crazy. Wow. Chat, have you guys ever seen this? That Onrio's actually committing to a chase. That's insane. Wow. Oh, shit. Never mind. Excellent. <laughs> Rip Bozo and another one for good luck. There we go. <laughs> and the Onrio was blind for 17 Lilith years. And at your duty, two months. Thank you so much, man. So many, many more. You are incredible. Oh, not again. Fims. Oh, I can't get that one. Rip. I cracked. Thank you, Malhouse. Thank you, dude. I'm currently using barbecue, um, discordance, ruin, and dying with blighted crow and ring. Uh, I mean, okay, so ultimately, I mean, you can run whatever you like. You don't have to listen to me or, um, whoever told you to run the other concerning build. But, like, I, I wouldn't recommend running Alcring if you're learning blight. Again, like, 
you know, understanding his standard three second rush duration is pretty important because it gives you an idea as to like what you know you can go for. Like going long is a really fundamentally important thing for becoming good at playing blights. And Alkring isn't really going to teach you that. Uh, if anything, it's going to fuck with your muscle memory. Um, I mean, green speed's fine. It's only 3% now, so it's not really that big of a deal. Even if you wanted to run double speed, that's, you know, fine. Uh, best adrenaline bar combination. As of right now, uh, it depends what you want to go for. Do you want, like, uber, super, ultra flex? It's like Adivile and, um, what is it? Uh, Airy Tank would be kind of sick. You have always been here, the only child. A copy of a copy of a copy. Orange peel. The picture is the Oh, the shit. Picture. Oh, when you're right, man. My bad. Know you're in New Year. You uh, where are the listen. TVs? You want to dream. You want to smile. You want to hurt. You don't you do. want to be. Those are all things you want to do. Hold on, chat. I'm grabbing the tape. No one panic. Everything's fine. And, uh, yo, Raven. Also, uh, 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 Raven, hello, welcome in. Um, Amarillo, thanks for the 100 bits. I am concerned for you, dude. Uh, if you need some help, <laughs> let me know, dude. Oh, no. I am condemned. I am no longer condemned. Okay, going back for that guy. That's okay. That's possibly not okay, actually. Oh, shit. Oh, no. <laughs> Whoops. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Okay, don't run into main. Uh, unless you want to take a... Okay, that's fair. We can possibly get a pick here. So that time you got the tape, it wasn't a huge concern, dude. I was like at least one stack away from dying. Okay, there we go. Also, Sham, we're going to pretend we didn't see that dead hard. Okay, you want to heal? I kind of feel like healing's probably a good idea here. Also, no! No, don't do that! Don't do that! No, do <laughs> Oh, fuck. Oh, no. Oh, no. No, that's even worse! Oh, fuck. No, okay, Shan, I tried. Um, I was, I was going to try and go for the CJ like four miles away from the pallet. That's really bad. Don't worry, miss. I've got you, dude. Everything's fine. I'm really hoping Fims can get that gen done. Do you think I can make that window vault with resilience? I'm gonna try it. No! She got a grab there. I'm kind of impressed. Well played. However, we also have zero hook stages, so this could be significantly worse. No pain res, no pain res. Hey. Have you heard that they are building a Wish.com Universal Studios, same as the American ones, in Bedford? Are they actually? Wait, wait, like, like, like... Wait, so... And, like, hold on. I'm, I'm trying to wrap my head around this and also my stuff at the same time. Like, an official Universal Studios, like, a legitimate, like, branded Universal Studios in Bedford. Really? Why Bedford? I was wondering this thing for 24 months, man. Two years to many, many more. Thank you so much, man. You were handsome and cool. Fine. Um, let's go jump on some gens. Is that the one that Fims was on, by any chance? Okay, me and Mr. can spare hooks here. Okay, she is not wearing her skull candies. She does not know I'm here. Cool. Yeah, Dad lives in Bedford. He's quite excited for it. Uh, I'm, I'm really confused. We said that they're, they're building like an official Universal theme park in Bedford. I, I, I'm also quite excited. In fact, I might have to go visit your dad while I'm there, man. That's a little bit weird, though. Maybe a little pop. Yeah, yeah. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. That's not good. That ain't good. No. Oh. Nah, 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 nah. Uh, two years well spent. Thank you, Elise. You are way too kind, man. I appreciate you, dude. Uh, no, Mrs. Onrio. I do not die here. Okay, I'm gonna go do the tape. Riding in embrace. Retribution. Soul eclipse turns solid. Energized. Sucking vomit acting like it's honey. No! That was so close, dude. Well played, man. I guess I'm dead. 
Hold on. <laughs> she fucked up the click, dude. Oh, Apples, thank you for 100 bits. I still don't know what's going on, but uh, you were very, very kind. Okay, so, okay, pros and cons. The con is that we died. Uh, the pro is that she did fuck up the Mori, and it did look kind of funny. Shit's on. It's fine, dude. We almost had that. Oh, shit. Hold on. Tape time. Very cool. <laughs> GG's. Uh, a project of this scale has the potential to be transformative for Benford and, and deliver significant benefits to the UK economy. I mean, probably. It's just weird to choose Benford. Terracotta pie. Hey, terracotta pie. Hey, terracotta pie. Hey, terracotta pie. That's a system of a down reference. See, that one I kind of understand. And uh, you're all good. It has been a long time. I hope you're doing okay, man. Hope you haven't been hit by any more uh, cars. I think the last time I heard from you, uh, you were in hospital again. <laughs> Doors were so close. It was really, really close, man. Are you kidding me? Hold on, Swift. Hold on, guys. Did we just get destroyed by a P1 Unreal as a P400 team? Are you kidding me? We'll let them in blight dance. Jeez, dude. What the fuck was that? Uh, also, Ricky, thank you for the two months, man. To many, many more. Uh, you are incredible and handsome and also very, very cool. What the fuck? Mingo, are you seeing this, man? This outrage. Uh, team, thank you for playing. Shan, Fims, Missy, you are all incredible. It is time to go play some killer, though. And hopefully not lose against uh, P1 players. Uh, Plaything got you. Honestly, I, I totally get that, man. So, yo, Big Blue. That's so kind, man. Thank you. Hello, Lilith. Hope you're having a great weird Fez flat cap hybrid day. Lurking in chat lol. Less than three. Is everyone just in one of those like weird Friday moods today, man? Because I, I don't know what that means. Unless you're talking about the weird Fez flat cap hybrid that Dwight was wearing. In which case, yes, I'm having a wonderful day so far. Um, okay, so just to confirm, I think we have like two or three in queue right now, right? We have the Bubba, and then we had uh, Endgame Trapper, and there was another one as well that I'm not sure if I caught. Uh, also, can I add my Wish Cosmetics to the Blight build? Uh, of course you can, dude. Absolutely. Uh, also, build-wise, I'm not going to run the classic uh, Mad Grip Bubba, because it hasn't really been that great for us recently. Pain Rares, bit of the old cheeky Grim Embrace... I uh, kind of feel like lethal might be a good idea here, or, or I mean, alternatively, enduring could be sick. And what's like the classic Bubba Pug? It's got to be Insidious, right? That is the Wombo Combo. And at your fims, that's so kind of you, dude. Thank you for the raid. Uh, it's been so long since I last saw you. Uh, how, how are the games? <laughs> I don't suppose you just got shit on by a particular Omrio, did you? And, uh, yo, Mutation, good to see you, man. Manifesting Lilith lose to a P100 Leon. It's not gonna happen, man. I don't think Leons have ever escaped in the history of DVD. Hey, All timer, that is me, man. I'm so sorry, but, uh, dude, Ricky again. Thank you for the resub, dude. Uh, you're in a great mood today. See, that, that that's fantastic. That is good to know. Um, it's not so much you, Moth. It's everybody else that's just kind of concerning me today. You know? <laughs> It's the, uh, wait, so Tia Man Mask, uh, the black suit that I don't remember the name of, and the metal cane, if you know which one I mean. Uh, it's the mechanical staff as well as the Victorian ruffle, the darker one, I think is what you mean. Uh, what is the requirements for builds again? Uh, what, for, like, redeeming one? It's either, I mean, you can do it for free, uh, via channel points, or it's 500 bits or two gifted subs for a build, uh, via that way, I guess. Um, any killer, any build. Presuming I've got the add-ons, I guess. Uh, how much for concern are we talking? Honestly, like, considering the kind of shit that this chat has been through in the past, not that concerning. Um, it's not like the whole feet saga again. <laughs> but uh, probably like a 2 out of 10 on the concern meter I think. Uh, but not Hag. No, of course not, man. Yes, I should specify. Uh, Hag is not 2 gifted subs. Hag is 50, because fuck Hag. Delicious. Uh, if anyone's curious, by the way, I've got some uh, sugar-free Red Bull today, man. It's delicious. And at Apples, it may not have read that because of the word fuck, I presume. 
Uh, oh, meet the man that made me greet the can that I came from. The fucking sacred heart of Jesus blew it in the back room. <laughs> I hope he's not blowing out the back room. What the fuck? Hold on, gamers. Fuck hag with every ounce of my being, dude. <laughs> Excellent, man. Perfect. She is extra oh, super greedy. Almost a scrim baby. Uh, your shit? Oh, almost. Uh, we've got a whole month to think of what we're going to name it. Um, if it was up to me, I would call it uh, Pocos Jr. the fourth. Uh, despite there being like 50 of them. But a thank you, Shelbo. You are too kind. Yo, yo, yo. Grim embrace time. They got, yeah, way too greedy. Agreed. That's a uh, Sprinto Bozo on the Jill. Oh, bless Chili. Oh, it's so good, man. I actually well played in Drink Valley. I lost all my points on Gamba. Gotcha. I my money for an Oni with Lethal, Pain Red, Floods of Rage, and Ritchie Eye. With Pop Nuts and Cut. Yo, I thought I could tantrum tech a man, but we actually kind of got the Enduring Tech instead. That's cool. Uh, so let's thank the fire this man. We can totally get some uh, some Oni going. That sounds sick. And still greeted. That's insane, dude. Riding a rhino, Pico de Hello, Rooster Well played. She's actually doing really well. Uh, so White Rose with 100 bits. Um, I, I, chat, are we, are we actually doing okay? Like, legitimate question. I'm concerned for everyone's mental well-being right now. Something about a bisque, tomato, basil ship. <laughs> what is going on, dude? We're running bam. Yeah, I may have made a fundamental blunder. It's because I decided to go for a insidious. Fine, that's okay. What's going on here today? Uh, Banshee? I don't know, man. I think your guess is as good as mine. Something concerning. So I just realized we're playing on Ormond. This is not great. Ready? Respect it. And at your market, it's going pretty swell, man. Not bad. Vibing, chilling, attempting to kill some gamers. The first down was quick. We are going through pallets pretty quickly, but uh, I feel like they're going through gens just as quick. A uh, booba, links, you are correct. Uh, we don't have purple chili here. We might be able to do this. Excellent, man. Pocos, uh, keep in mind that the Yui or the Jill or Meg, whoever that was, is probably going to try and background player this one. She fucks it up. Excellent. I need some pain res, dude. Oh, so your minus is now P92. God damn. 478 tombstones and 520. Dude, 521. Tuss of hair. I wish I was even 1% as cool as you, mister. That's insane. Still got shit on. Also true. Grim Embrace Part 2. Okay. Found some nerds. Is that Meg? Is that like a new hairstyle or something? I swear to God, that's Yui. <laughs> When did she get that haircut? Hmm, I'm perplexed. He's been a hungry boy. I respect him. Off a Michael. What's oh, the new rift? Oh, I see. Okay, gotcha. I was going to say, I don't remember seeing Meg with that hair. That's insane timing. I'm surprised that in vacuum. I should have gone for another one. I fucked it up, chat. So you win the match. It does look like you win from behind, though, to be fair. Oh, shit. Fuck. <laughs> oh, no. Uh, apples, I totally agree, man. I also uh, partake in tossing stones around from time to time. 
We got healthy past time. Team's juicing? They're doing really well, man. They do have almond tiles without bamboozle, to be fair. We're good, man. Nice. They're playing well. Oh, very, very well, man. Um, are you also gonna try for some background player Beamer Nerdington as a pain res? That's fantastic. On your trout. The snowball commands. I'm hoping so. Um, that isn't gonna be any grim embrace though. Is the problem? Also, I don't know what we're currently regressing. Because main's done. All right, come on then, buddy. Okay, holding W. That's really bad. She's taking me to, like, the worst part of the map. I'm going to leave. She's one of those uh, genioso survivors. Uh, by the way, I hope the game's going well. Uh, love me some Bubba. I agree, dude. You can't ever go wrong with some Bubba gameplay, unless it does go wrong. In which case, you can. It's fine. Yeah, force that one. Excellent. Huge. Um, I don't believe that we actually downed her. So we might be able to get a pain res and or a grow embrace here, maybe. Depending. Hold on, chat. If we believe hard enough, we might be able to bring this back. Maybe. Uh, playing Bubba to get him PA. Wait, uh, PA for the barbecue charm. Oh, sick, dude. Imagine running the barbecue and the Shadowborn charm. Why have I never done that before? I feel like I missed the uh, opportunity, dude. Someone's running to the right here. How long is Grim Embrace? 15 seconds? And Sidious Bubba face camp went uh, soon. That is the plan. <laughs> to be completely honest, I don't know where she went. Uh, oh, she held W because she has lithe. I see. Gotcha. Okay. Reasonable. The 12? Gotcha. Okay. Uh, so nothing insane. One down. Yes, dude. Oh, man. I love Slow Vault so much. That hitbox lingers for like 14 years. The lyrics used in order of donations. Uh, Lordy, Dr. Sin is in. Demiurge, Meshuggah. Wait, did I, did I miss a Meshuggah reference? Oh no. I'm not a true fan anymore. That sucks. Okay. Um, we have a couple options here. I feel like Snowball and Slug is the best thing we can do right now. And I think the best way to do that is going to be to stand right here. And go completely insidious. <laughs> Wait for a chat. Trust me, this is going to be fantastic. Uh, hey, Lilith, I just came by to say hi. And so, dude, today's your birthday? Congrats. Uh, hope you have a wonderful day. Check, can we get some B lights going? For, uh, for great, dude. I appreciate you, man. Have a wonderful day. Is anyone coming for the save? Are we about to get shit on? By our own <laughs> bad decisions. Oh, fuck. Well, that's not good, is it? That's uh, the opposite of good. Teabagging? Hmm. Yeah, I feel like we probably don't get more than one kill here. <laughs> unless, hold on, unless maybe, what if I stand right here? Then go Insidious. Presuming my chainsaw isn't actually going through the wall. Maybe they're like weirdly cocky here that I can go for like a chainsaw down. Unless they just leave. Nah, I'll play, man. Jeez. It was a valiant effort. I feel like bamboos would have been pretty game-changing there. Almost. Uh, don't teabag the booba. I almost feel like there's a very good chance these guys were swiffing. What do you think? They exploiting the, um, the Discord comms. Jeez, dude. And, uh, your pizza! Wait, wait, wah, wah, we were. Hello, how are you? It is fantastic to see you. I uh, think the gift's up to, um, I'm gonna butcher the name, man. Is it Great Orion 8400? I think, uh, dude, enjoy the emos dad for viewing. And again, have a wonderful birthday, man. Pizza, you are way too kind. And I hope you are doing swell. 
Uh, next up is Trapper, I believe. Oh, hey, Lilith, I just came by to say hi, and today is your birthday, not... Wait, is it actually? Okay, hold on, Shaq, okay, hold on. We have another birthday boy in chat. Can we get some serious b lights going for Bodil? I have known you for... I don't even know how long, man. Probably, like, 15 years at this point. Uh, Bodil has been a supporter of me and my streams for the longest time. And even before I was streaming, uh, he is handsome and cool, and I seriously hope you're doing fantastic, man. we got to catch a beer at some point, dude. Um, have a wonderful day. Double birthday? I mean, has anyone else got a birthday today? Could it be a triple? Okay, so, endgame trapper. The only problem is I don't have any map offerings. Uh, so I'll see what I can do. Shit, uh, that is- wait, Larry's! <gasps> Yo! Hold on, that's exactly what I need. Nice. Cool, okay, so, uh, just to check, no way out, remember me, no ed, and blood warden, iridescent stone, and trapper sack. Cool. Uh, yours was a week ago, does that count? I think it does, man. Can we get some beelights going for Zoe, who had a birthday last week? Uh, also, you haven't played this game in a while. When did they add a teddy bear? Uh, this is not just a teddy bear, I'll have you know. This is Naughty Bear. This is uh, Behaviour's um, kind of obscure cult classic game from like 2010 that everyone kind of forgot about, except for me. I don't know, how do you feel about the PTV changes? Sorry if you already spoke about it. I uh, didn't catch the stream the last couple of days or weeks. I do have a clip somewhere that someone could send you um, where I'm discussing my thoughts on it that might be better than me discussing it now. Long story short, I think it's a mixed bag. It's nice that you can play Bump Logic on maps like Swamp, but also you are forced to play Bump Logic and Moon Rushing is kind of fun. Uh, more so than that, I think the biggest problem I have is going forwards, it does, it does kind of um, portray a pretty sad future. Uh, for DVD, I think. Hope to get you while I'm playing Wesker again for rematch. Oh, a great dude. Smiley face. I've definitely gotten better. Emails. I would imagine you are probably the world's greatest Wesker um, of all time. Even better than Wesker from Resident Evil 5. Thank you for 100 bits. You are too kind. Delicious. Uh, chat, what's more scary, Basement Trapper or Endgame Trapper? See, one of them, um, I mean, one of them you can just leave from, though, right? If, if someone's in the basement against the Trapper, you can just leave your teammate and get a three escape, right? Whereas Endgame Trapper, he's just stood there. Wait, no! No, 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 that's bad! Oh, fuck! Make them run, naughty. Make them scream. I will try my best, Mr. Narrator Man. Um... May have fucked up on the maps, though. That ain't good. In fact, I would argue it's probably the opposite of good. Uh, how do I do this, champ? Yeah, what's going on, bozo? Stick one of those bad boys. You know what? Why don't we just go for, like, Basement Trapper instead? That sounds like a wonderful idea, right? Let's see. If we can't do Endgame, we'll just do Basement. And, you know, Slash Endgame. A 7,000 hours Claude Gaming, yeah. <laughs> You're probably not wrong is the worst part. Rip shout it. Yep, gone, but not forgotten. However, we're not going to be um, breaking it yet. It's too valuable. But there was someone here. Not anymore. Are you thinking West will be your first P100, although you're still pretty far from it at P14? Why did my accent just go, like, weirdly northern there? Far away. <laughs> I have no idea, dude. I think it's a great idea. Also, a uh, 12,000 hour um, Alan Wake right here, man. Insane plays. Great job. Yeah, I would recommend going with the P100, the P100 Wesker. It sounds like a good time. You guys think basement is scarier? Really? No! Alright, Bozo. Um, people seem to forget that killers can just aim up a little bit. Uh, Castlevania in Dead Daylight would be cool. Apparently, according to the leaks, that's what we're getting, though. Which sounds pretty cool. I'm just excited for the menu music, man. That'd be so sick. Okay, well, that's Sprint Burst. Oh, no, actually, it's probably not. That's probably Background Player, I think. I rip Alan Wake hooks, but not for gone. Never for gone, dude. I'm 24,000 hour Zarina. <laughs> Insane play. Let's 
Let's see. You gotta throw the pallet now, Bozo. She is. Okay, she managed, she managed to get the blind. She might be 30,000 hours. Uh, good distance, though. Uh, end game trap is way more interesting to play and play again. Space you just leave, like you said. For sure. Um, I guess it depends, like, how early into the game it is, though, right? Because, like... Oh, so that's blocked now, right? Ah, you're fucked. You're fucked, dude. Your 15,000 hours of experience isn't going to save this time, Bozo. True, it, it depends, like, when you get someone in the basement, though. Because if you manage to get someone in the basement early on... Uh, I guess they can just do gens, but they can't leave yet, right? Let's see. Bum, 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 bum. They're not going to run towards Shaq, are they? Fuck. Okay, three gens. Okay, dudes. Hey, you're cleansing bones. Fine. And you're Jason. Dude, Jason, welcome to the stream, dude. Much love uh, from England over to Poland. Yo, hold on. Do you think, theoretically, I could get her into basement by going all the way around Shack and then back downstairs? Or can I do something else that's potentially going to be really, really dumb, but might just work? Hold on. Let's see. I've got an idea, chat. I've got an idea, and it's going to be genius. Let's four gens. I think we've just got to run with it, man. Do what we can. Okay, well, she ran as far away from Shaq as possible. That's kind of bad. I'm trying to brainstorm some ideas here, and admittedly, none of them are going to work. <laughs> uh, what can we do? How can we possibly bring this game back? I mean, no word, maybe. Shit. Oh, damn, M1 Trapper is so OP. He is clearly too strong. One gin! Yeah, run towards Shaq. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Perfect. Uh huh. Yeah. No, run. Oh, shit. Okay, she might know. Now, your mocker, 14 months, dude. I hope you're doing a fantastic, keeping handsome and cool as always. Thank you, dude. What? Infinitely too kind. Cool. I mean, theoretically, if they pop the last gen now, then I guess we at least get, um, no value. Why are you chasing me? Hold up. Melaman? Oh, I see. Very cool. Okay, buddy. Okay. Wait, hold on. Oh, yes! Okay, hold on, chat. This is where we start the snowball. We are going to win the match. We pick up Alan Week right here. Go into the basement. I guess I totally agree, dude. And at your dongle, it's going pretty small, man. Not bad. Uh, we were trying to do some endgame trapper, and then they took us to the wrong map. And now I'm crying. Okay, well, there, there goes nowhere. That's really cool. Um, I guess we stick one of them here. It looks like he's trying to kill himself, so this might actually work. Let's see. They can't cleanse the one on the other side of the pallet. Right, disarm. Uh, the tattoo links in the um, for you page are not working. Uh, you are correct. I'm going to try and fix them as soon as I can. I was going to fix it over the past couple days, and then I forgot. Okay, we've got a bozo over here. What's been worked on? I doubt that they save Alan in time, to be honest. Oh, shit. Uh, okay, that's bad. Uh, we need one more gamer who's possibly... Wait, over here? That was a crow? Hold on, chat. Okay. Random traps going down here. We might be okay. Wait, we might have this. Wait, hold on, perfect! Wait, wait, chat, hold on. Wait, 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 wait. I think we got this. We beeline. She's taking a pretty uh, bad route to the exit gates. There we go. Fantastic. Okay, we're just going to try and cut her off and see if she turns around. Does she just run towards the exit gate like a bozo? Yeah, she does. Okay, that's not good, but that should be fine. 
Remember me? Yeah, but Zarina got open so quickly, dude. I guess, to be fair, she is the obsession, so fair enough. Okay, we're going to try and play a little bit baby here. Pretend that she has hope or something. Let's see what we can do. As soon as Yui's back up, we're going to try and um, get that timer down a little bit more. Oh, horses. Okay, champ. Let me cook. Give me a sec. I think we can do this. Into the trap. Almost into the trap. That's good. That's good. Okay, forwards here. Forwards, forwards, forwards. Okay, does she have a beamer? She does not. They have a background player, though. Keep in mind. Ugh, not quite. On the hook. Excellent, dude. There we go. Nice. Okay, let's go for one stab on Zarina. That is the 3K. But I don't know. I, I mean, either that or she just kind of preemptively left anyway. Blood Warden. Oh, yes. The single greatest perk in the game. Stick one of those down because we have infinite traps. To be fair, she could just get like a lucky um, hatch spawn just randomly in the middle of like a filler tile. What are the chances? No, 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 fuck you. <laughs> oh my God. Oh, she almost had that. That's awful. My heart, dude. Oh my God. Okay, get on the hook. Get on the hook. There you go. Oh. Ping difference? Yeah, Jesus Christ. That was way too close. Bring it back to a 3K is not bad though. I'm going to say that was a pretty decent success. A nice comeback. Thank you, Robbie. Thank you. I try my best. Uh, Blood Warden is like your mum when you want to go hang out with your friends. <laughs> I'm sorry to hear that, dude. And at your pixel, it's so good to see you, dude. Eight months. Yo, yo, hello, Lilith. Happy eight months. Hope to see you well and spicing as always. Also, have you played Dark Souls 3 before? Uh, Dark Souls 3, no. I mean, kind of. I remember buying it. Um, was that on the Xbox 360, I think? I, it's been a long time. Um, also, okay, chat. Uh, I'm not sure if mods have any list of the builds. There was something... Was Blight up next? Okay, gotcha, gotcha. There was something, and then there was also an Oni as well. Uh, someone gifted some subs. I'm trying to remember. But uh, Pixel thing for the eight months. Uh, I have played the beginning of Dark Souls 3. I played the first one to its entirety. I've also, uh, I, I, I do have, fuck, dude, there, 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 there are so many games, though, is the problem. I haven't played Elden Ring. I haven't played Demon Souls. I have started Bloodborne, but I haven't got very far, because the frame rate sucks. With the Myers. That's the one. Thank you. So that's the one, dude. Uh, also, Anagril, thank you. That was uh, brutal. I feel like I lost many years of my life to stress in that match, but, but we got the 3K, and that's what counts. Uh, Elden Ring is so worth deep diving into. That, that's what I've heard. Um, I've heard that Elden Ring, as well as uh, Liza P and Sekiro, are all like really worth trying. Um, I just have another time for it is the problem. It's a BP. Okay, give me a sec, dude. Hold up. Uh, Block 1 is goated. Uh, the frame rate kind of disappears when you have fun, which is fair. And to be honest, it doesn't seem like the kind of game that relies on having like a clean 60. It does just feel a bit weird. I'm so used to, like, you know, 60 minimum. Uh, yo, Kiko, it's good to see you, by the way, man. You're Dark Souls 3, enjoy. Also, good morning. Good morning. Hope it's the ball, dude. Scratch Mario with Rapid Brutal Surge Devour. Cool. And then after that's Oni, right? I think. Also, chat, can we all just, like, appreciate how goddamn handsome Tut is, dude? It's insane. I just wanted Scratch Mirror, which is, uh... B -b 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 scratched with... Boyfriend's memo, I guess. Also, rapid brutal surge devour. Okay. I can't guarantee this is gonna work. I don't really play Scratch Mirror Myers, but I can give it a try. Uh, what was the next one? Uh Surge. And Brutal, right? Okay. And I kind of feel like uh map offerings are pretty necessary here, so probably Larry's or Midwitch. I don't know, would you guys say that Larry's is, like, objectively a better map for Scratch Mirror Myers than Midwitch is? Midwitch has the hallways, I guess, which is the problem, right? It's pretty long. 
Uh, Larry's is better for the gown. I do agree, for sure. We are wearing, uh, you know, the naked Myers gown, for sure. Uh, is it possible that we'll never see Pocos again after the Blight nerf? Uh, no, no, no. So, so I mean, Pocos and Flix are going to be as strong, if not, you know, even more prevalent after the patch. Um, because you're going to be, you know, going to be swinging at more crazy stuff. It's more so just the Hug Techs, the Moon Rushes, Lilith Techs, V1s, and so on that aren't really going to be as prevalent. Also, dude, check out that username, man. Traumatized Ravioli. <laughs> I would love to know what inspired you to choose that name. That is genius. Uh, Midwitch has the two long hallways. Larry's is good for hiding. That makes sense, for sure. For sure. I guess, like, Larry's is a little bit more um, random in, like, the door and, like, uh, room placements as well. Whereas uh, Midwitch... Midwitch doesn't have a whole lot of RNG, and also the rooms are pretty long, right? And the doors are pretty far away. If it's bad for Nurse, it's good for Myers. I, I will keep that in mind, dude. Cheers. Also, wait, yo, Quantum Slayer, hello, dude, what a sick username. Although, if any videos you'll be playing uh, Nerf Blight in the P2P, yes. Uh, I mean, I'm going to be releasing a video. Um, I I'm, I'm not going to tell you exactly what the video is going to be about, but I've kind of changed the direction of, like, what I'm going to be talking about. Of course, I'm going to be addressing Blight and the Hugsack and everything like, like that, but I'm going to discuss more, like, my thoughts on DVD as a whole in that video. Okay, so keep in mind, I haven't played Scratch Mirror Myers in probably a year or so, I would say. And uh, yo, Yara, three months, dude. Thank you so much, man. Lilith and in Blight love. Much love to many, many more. I hope you're doing fantastic. Oh, hold on. Nancy Wheeler acquired. Did you see me? Probably not here. Okay, we're going to try and get the first jump scare, working on the gin. Yo, yo, yo! <laughs> Almost a grab. I wish they made Maya's uh, butt hang out the back of the, the, uh, the gown. I completely agree. Sweet. Wait, so what's the total speed? Um, of Scratch Mirror Myers Tier 1 with Rapid. Still not that fast, right? Oh, you don't agree? Oh. <laughs> Cheers for that one. That's what I recommended. If you don't want to, like, lose the hug tech, just don't update the game. Just keep the game running forever. Uh, thank you, Rabbits. You were too kind with a 10 months, almost a full year. I agree with myself. <laughs> I have the best takes imaginable. For the part now? Yeah, cool. On the blinds. Is it 105? Gotcha, okay. I guess we don't get to keep it very long, though, is the problem. A possible Windows user here, I think. Uh, bro, you cannot chase one person with a build. I really want to get Nancy down, though, is the problem. I really want to try it. Oh, Steve. Hold up. He's thinking about it. He's thinking about it. That guy might see me there, maybe. Hold up. He's coming in. Yo, gamer! <laughs> Sick. All right, two gens down already. It's, I mean, DVD in 2024. Can't really do much there. This guy's running back in through main. Hmm. I think we get that, though. I think that's fine. Come on, come on, come on. Ooh. Oh, come on! That's so close! They just love gen rushing. That is survivors in a nutshell, man. That's true. Okay, he's got another pallet here. Hmm. 
Uh, what an interesting play by Steve. I totally agree. Two gens. Fuck, dude. Uh, maybe I can go back around here. Maybe I can grab this guy. I gotta break the pallet as well, man. Yo, Steve. Yo, we got the grab. That's huge. Excellent. Cool, cool, cool. Nice big stat for you. Back when playing nerd. I'm gonna start studying for tonight, so you can pay more attention now. Well, dude, welcome in. Hope the studying went well. Hold up, hold up, champ. We can do this. There he is. I think I should also break this. <laughs> Budget agitation. Oh yes. Um, buddy, I'm <laughs> I'm running that one add-on that lets me uh, see through walls. And uh, yo, Nikki, yo, thank you for two months, dude. You are my fire, the one desire. Believe when I say you want it that way. Uh, tell me why. Oh. Come on, dude, that's so close. And they got the unhook. Oh, shit, this is all, this is all going to hell, man. This is a shambles. Uh, mm, I love X-ray diffraction. There's nothing better. Is that light, or is that just normal speed and I'm losing the ability to tell how fast the survivor should be running? Ah! Excellent, huge. Bit of our... Nah, the problem is they're all kind of like loitering around the same gen. Background player Nancy. Attempt. The pressure. I'm trying, dude. Okay, here's the plan. So... Can ah! be a slow... Yeah, but like... I think the problem is, is that, like, this, compared to my normal gameplay as Blight, is it, it couldn't be more of a polar opposite if we tried, right? Blight runs at 2.30, and this guy runs at, like, 4. Okay, well, talking about de uh, Devour Snacks, there goes that opportunity. Uh, cool. Oh, come on. It's so close. He makes that. That's a fake hit. I think that's a hit. I think that's a hit. Way nice. Hold on. That's a down. Yo, that's fantastic. And Surge. Excellent. And at your Lachlan. 25. Oh, fuck me, dude. 25 streams in a row. Thank you, man. Well, incredible. It is Fridays, my dude. It is indeed. Is anyone going to be uh, ordering pizzas and or cracking beers tonight? I'm sad because I forgot to uh, grab any beers. A uh, slow and can't gain bloodlust, though, which makes rapid not a terrible option. But play with your food is uh, so much more important for consistency. Just fair. However, I also feel like, I mean, Brutal and Surge are also pretty useful. Perhaps some pizza? You should go for it, Zoe. Treat yourself. Ah! Excellent. Second before I disappear into the shadow. And it you his. Have a great day, everyone. No, 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 Nancy. <laughs> fuck you, dude. Uh, his thank you for two years in a row. You are incredible, and I really hope you're doing great. I hope the drumming is uh, also going well, and to many, many more. Thank you, Hiz. I miss you, dude. If you're not being, not keeping yourself too busy. I kind of feel like Nowhere instead of Vow may have been a good choice here, maybe. That's pretty good. Uh, no search from what I can tell, but that's fine. The background player, no beamer save. A fair point, I guess. Trying to optimize Scratch and Remise like playing a uh, clown and comp. You're honestly not wrong, man. You're kind of doomed from the get-go. Is anyone on Deathhook here? Maybe one of the Steves? Let's see. And then your Blights. Welcome back, dude. That's fine, that's okay. Everyone's injured, that's really, really good. That's even better, Surge. Wait, 
Oh, fuck. I've never actually seen the gen block before. Is that fully blocked now? From Surge? Uh... Interesting. No, it, it, it's almost fully blocked, though. I, I've never once seen that happen. The double flashlight. Yeah, these guys are going to be backgrounding my player. Like halfway. Good to know. Cool. I guess that tells you just how often I uh, kick gens. Get off that gen, you nerd. Get off that gen. Oh, shit. Uh, if he stays close enough, I can maybe surge the gen again. So close. Can we catch that? Oh, I feel like we probably can't here, actually. Shit. On here, it's pretty close, though. Let's check on the Steve again. He's running. I thought the gen just blew. Uh, I didn't know a weird molten spice came out. Yeah, it's one of the new features to stop you from, like, three genning. The gens have, like, a maximum amount of, like, regression events now. Yeah, dead hard, right? Yep. Ah! Yo, we get Surge again. <laughs> please, no background player. Please, fuck. Oh, oh my god. And, uh, yo, Peach, it's good to see you, dude. Hello. Yeah, let's go for the second blind, because uh, why the fuck not, dude? Yeah, I guess we just uh, run back into the main room again, because they're back on it again. Steve? Don't do it. Don't do it. Uh, what does he have here? Hold on. I feel like we're fine, actually. That's good. Ah! And surge yet again. That's got to be, like, almost there, right? Is that still not blocked? Dude, that's insane. It's still going. Steve wants the heat, apparently, man. Yeah. That gen's so fucking close, though, dude. I don't know if we can get it in time, but maybe if we can hook in the main room. Oh, no, still regressing. Nice. Uh, six out of eight. Ah! This one down. Excellent. It does look like they are going to be attempting that gen again, though. Shit myself, Steve. Nice. Uh, Knight is going to jump back on it for sure. If they're thrown pretty hard. I'm not sure why they aren't focusing that gen in the corner. If they had one person on that gen the whole time, they'd, they'd be out by now. Ah! Shit. Maybe we can get it, like, one more time here. Let's see. If we can get, like, one more surge in that gen, that'd be wonderful. Yo. <laughs> Yo! <laughs> that poor Jen has been absolutely fucked this game. Oh my god. Did I use it? Yeah, exactly, man, for sure. So, but it looks super cool. It's pretty fun, actually. Dude, he's back on it again? Why aren't you on the other gens, dude? I'm so confused. I think we might actually win this match. I'm hoping that, like, Nicolas Cage has some common sense here and, like, sticks the other one. I presume that's why we've not seen him in like 50 years. Ah! Huge game. That wasn't within surge distance, but I think maybe we're fine here. Let's see. Oh, what's been his last scratch Mirror Myers? Um, he's like, he's like 97, isn't he? Or like 103 or something? I can't remember. He's not that fast. I think he's, like, moderately faster than the average survivor. But also, like, survivors have smaller hitboxes so they can loop things tighter, right? 105. Yeah, that's the one. But, like, since survivors have that, like, smaller hitbox, 
I mean, around tiles, you typically can't really change them as such. No way can I search that gen again, man. That'd be wonderful. Uh, 105 or 4.2. I see. Gotcha. Okay, okay. No way. Oh my god. Nancy! I think they may have actually thrown the game for the sake of that one gen. Bro, she is shit in her pants. This is fantastic. Hold on. I'm gonna see if I can jump scare her. Is she slow vaulting? She probably presumes that I'm chasing the other guy right now. Hold on, there's no way. Hold on. Really carefully. Just uh, come through here. <laughs> Yo, gamers! Excellent. Uh, mine is a 105 or 4.2 in tier 1. That makes sense. Thank you, Turns. I can't believe we've won this. That's crazy. Okay, we have to go for like one more pen shitting moment on this guy. Hold on. Almost, dude. And at your locally. Thank you, man. I tried my best. I uh, don't really want to be chasing him in the corridors, though, to be honest. What's window? Excellent. Thing is, he does have the advantage finding a hatch here before I do. Oh, come on, dude, they're so close! Crucial, come on, keep going, keep going! Hold on. <gasps> Yo, 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 let's fucking go, man, and we get the hatch, excellent, there he is, yo, what's going on, nerd, he's gonna W key, oh, for sure, man, he doesn't survive, though, what's window, ignores window, big panic, chance, I can't believe it, but by some miracle, um, we have been blessed with a 4K, uh, Scratch Mary Myers, that I haven't played in years. That's insane. Pog Champion, thank you, Fergus. GG, I, I can't believe we won there. I mean, we had, what, like, one hook per three gens being completed at the beginning? Giga Myers, I mean, he's so strong, dude, right? It, it, it's, it's kind of funny, because it, it seems from our side like we're doing... Like, like the survivors are making so many mistakes, but realistically, they have no idea whether I'm leaving to go and chase someone else or just standing there waiting for them to move, right? But they have no idea. And so if anything, like, I, 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 I could realistically be on the other side of the map and they could be mind gaming themselves in a corner, you know, shit in their pants thinking, like, is he there, you know? Alright, jeez, what do we have? We had Dead Hard with DS Windows main for this. Okay, uh, hyperfocus, wiretap, stakeout, wiretap. Okay, nerds. Jeez. Uh, what do you mean I haven't played DVD in four months? Have you not? Have you not streamed in four months? Hold on. Nah, that's not true. So, uh, Blight Build, thank you, sir. You are incredible. Uh, Plaything, Lullaby, Pentimenta, Barbecue, Soul Chemical, Alkring. Thank you, thank you. The Alkring check. Also, I shouldn't be doing it on Devour. Alkring, Soul Chemical with Plaything. Uh, real life too busy. I totally understand, man. Absolutely. Let's see. Uh, Plaything. You also wanted Pentimento. Barbecue. And the last one was Lullaby, right? Sweet. And uh, you're Speedy Gonzalez. Welcome to the channel, dude. Hello. Uh, did I enjoy Omrio, by the way? Uh, the one earlier? Um, yeah, I mean, she was pretty fun. Um, she didn't let me put the tape in the TV, which I'm going to give, like, minus marks for. But it was pretty good. Uh, yo, Remus, it's been a while, man. Uh, what is Hellraiser's favorite website? Oh, God. Um, Hellraiser's favorite website? I don't know. Pinterest, bro. <laughs> oh, I don't know whether I should laugh or cry. That's pretty awful. That's also pretty good. I'm, I'm going to give that one a pass. I don't know. If, if you had to summarize the last year of DVD in one word, what would it be? For the last year? That's a good question. 
I mean, okay, so like what's happened in the last year of DBD? Um, they fucked up Light's add-ons, but also made them the best they've ever been somehow. Um, I mean, they haven't nerfed the Hugtech yet. I'm trying to think. I mean, what killers have released in the past year? We had uh, The Unknown. We had Chucky. Was Xeno a year ago, I think? Yeah, Xeno still counts. Singularity was last year, kind of. I'm, I'm, I'm honestly not sure what word I would use to summarize the video. Uh, confusing and weird. Sweet. Uh, yo, man, when will I change the background songs? Uh, it's been the same for years. That is true, but they're pretty iconic, man. It's like the signature Lilithoman soundtrack, you know? Alrighty. Zenith was August? I see. Um, I'm not sure what word I would use. Uh, yeah, perplexing, maybe. And dead. Uh, with no woo unthinkable. That's what I'm saying, right? At the very least, I feel like that song has to stay. It's it's become a a, 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 a pretty vital part of the Little Thurman experience. Don't change the woo song. Exactly. The old gamers, is that Legacy? Yeah. Legacy Chiso Cord. Remix the song with 200% more woo. I know that I'm... Um, Singular remixed the song for me, but without the woo. <laughs> uh, woo was as iconic as Blixel. You don't mess with genius. I completely agree, man, for sure. Yeah, I'm the hook for you. I guess the concept here is uh, skill checks with both Huntress and um, Soul Chemical. Also the delayed weird rush thing with our Alk Ring. Someone's here. So close, dude, almost. Now, if we had double Eerie, that would have been a guaranteed hit. Uh, by the way, Lilith, when you have a second, Blixel... Oh, there was a Blixel tree. Of course, dude. Yes. Uh, hello? Well played. I thought I should uh, turn around the tree. Close. I'll let it. Do I not think the double area is perhaps a bit too busted? Oh, it probably is, but it's also really, really fun. So uh, unless it gets nerfed, I'm going to continue playing with it. It's pretty sick. The wiggle, yeah. Ah! Yeah. I mean, credit where it's due, the Nia's playing pretty well so far. Probably the uh, strongest chase in the game. Uh, yo, Worm, uh, do I think that someone would do that? Load up the game and cheat. Uh, do cheating in, in my Dead Daylight? In the in God's year of 2024? No way, man. Um, I could always play main building. I'd rather go over here. Now, the only cheats that I'm interested in are the cheats you download from uh, omenhacks.net. One stop shop for all of your flicking needs. Well, I just went against the Blight that said that uh, Blight is hot on trash with our double eerie add ons. See, the, the, the funny thing about that is do you not feel like that's kind of projecting? It's like, well, I can't win. <laughs> I can't win with double eerie. Or uh, without double area, so clearly, he's really bad. I feel like that Blight may have just outed himself as being really bad at the game. That's embarrassing. Fair enough, another pallet down. Oh, where the copium is smelling? Dude, exactly. Okay, she's not so much reacting to what I'm doing here, that's fair. Just bump logic. Yes. Dude, they're cleansing everything, which is great. So that's, uh, what, one, two, three pentimento so far? 
It's huge. I was going to say, keep in mind that she's running um, Legacy. So the chances of a dead hard are significantly higher. This is significantly higher. Uh, Black feels so slow with that retank. He does, man. The extra 20% does make a big difference. Uh, Black ate it now? Nah, dude, not a chance. I've heard a ton of people saying that. Saying like, oh man, I played him in the PTP. And he's like, eight here now. And I'm seriously wondering uh, where that opinion is coming from. Because clearly those people are quite new to Blight. Uh, isn't Blight the least killer to need add-ons? I would say so, yeah. I think Blight really doesn't need any add-ons to do well. Unlike most other ones. Hits. Uh, a lot of injury pressure going on here. And again. I don't know if I legit got recommended a YouTube channel that was just a cheater and their cheater friends posting shorts. That sounds wonderful, dude. That's really cool. <laughs> Ultra Turbo by Tesco. Dude, Ben, I picked up the sickest things from Tesco the other day. Let's see if I can pull off some bump logic. Perfect, man. Nice. Uh, how do I feel about Double Eerie Blades? I think it's, it, it, it is incredibly strong. I would be insane to tell you that it's not very, very strong, if not busted. Um, but it's also really fun is the problem. Okay, not panicking. The knee is really good, man. She's paying attention. What you got, Tesco? Bro, I bought some of those, like, fucking... Oh, nice, that hard. <laughs> those uh, mirror placements, but in, like, chocolate form. It's sick, dude. A dead art? No way did a survivor in 2024 actually press the E button. Uh, fun and busted? Say less. I mean, <laughs> it is just the greatest combo the Blight's ever had. Looks a treat. Of course, dude. Yeah, as soon as I've uh, got a bit more pressure rolling, I'll see what I can do. One here. Hmm. Perfect flick, nice. Um, that's a sprint burst. Did she just, like, not sprint at all when I was, like, halfway through flicking through her skull? That's really weird. Oh, what killer was this? This is the Skull Merchants. She puts down drones, and she's really fun and cool. Oh, and of course they have adrenaline. Okay, dude. Also, I realized I probably should have put up some Pentimento. I was hoping I'd get to five there. Hmm, we're going to need some altruism if we're going to bring this one back, for sure. Let's see, that door's likely being worked on. That's fine. Blocky, dude. Close. And not enough angle there. She did use the dead heart, though, which is good. What is her plaything? Oh, is she? Nice. Say we'll just jump. She did, yeah. Down. Uh, here's the problem. We can't really hook her. Because otherwise they will just leave. She's a death hook. Um, is there anyone else that we can go for? The doors are really close. I kind of want to see if we can use some altruism here. He was using. Oh, she was playing very, very well. Yeah, the knee is sick. Is she crawling? Hmm. If I had Blood Warden, this would be fantastic right now, man. Uh, Alan Wake is going to shit his pants. I don't think that he's going to come back in for a save, but maybe. Thankfully, she isn't really crawling, though, which is good. And at your Demi, I've missed you, dude. Welcome in. It is indeed the Blight guy doing the funny Blight thing. Wait. Wait, 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 huh? Wait, how did he tank a hit? Wait, what's going on? Wait, nah, 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 nah. Could that have been dead hard? Buckle up? Oh, no, you're probably right, man. Yeah, probably was. That's really cool. MFT, maybe? Hmm. If I pick them up, do you think they shit themselves like I got Blood Warden? 
Let's see. There's one more thing we can try here. But yeah, I guess maybe these guys don't have the balls to come back inside. Let's see. Drop. Nah, dude, not a chance. Okay. We're going to go for backup plan numero uh, two, I guess. We're going to drop her. We want to try and convince the claw to come back inside a little bit. Okay, Fatiga. Excellent. She runs the opposite direction. Claude is not going to follow, man. That's a shame. Yeah, I mean, we could have tried it maybe if we had like slightly more altruistic survivors. Who knows at this point? I don't think anyone does, man. You see a survivor take a hit. No! No! <laughs> no! Why does the hatch always spawn by the last survivor? Fuck! That's what I get for trying to trying to altruism my way to a 4k geez dude what played oh man okay so i to be fair i may have fucked up your build i forgot to use the perks <laughs> but i uh, thank you for the, for the uh, redemption man that is very very kind okay so what is up next in the list of things that we're going to be playing today uh so do i miss j flicking yes i do uh j flicking was like the coolest thing that blight ever had and it makes me very sad to this very day Hatch spawns today, dude, every time. Like, like one survivor remaining, it will just spawn at their feet. Oh, so wait, Oni? Okay, hold up. Can do, can do. Do on top knot and crutch. Oh, shit. Uh, I've got the crutch. I do not have the top up. Uh, to hold on, top up. <laughs> I can find the top knot. There we go. Uh, put that off and on. Wanted lethal, pain res, floods, and agi. Cool lethal there's pain res uh floods of rage and agitation just page one sick uh catch my balls yeah <laughs> uh j flick blight was the most balanced blight minus outcring which dude, the funniest thing is is that, like j flick blight um back in the day considering the fact that his pov was so short like even with the outcring is significantly more balanced than what we have today right like keep in mind as well and i i i can't I, I genuinely can't think as to how many times i've explained this before but like blight with the j flick could not correct his rush so if like there was a car and you wanted to 180 a survivor there like you had to get the perfect angle and hope that they continue running if they decide to just go here or here or just run a slightly different direction you would never hit them and then 4.7 came around and they were like oh well, well you know we've we've ostensibly removed the j flick but also now you can correct it so he's actually stronger than he was with the j flick anyway it's so bizarre dude it's almost as if you know may, maybe this is like a tinfoil hat moment but it's almost as if the devs don't know what they're doing <laughs> And then, yo, Simon, hold on, man. Let me ready up. It's good to see you, dude. Uh, bro, I just had a scream. Keep dropping me and not putting me on the hook. Uh, by scream, do you mean ghost face? See, I do that sometimes because sometimes the survivors smell really bad and I can't keep them, like, on my shoulder, uh, like, close to my nose for too long. Especially Steve's and Ada's. They smell really, really bad. What? That, now that's a, that, 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 that's a cap? No, it, totally true, man. Totally. Right back in the day, like, the J flick couldn't be updated. And so if, you know, as soon as 4.7 came around, you could... Also, the Blixel Hungus, you are correct. I'm sorry, man. Hold on. Oh, shit. There's some pizza. Enjoy. Yeah, as, as soon as you flicked, you had to go in that one direction. When 4.7 came around, you could flick 180. Be like, nah, actually, that guy's trying to dodge me. Correct at 90, you know? And now it's even stronger because considering that we have add-ons like um, Irate Tag that increase your look angle... You can, I mean, effectively correct it like 90 to 120 degrees. Uh, nah, ain't no way the devs don't know what they're talking about. They def do, especially when it comes to FOMO. Oh, <laughs> oh absolutely, man. Also, did they remove hug text? Not yet, but there is a good chance in the next update they might do. It's hard to say, but maybe. Okay, so, uh, also, Athlete, it's great to see you, man. Uh, Gideon on Oni. Um, is that a good combo? I feel like this isn't the worst map in the game. Unless they pre-throw everything, in which case we might be fucked. My distortion? I thought so. I thought that I, I'm pretty sure they were hiding behind something. I think I saw four.
Oh, fuck. Okay. Um. Right. This might not be the best person to chase right now. I just not the pallet immediately. That's good. Let's fake it. Where's the pallet? I mean, getting these out of the way quickly is not the worst thing ever. And, uh, yo, athlete, thank you for five months, man. Turbo only gameplay. Oh, absolutely, man. Juice in these gamers. You gonna follow that one? Cool. Thanks for the resub dudes and many, many more. The window. I'm just gonna pretend that I'm not interested. She's gonna hold W anyway. Blood lost one. That's a hit. That's why I use Brutal. Yeah, Brutal Enduring. All right, even Spirit Fury on only works pretty well. Is that enough? Oh, come on, dude. So close. It's another pallet down, though. More blood. Almost power. I'm going to see if there's someone else in main that we can go for. These gens are pretty close. Yo, Steve! You've made a fundamental blunder. You fucked up big time. Nice. I right, could get that blood, King. I'm trying, man. I'm slurping up, dude. Give me the blood. Right, the sad truth is that Sky Blight is not going to be the new thing instead of Hug Tanks. If, if, I mean, honestly, if they wanted to get rid of uh, Oh, fuck, Gamma. That's why you uh, look at the screen sometimes. If they were to, like, bring back Sky Blight, I keep uh, Hug Tech on, I wouldn't mind too much, honestly. Yo, let's fucking go. Hold on. Hold on, chat. We're on fire, dude. So he runs back upstairs. That's another one down. Nice. I'm uh, going to save the blood here. Also, Steve DCs. <laughs> Excellent. Flying Oni Tech. Oh, yes. All those struck in the book. Are they actually giving up? What are you doing? You guys had some really good pressure there. The only dunk is crazy. It's really fun, man. Doing it with Blight's even more fun because you can make it over the jump as well. And then, yo, Zelcro, welcome in, dude. Are they actually giving up? Dude, that, that, that was just getting so sick. I guess maybe if you, like, dunk on them too hard. And then she delis. That's really cool. Okay. Hold on. Genius idea. What if I just ignore Ada for the rest of the match? <laughs> that might work pretty well. Yeah, sorry, buddy, old pal. I'm going this way. There we go. Sick. Cheers. If you could uh, step out of the way real quick. If you could just... Uh... There we go. Nice. All right, giving up on a survivor side of map. I don't know, dude. Against Oni? On Gideon? I'm confused. Uh, what did Steve quit? I don't get people sometimes. It's false. He did not go the way I go to heal. I, the, the honest answer is that I don't know, man. Survivors are bizarre. I don't think modern science has progressed enough to know what is going on inside the average survivor main's head. Wait. 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 How? Oh, well, how? Wait, huh? Can someone clip that? How the fuck did I tank that? They blinded me and threw the pallet, and I still had him on my back. <laughs> Wait, what? I, I, I am perplexed. I am confused. Oni just build different. I mean, to be fair, like canonically, it would make sense that Oni wouldn't really be too fast about a plank of wood. But like, Oni is the juggernaut. Dude, this, this is the true Bordeaux of killer. This is. Oh, wait. It had the sound effect, though. It definitely stunned me, right? The pallet stunned me, and she also got the blind. Clearly within time. How was that possible? <laughs> this is the juggernaut, bitch. Close. Let's see, you running over here? Close, almost there. Uh, you are the only... There we go. Nice. I thank you for answers and contributing to my research. Of course, dude. Always happy to help. Is the tank, bro? 
I've never seen anything like that. It's one thing to fumble a beamer save, right? You know, like, on, on the embarrassment scale, probably like a solid seven, you know, especially with background player. But, like, to fumble the beamer save and the pallet save at the same time is quite impressive. Oh, is that double speed? Uh, no, it's single speed, as well as the top knot, which allows us to um, charge quicker, I guess. Okay, well, she's dead. I guess we go find the hatch. And if my calculations are correct, I think the hatch is going to spawn right... Uh, right here, I think. Maybe not. Let's see. Let's go check the edge map. Might be in here. It is not. Is it in the ice room? It is not. Is it in the corner? I hear a gamer. Never mind. <laughs> what was that match, dude? I can't play only without the scap top knot. Did you play with the original? Like the 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 uh the, the version of it before the nerf? Because that was insane. Sniped, you have absolutely annihilated. Uh, someone pallet stunned you with Oni, and you swung after and down the survivor mid stun animation. What is, is is it Oni? Is he specifically bugged? I don't know, dude. It's so weird. Uh, is it possible that they happened at the same time? So the code said, "I have no idea." Fuck it. <laughs> uh, possibly. Bro, and the builds as well, man. Right? Like, so we had double Delhi, adrenaline times one. Dead Hard, DS, Unbreakable, Stimtic. Need to start dodging consoles. Honestly, uh, solid plan. Jesus, uh, GG's. And they still gave up to that man? I don't know if you are my entertainment for my dinner, uh, congrats. Okay, important question though, what are you having for dinner? Okay, so next up is Blaints, I think. Uh, I'm not sure how many are still in queue currently. Uh, how did they manage to dodge this? I don't know, man. I genuinely have no idea. Uh, is it the old swing that stun immunity? I, I can't imagine so, unless it's like a very, very recent thing, because it doesn't happen with Blight, or at least... I mean, it might not be an only specific issue. Maybe that was just weird timing, where they both stunned me at the exact same time, and like um, uh, uh, Chase Face mentioned, maybe it just didn't know what to do. And, uh, Yoke Fist, hello, man. It's great to see you, buddy. Uh, top hat with, uh, N Fury, Infection... Wait, sorry. Oh, okay, hold on. I, I, I read that as Infection. I was like, wait, hold on. <laughs> I would rather not run with an Infection. Infectious, Deathbound, N Fury. Cool. Bum, 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 bum. The day that Enduring is no longer second page, I'm gonna cry, dude. Let's see, Spirit Fury. Wait, hold on. No, fucked it. With double speed, right? Standard double speed and a top amp. Uh, what have we got? Maybe that one. Uh, there with the classic mangled tail coats and also the mechanical staff. Pretty good combo. Other than what build did I recommend for Blight starters? Lethal, barbecue, jolt, and pain rinse. Uh, no, 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 no. I wouldn't recommend jolts, especially because that would uh, imply that you're M1ing people, which, especially if you're learning Blights, you shouldn't ever be doing. Um,. Also, Pain Res, it, it, it's a good perk, but it does take away from you doing the Blight thing. Um, my my number one recommended build is Lethal, Barbecue, Deadlock, and Grim, because it gives you gen prevention. It slows down the game without you needing to actively go out of your way to do something, right? Like, for example, Pop. You know, you down someone, you hook them, but now instead of going and chasing someone and learning Blight, you are finding a gen and kicking it, right? Which might only be 15 seconds, but 15 seconds over, you know, 50 games does start to add up in time that you could be learning Blight, you know? Also, uh, yo, Robbie, uh, we love the Blight. We do indeed. This guy is handsome as fuck, especially when he's dancing the Macarena, man. Uh, also, Gigaben has, um, hold on, drank 2.2 liters of water. Uh, how has your bladder not exploded yet? I don't know. But I feel like you can drink more than 2.2 liters at a time, right? I'm, I'm not recommending it, but I, I don't feel like that's, like, toxic levels of, of water in one go. I feel like if you were, like, 5 liters in, you, you probably want to, you know, get that checked out, man. 
I feel like the goal of the PvP changes was to get more people to run more add-ons than just double eerie. No, but th th that's the problem though. Is like, if anything, um, after the update, more people are going to be running double eerie than they are currently because you can't hug tech. So why bother running slam duration or anything else that could maybe assist in their playstyle, right? Just go for bump logic and flicks, which is what double eerie does best. Okay, wait, was that a map offering? No. Okay, random Irie. See, so your game is over here. Nope. Uh, hello, is it still possible to do a 180 flick as Oni? I haven't been able to learn it. I just want to know if it's just me having a skill issue or not. Uh, yo, I said, welcome to the stream. Uh, you can indeed, yes. Um, it's a little bit tricky. It requires some specific muscle memory, but it is still possible. Gamer spotted. Oh, hey, my partner left your stream on, so came on to say hi. Yo, no kidding. Hello, it's great to meet you. Uh, Cosmic Mistakes partner. Hello, welcome to the stream. Hey, I hope you're prepared for the spiciest blood gameplay of all time. Let's see. Could be someone to the right. Uh, nope. I uh, think for asking the question. Of course, I said. If you have any questions, man, uh, I will always try my best to answer. Just always remember, there is no such thing as a stupid question. Only stupid answers from me. Uh, your voice is oddly satisfying. Um, I will take that as a positive thing. Uh, thank you, Yuna. Welcome to the stream. It's like, hmm. Weirdly enough, your voice is bizarre and grating, and your accent is weird, but I kind of like it. <laughs> thank you. Fair enough. Now, you're Meister. I'm not sure what that means, man, but thanks to 14 months in a row uh, of Prime, by the way. That's so kind of you, and so many, many more. What are you doing? Kate Denson, what are you doing? Why did you not run towards the pallet? Uh, why did the Debedalet survivor bring a ladder to the trial? Because they heard it was a killer way to escape. <laughs> oh. That's pretty bad, but also I quite like it, man. Uh, 10 points. Let's break that bad boy. Uh, hello, Mr. Blight guy. That is me. I am the guy often referred to as Mr. Blight. Hello. Uh, my voice is oddly overpowered. Please nerve. Over is, is it too loud? Oh, shit. Boys, to get this map doesn't really have any collision. Uh, we can go long here, and then here, then all the way to the back. Oh, dude, I should have flecked, man. I didn't know the same ward would be right there, to be completely honest. I uh, know the audio levels are fine. Thank you. Glad to hear. Okay, well, there's Kate. I'm uh, really sorry, buddy. I promise I'm not trying to tunnel. But, uh, your teammates were kind of AWOL. Uh, Kate is Greek, is she? Are you sure? I could have sworn that Kate was supposed to be like the all super, like, turbo American character, right? Little did I do the voice acting for Blight? Please confirm. I did, and I am going to be playing Blight in the new upcoming DVD movie. Yes, that is correct. Yeah, for American? I don't think she's Greek, is she? Also, I can't find anyone, chat. This is not good. I think we might lose on the basis that I just can't find any gamers. Never mind, found them. He's American. She's from the deep south, I see, not the shallow south. Wait. Where did she go? Wait, huh? Hold on. Uh, apparently she went that way. I didn't see any pallets, uh, any scratch marks or anything. Over the pallet, weird. I think they mean the person playing Kate is Greek. Oh, I see. Okay, that makes sense. Fair enough. So close, dude. Almost. And, uh, yo, nobody. Hello. Lucky break? I don't think so. I mean, she was still leaving blood. There we 
we go, nice. Okay, keep in mind there is someone in the main building. Uh, we, dude, these chases are not short enough, man. We gotta find people. We can't let a team win on the basis that they're just really good at hiding. A Kratos Denson, yeah. <laughs> Uh, Chip. Uh, the insane blight podcast flick montage is here. You are correct. Yes, six hours of podcast flick montage at your service. Uh, it doesn't fall to her doom. That's kind of cool. Uh, what does my go-to blight build? Like my my personal one is a uh, double eerie, and nothing else. Um, I'm not super fond of running perks. Okay, that's huge. Having a kill here is maybe what we need to win this. It's Michaela. Does she seem really slow? Or am I going insane? Maybe I'm so used to playing Blight, you know, whilst in Rush that, like, a survivor moving normally is, like, a weird thing now. Hey, I can't tell if you gaslight him with the no perks. No, 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 like, like seriously. Like, my go-to build is double E and nothing else. Um, back in the day, I mean, for the past three and a half years or so, I played with Shadowborn Barbecue. Um, and then they changed Barbecue. No, sorry, um, Shadowborn. And I was like, well, I mean, if I don't, if I'm not going to run Shadowborn, I may as well run nothing. Cheers. Uh, Survive with speed hack seems normal to you. That is also true. I am not uh, famous for paying that much attention. Yes. I told my streamer friend I was going to raid him, so I called the SWAT team to raid his house. Please don't actually do this. Yeah, do not do that, man. That is illegal and also, like, the worst thing imaginable. Bad idea. Also, same here. Twice. Uh, has barbecue changed at all? Uh, not for a while. Um, I'm trying to think. So, to my memory, I think there were two changes to barbecue. The first one was, um, originally it would give you double points. Um, for each survivor that you hooks, so it'd give you 25% per survivor. Um, that was removed, I think, about three years ago or so-ish. Um, and I think they also changed it so that, like, the auras of the survivors, uh, appear at a different point. Right? So instead of appearing immediately, it's, like, delayed or the other way around. I can't remember. Hmm. Oh, shit. Yep, very cool. Nice one, game. And, uh, yo, Demetrio, hello. Yeah, well, she's holding W. Um, did that chin have any progress? Fair enough. A uh, precise collision. Yep, yeah, you'd love to see it, man. Oh, shit, but that one has collision. Fuck me, dude. <laughs> <laughs> nice and reliable. Jeez. Uh, how the hell is in the P2B? Um, I mean, better. It, it works now. You can bump into them. But, um, they're also quite sticky. It's quite hard to not collide with them now, you know? Oh, shit. Hold on. That ain't good. Let's see what's, uh, what's happening over here. So the two doors are kind of far away. Uh, that one has no survivors yet. This one, I think, also has no survivors. Unless they were early. So I think best thing we can do is try and, uh, defend this survivor on the hook for a second. And then try and take out whoever's going towards those doors. Because you can't, um, self Kobe with the anti camp anymore. Let's see. Survivors over here. Perfect timing. Also, adrenaline. Oh, fuck. Hold on, chat. I think we might get punished for not tunneling. Oh, shit. How about instead we just go for, like, a super turbo tunnel? This one down. And presumably, they're going to use that speed increase to get towards the other door. Which is exactly what they're doing. Like, rats. Ah! 
Oh, yes. Um, maybe the Yunjin goes to the other door. We gotta be quick on the down for sure. And at your Misim, hello, dude. Welcome in. Fuck, we're now time for this, man. Uh, what do we do? What do we do? How many lights was the other door? Let's see. Damn, they got that quick, dude. Let's see. Uh, Sable should play the lottery. Oh, 100%, man. She's been lucky. Uh, gotta try and find some um, crows here, ideally. She could be anywhere. Let's see. I mean, if, if I was her, I'd be running around the back of the main building to try and get towards the other door, but she might be back on this one again. But she is indeed. Hold on, that's huge. No close no. Let's see what we can do. And now goes Zala. I'm doing pretty good, man. Vibe and chilling. Not too bad. Uh, was she death hook? Does anyone remember? Could I possibly bait them to come inside? Were they going to be uh, little bitches? It's hard to say. She is death hook. Okay, how do we do this? Um, is there a hook near Shaq? Are we going to be like hookless here? Maybe. See, big swings. This might still be possible, to be honest. Let's see, one big hit. Yo, shit, sprint burst. Hold on, that ain't good. No, 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 no. Okay, that's a 3k at least. Excellent, jeez. Okay, so we kill her and then go for the Hokon Yunjin. Let's see. Do we have the hooks? Uh, it's pretty enduring. Absolutely, man. Winning the match. Go for that one. Jeez. Uh, why does he inject himself twice sometimes? It's a bug. Uh, I'm pretty sure it was introduced when they changed the add-ons for some reason. No one knows why. And at your shack. Hello, my man. 14 hours sleep. I'm proud of you, dude. That's huge. Hey. Uh, he just likes needles. You know what, man? Have you ever considered that maybe he's just a big fan of needles? Let's see. Um, double med kits. Prove thyself. Some windows times three. Jesus. All on the line as well, man. Crazy. Jeez. How's it going? Yeah, not too bad. I mean, the maps have been pretty garbage. Uh, but besides that, not too bad, man. Also, another build with another top hat. Cool. So lethal pain res DMS barbecue at evolve green speed. What would I do without you, man? I would be lost. You are incredible. At evolve green speed. Pain res is page seven. DMS barbecue and lethal. And at your smite, hello, dude. Welcome to the channel. Let's see barbecue page one, DMS page two, and the last one was lethal, which is page six, I think. No, it's not. It's page five. Hey, mega nerd. Uh, mega nerd, me, Misty. I'm sorry. Hold on. Uh, back up a sec. Pause the music. Uh, <laughs> Hello, Misty. How's it going? Thank you for the seven months, and it's many, many more. Hope you're doing fantastic. It's always a pleasure to see you. However, I'm also um marginally offended. How do I remember that one? What the puck locations? I mean. The honest truth is after like 8,000 hours of playing this game um, without a search bar, you just start to memorize these things, right? Because someone comes in, what's a BP? I know, dude, hold on, let me spend some points, hold up. People come in, they're like, Lilith, can I have this perk and this perk and this perk? You just gotta, gotta, gotta remember, right? Lilith exposed, what, for being a nerd from Misty? Okay, dude, okay, that's reasonable. Uh, why don't I spend blood points? It's capped to 2 million. The, the honest truth is that... No! Oh, dude, can't we just have one game with a good map? <laughs> For fuck's sake. So, Plex Retreat again. Can do. Just a smite. Hold on, man. There is a, uh, a slush. It's sliding all over the place. Oh, of course. Did you try mouse and keyboard blight? Hold on. Uh, you try blight, okay, and you don't know how you do it, sir. He, uh, so, so what, one thing that you can confirm now, right, is that like he, he is harder than it looks, right? Like, 
I understand that we have a lot of practice on this character. We have a lot of game time. But like the, the one downside to doing so um, is that you do make things look really easy, you know? You're insane to him? Thank you, Misty. I mean, you, you could be as well. You could be uh, the next uh, bright, uh, bright, uh, blight prodigy. Uh, also, Nilavi, hello, dude. It's so good to see you. Hello. Let's see. Uh, corner has collision. Big flicks. Six of nurse and pyramid head and not blight. Oh, I can't believe this. You are like a brother to me. That's <laughs> uh, David. With spring burst. That's really cool. A uh, calm spirit sprint burst, David. Good to know. Making a checklist. Doesn't fall the window because he's beast. He dies. Uh, not a bright prodigy. No, no, no. A blight one. Exactly. I uh, removing the hug sack will buff blights. That is true. In fact, that was the name of my video uh, from like two years ago. My uh, opinion is still the same. Hold on. Uh, gamers? Somewhere. Maybe distortion? Yeah, possibly distortion. You never know, man. But I missed the hug any wonderful day so far. Better than me getting pallets to the forehead. Let's go over here. Take it. Oh, that takes so long to recharge. I don't like that, man. Hits. There's a four second recharge. We break that one. Edge. Ah! Uh, look, if it's not bump logic, it's bumble logic. Yeah. <laughs> I completely agree. Uh, you think M1 is your ally? I was born in this. Modifiers. Uh, it was only when I was a young man that I saw the the, the bright and was blinding. The bright or the blight? Oh, Quentin gets stuck on a wall. That's unfortunate. And then your Volta, hello. Hold on, chat. I'm going to try something crazy. Okay. Oh, I've got any valve of my fuck. Uh, what can I do here? Let's fucking go, man. Clean as fuck. That is a uh, bump logic supreme. You think I'm gonna be breaking pallets in in 2024, man? You think I want to consume your blast mine, dude? Not a chance. Uh, do I miss the old add-ons? Uh, kind of. Um, I mean, old Alcring, I do miss. Alcring was a ton of fun. Also, we hold on. Big bumps. Big flex. Oh man. And then we get Adivile. That's really cool. Blast Mine. Blast Mine, Chemical Trap. Same thing. I don't get hit by either. We ain't kicking gens, we ain't breaking pallets. Shit. Uh, no Chemical Trap Valley for you, Mr. Quentin. Nope, not today and not ever. Uh, he's running in building. Oh, fuck. You got that hard. Oh. Godward map. Um, Adivile isn't my favorite add-on, uh, especially since they kind of bugged it recently. You miss Outcring, you miss... Uh, uh, old double speed was fun, man. But, like, who needs double speed? And have double eerie, dude. It's so sick. Oh, come on. Uh, sadly, yes. This is live, not P2P. P2P is where they simply fix the vial. Apparently, yeah. I guess uh, they finally caught on to the fact that they may have fucked him. Uh, does anyone know if Chemical Trap triggers if Blight just rushes into the pallet break? Uh, as in if he breaks it with a power? Yes, it does proc. Any way that you can break a pallet, basically. Uh, except for Night Guards, I guess. Oh, hey. Leave it. Hey, so sunglasses. Looking extra fashionable. Yo, it doesn't fall the window, though. This guy has balls of steel. Oh, fuck. Addy Vile. Hold on. Come on! Uh, oh. uh, do I remember my Blight gameplay review series? I do, yes. It's been a long time since I've done one of those. If there's enough appeal in doing them again, I'd be more than happy to. 
But uh, they, were, they were never the most popular things that I did. Bro, that takes so long to recharge. I hate it so much. Yep. Genuine question, because I'm sure there's like someone out there. Does anyone actively enjoy uh, current... Oh, fuck. Scratch marks. Uh, current adrenaline vial. I'd be really curious to know. Oh, God. There we go. Not too much? No, you'd love them? Really? If the PTB fix it, for sure. Once the PTB comes around, it's going to be a lot better. As of right now, like, not the biggest fan. It's better before, for sure, now has agreed. I mean, bugs or it wasn't bugged. It is currently bugged, is what I mean. They reverted it to how it was originally, back when I said that I didn't like it, and I still don't. Oh, dude, you are lucky, man. This guy's got ping in my garden. Okay, video game. That's really cool. Just embarrass me in front of 17,000 people. Okay. Was that punk? Um, adrenaline vial back in the day would limit your rushing by, what, like 70% or something? 80? Uh, and then they made it not quite as extreme. Made it like a 40 or something. I don't remember the numbers. And then when they changed the add-ons again, they reverted it to what it was originally, despite the description still saying that it's the new version. And so, for example, um, let, 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 me, let me try and show you. If I try to turn with the adrenaline vial, I effectively don't go anywhere. If I just go in a straight line, like, the turn is, like, non-existent. You know, I'm, I'm just going in a straight line, right? And so it means, especially without the hug tech, this would be pretty useless. This was Shaq. Uh, hey, Mia, make a point redeem to start a petition to rename Blight to Bright and make the survivors suffer a violent heart attack if they try to blind him. That's a great idea. I'm, I'm not against it. Yeah, see, like, normally, I would feel pretty confident, like, downing her without breaking the pallet, but with that evil, not so much. This one says 55. Yeah. But it's not 55. It's, like, 80 currently. I don't, yo, never accept suffering. What a great name, dude. Hello. Hold on. Sorry, I'm not really paying attention. David, my man. I have adrenaline vial. I can't catch you. Oh, come on. Oh, I think we get that. I think we get that. Nice. Good uh, shit. Uh, oh, my God. Little Thoman, my favorite amazing streamer. Uh, with an eggplant emoji. <laughs> <laughs> what does that mean? Hold on, I'm not sure if I should be um, impressed or terrified. Sick. Uh, in current bug form, minus 80%. No, I hate it. However, um, it'll be back to minus 55% and notes won't reduce the charges. So it'll be back to vile and notes after PP. Correct, yes, which would be much better. Well, like that, for example. Like, I, I mean, unless you're going parallel, you will not be able to hit something like that, which is a shame. We have. I've got a wall here. Hold stop you. Oh, come on. Way. There we go. I'm not a flood of moments, OP. I try my best, dude. Uh, the devs did nerf me back in the day. I'm not sure if you guys remember when Pinhead first released, but uh, they bugged Shadowborn. And it was the most miserable two weeks of my entire existence. He could take a hit there. Ah! Yeah. Is the Hugtech still in the game? Uh, as of right now, no, the Hugtech has been removed, sadly. No more Hugtech ever again. He jumps in a locker? Oh, that's such a shame. Okay, yeah, let's go for Quentin, I guess. I think Quentin's death hook, if I'm not mistaken. I can't remember. Run for a pallet, runs towards main building. I can't rush for like 14 years. Oh, hold on. A lot of tech. 
Wait, hold on. Let him, let him sec. <laughs> All right, never mind. I mean, we get him anyway, but you can't Lilith sec against that one particular locker. Why? <laughs> That's really dumb. Uh, how do I play on 6,000 DPI? You just get used to it over time, man. It, it sounds insane, but also like, I don't know. To me, it's way more comfortable. You know, you just don't move your hand very much. I never thought you'd see Julius Caesar getting chased by blinds. I didn't think I'd see that either, man. But, um, yeah, DBD is a wild place, man. Problem is, we can't really see that door from this angle. It's a shame. Uh, if they're smart, they'll try and reset first. If only I had a perk to find them, that'd be really cool. Yeah, like, that is, like, the maximum turn you've got with any vial. Ugh. Uh, what's the little attack? A really bad tech? Okay, dude. Okay, hold on. It is the single greatest tech in the game for hitting someone inside of a locker. Actually, no. uh And then, yo, Rosie. Hello. It's so good to see you. Number one, 1v5, uh, Doomfist main. God of all gods. Destroyer of hope. Hey, yeah, hold up. That's good. That's fine. If they're on comms, uh, Quentin will actively will actively be on the other door right now. Big free throw, okay. That's uh, any means. Hold on. What the fuck? Went down. Uh, we may as well check the other door, I guess. I don't know, for vital notes will be seven charges. It'll be nutty since bump logic is the only way to play. 11.6 second recharge. Oh, for sure. Which is going to be pretty good. Um, considering that they're going to, you know, re-unfuck the, uh, collision bug. Or the, uh, turn bug. Nice. Don't teleport. Don't do it. There we go. Nice. Um, they might escape the Hold on. She's pretty close. Uh, oh, shit. I think she crawls that, man. I don't think we get that. Yeah, I can't rush in time either. Shame. Jeez. I re unfuck you. <laughs> I mean, it was fine. And then they fucked it, so now, now they've got to re unfuck it, you know? Got to strip me that game? Yeah, cause, I mean, it was like a 1v5, to be fair. Jeez, what do we have? Uh, quadruple med kits, nice and balanced, uh, with the charred wedding photograph uh, offering. That's cool. Jeez. Uh, hope on Renato, also lies, distortion. Uh, whoever said distortion, by the way, you are correct. Crazy. Um, did anybody else redeem a build, by the way? We do have open builds for two subs or 500 bits. I don't think there's anything else in queue. And, uh, yo, PS Peekaboo, I'm doing pretty small today, man. Not too bad. Uh, re unfuck. Haven't heard that term before. It, it's one of those brand new 2024 Little Foman terms, you know? <laughs> Uh, hey, Lilith, do you think without the hug tech, Blight can still compete with Nurse? Okay, so, what I will say here is the same thing that I've been saying since the dawn of Blight, right? Is that, like, so a lot of people are claiming the Blight is now... Wait, hold on. Shit, it's not Blight. There's still more in the queue. We have an unknown build. And at your Renato, GG's, dude. Well played. Insane chases. So, when Blight first released, okay? Like, back in, what, uh, September 7th, 2020, I think, um... He had no hug tech, right? He was just simply a bump logic and 180 flick killer. And he was considered S2, right? Even back in the day, he was considered the best, the, the second best killer in the game below Nurse. Um, I don't see how removing the hug tech and bringing him back to what he used to be, but better because the, he, he has better add-ons and better collision and also better um, flicks than he used to. Like, how, how is a better version of an S-tier killer becoming A-tier? I don't quite understand. So, hold on. Unknown with Dark Devotion. Wait, what the fuck? Huh? Okay, I'm I'm digging it. Dark Devotion Discordance is another perk. Okay. Deathbound. I'm seeing a lot of Ds here, dude. And also, uh, Nurse is Calling. What a weird build, dude. I'm interested. With the Vanishing Box... And the sketch attempt. 
Okay, cool. He's F tier now. Oh, clearly, man, clearly. Uh, didn't he have a better version of C21 Green Speed now bring back at release? Um, yes. Uh, I mean, C21, no. Uh, PTB was better. The original version was the same as we have now, though. Uh, Green Speed and Alcring have been changed, but I wouldn't necessarily say that Alcring is worse, because Alcring is very, very, very strong um, in current form. Uh, also, second to last build. Thank you, Tur. You are incredible. I would be lost. And at your title, hello. Uh, how are you doing, Lilith? Just joined the stream. Well, welcome to the channel. It's a pleasure to have you, man. Hello, hello. These are definitely perks. I'm, I'm, I'm curious. Uh, I'm not sure who redeemed this one. But I, I'd like to know what kind of synergy there is. Because I'm not quite seeing it so far. Okay, Ormond. Sweet. It is uh, literally impossible for you to find a killer to main. You can't decide. You could always do the classic odd star attack and just play all of them, right? Theoretically. And, uh, yo, lesbian dino nerd. Hello, welcome to the channel. Based out of the uh, DB randomizer website, you're not wrong. It's so a classic Leon going down in four seconds. A star attack? Yeah, just play all of the characters equally. We're up against the other uh, hit rapper, Big Sneakers. <laughs> well, he did choose the main Leon, so um, um I, it's effectively a three v one. Uh, hello, hold on, gamers. There was someone here, and now they've disappeared. Uh, nice one, Leon. Oh, yeah, fantastic play from... <laughs> that, that doesn't even count as tunneling, right? Like, I see the unhooker, I go for that guy, and then Leon runs into my face. Oh, because he has decisive strike. He's clearly really good at the game, right? Okay, yeah, well, there's one hit. It's always Leon. It's always Leon, dude, every time. Every fucking time, dude. He throws the pallet. And then doesn't die. Okay, okay. A huge brain. Yeah, clearly. He runs away from the tile. Let him cook, champ. This is uh, stronger than the average Leon main. Yo, and he also moves from the pallet, dude. This guy's insane. Holds W. No ways for Scott. See what's going on, buddy. Good play. He does have the reaction time of a fish, though, that's been dead for several years. Okay, go for that one. Uh, Leon was tunneling me. <laughs> True. Yeah. It's not that bad. No, okay. To be fair, he's, he's doing all right. He may have made a couple of fundamental blunders, but he's doing okay. <laughs> So not looking behind herself, that's bad. Oh, decent. Anyway. I guess it's uh, lore appropriate, so he wouldn't even tell Meg uh, was still alive in the trailer. <laughs> that's a good point. Bum, 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 bum. Dun, 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 dun. Bum, bum, bum. Uh, and uh, you're Onyx, by the way. I'm not sure if I said hello to you, but uh, hello. It is so good to see you. Sick it. Thank you. I am often referred to as being the greatest uh, unknown player of all time. And uh, you're Ragnar. 36 months. That's three years. Fuck me, dude. 36 months, man. I really grew up with you, James. I love our community, even though I left DBD a long time ago. That's right, man. It, it, I mean, to be honest, if anything, that means even more to me. The fact that you still hang around the channel and, like, you know, support me, despite not even playing DBD right now, is insane. So, uh, thank you, dude. Classic Leon. 
Uh, Ragnar, so many, many more. Thank you for three years of support, dude. Uh, okay, cool. Anyway. <laughs> you, you've you've got to give him credit for trying, though. I hit another hook. Well, lovely. Not too bad, Onyx. I'm, I'm, I'm doing okay. It's, it's been a strange week, but we're doing okay. <gasps> Popping my generators. This is insane. Hold on, champ. Hold on. Wait for it. Wait for it. Hey, there we go. Nice. Yep. Oh, lots of level ways you got too sweet, Onyx. I really appreciate it. See, that hook is still available. Uh, 10 out of 10 bang. It, it was a great bang, to be fair. It was well positioned. Um, it just needed to be, you know, maybe 10 frames later. Chip. Oh, yes. Uh, have fun with the build. I'm not paying attention. It's so it's it's, it's all good, man. Uh, to be honest, I don't know what the synergy of the build is. Um, someone in chat said that it kind of sounded like a DVD randomizer.org kind of build, and I kind of agree. <laughs> like, I mean, Discordance is pretty good on its own, but like Deathbound, Dark Devotion, Nurses. I'm I'm trying to figure out where the synergy is. You know, I'm I'm sure it's somewhere. Close. Yo, gamer. He runs upstairs. I need help. Help with this. Chip. You know what I could do here? Hold on. I can totally hold a hostage. Hold on. Wait, she left! Oh, that's a shame. Close. Wait a moment, this ain't Blight, you are correct. This is the other guy, uh, Chucky. Swing. A little th it's a five head. Deathbound is to group them. Discord wants to get peaks, uh, splits, uh, groups, and nurses for more collateral damage. You are a genius. You know what? I'm s it's starting to make more sense. Oh, wait, nurse is calling value? Okay, hold on. I'm starting to see the value from the build, dude. It is wonderful. You know what I could do here? Hold on. I think we can get this guy to shit his pants. Yo, I forgot where he was. My bad. Fuck. <laughs> Sounds like he didn't really shit his pants. But yeah. And then, yo, E flights. It's been a while, man. It's great to see you as always. That would have been so sick. So, probably one of your favorite killers. I would honestly agree. I think he's like top five right now, man. He's really fun. That's fine. Wait. Wait. That infected the wrong person? Hold on, chat. I've got a genius idea. Look at the placement of that, of that husk down there. Hold on. If I go over here... Yo! <laughs> Huge play. Oh, look, if I love Blight Sippy. Also, sorry if you saw this. I got distracted by food. Uh, Blight Sippy. Oh, as in like the one on the screen with like the little like slushy. I agree, dude. It's one of my favorites. Hello, gamer. Nice. A Kate is not the best at paying attention. Also, I'm pretty sure I said that she was a Sable earlier. I apologize. Oh, okay, nerd. Okay, you know what? We have some great teleports on the other side, actually. If I go for the pick here, and then stick you here. Oh, shit, I lost one. Fuck. Maybe I don't have any good uh, teleports, actually. Close. Hmm. He's gaming. We are attempting to game here, dude. Um, Ace is likely on the other side, I guess. Hmm. 
I mean, Ace can't be on the door and getting the save at the same time, right? So we might be fine here. Great fake, though. Good job. Hmm. What was in the door? Deathbound information. I mean, great play, to be honest. It's good. The problem here is that, like, everybody's death hook, so they wouldn't really bother coming back inside. Smart time to leave as well. Just paying attention. Um, what do I do here? Oh, Ace, hold on. Hmm. I've got a really dumb idea. I wonder if I can get them back inside. Despite her being death hook. If she has Unbreakable, I am truly fucked here. Let's see what's ha what happens real quick, though. Hold on. Okay, they are healing. That's fine. Uh, honestly, you're struggling a lot with the smallest round of Drex's blanks, bigger loops. I'm okay, but the small ones, you can't do them. Do you mean like, um, like Macmillan tiles and stuff like that? Nah, they're too scared, dude, is the problem. It is theoretically possible. But they are also shit in their pants. Hmm. So where did I down the Cheryl? She was over here, right? Is she crawling? I can't remember where she was, to be honest. Um. Hmm. We could maybe 3k this one if any of them are willing to actually come back inside. A uh, chance. If you have a blue collar working partner, remember to scrub your showers and bathtubs. Have, uh, you haven't in a while and just spent the last hour scrubbing it. Oh, it's a painter. Oh, I can imagine, dude. I'm so sorry. And then, yo, Grim. Hello, dude. Happy Friday. Bro, someone's got to come back in sight, because otherwise she's going to bleed, dude. You don't want her to bleed. I do, however, also have to find the Cheryl. I genuinely can't remember where she was. Wait, Kate's come back inside. That's good. That's progress. Where is she, though? There's you. Where's Kate? Hold on, champ. Hold on. This might still be possible. I don't know where Kate is, though. Hold on. Huge. I'm gonna try and get the Cheryl, though, ideally. Let's see. The thing is, they, they kind of know that I've got a teleport over there, though. I, I It's probably just worth getting here. I don't think they had the balls to come back inside. I mean, 10 hooks ain't bad, though. And a, yo, 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 what's going on, Zass, though? Good to see you, man. Hello. Almost 10 hooks. Uh, I mean, the last four survivors were death, as far as I remember. That ain't bad. I'm a terrible slugging. I forget where I um, slug people all the time. Dude, same. But then, I mean, often they're not the hardest things to find because they just crawl towards like an exigate or something. The Cheryl was crawling in the other direction though, so I had no idea where she was. Let's see, uh, DS, we had some, wait, what was Leon running? Chemical trap and wiretap. It's a distortion on cage, geez. Geez, man. Uh, hey, Lothar, can I ask what you think about Blight's hug tick removal? I do have a clip somewhere. Um, I mean, admittedly, you probably understand that is a very common question right now. I had a clip that had my thoughts in it, but I'm not sure where it's gone. Somewhere. Uh, that's the one. Yo, Shaq, thank you. Yes, exclamation mark PTB Blight. That's the one. Uh, also, Tyler, uh, Lilith, I'm learning Blight, and I'm great with him outside of Chase. In Chase, uh, when there is a structure or loop that I don't know when to use my ability, what I should do to land hits in a second. My best advice, um, because, I mean, I mean, ultimately, it's it's great to hear that you are good with Blight outside of Chasing, but Blight is a Chase killer, right? So it's pretty important. Um, if you're struggling to know where to rush, then you it, it means to me that you need to rush more. Um, you need to be rushing every opportunity you possibly get, 
Um, you are going to be failing. There's going to be a lot of collision that doesn't work. There's going to be a lot of areas that you realize that you're not very good at rushing in. But the more that you try and rush them, the more you understand where you can rush. And also, by extension, um, what areas you should be playing M1 in, which is honestly very few. Also, okay, so double eerie. Yo, double eerie. Hold on, man. That is wonderful. With a pain res, grim brace, deadlock, ruin. Okay, grim, page three. Ruin, page four. And deadlock, right? Let me double check. Deadlock Ruin, Grim, Pain Res, Double Eerie. Yo, let's fucking go. Also, Birkin. One Double Eerie. Say no more, man. Double Eerie is now my middle name. And, uh, yo, White Rose. Hello, dude. Uh, give me... Hold on. Uh, forgive me if you answer this today, but what uh, what's the progress in your game? Uh, I have not talked about it today. Um, I've actually... So, I had a friend... Uh, by the way, again, if anyone does want to play test the game, uh, give me your thoughts. Uh, DM me on Discord. Would be more than happy to give you the ROM. Um... I had a friend uh, play it recently, and they they really enjoyed it. There, there was a lot of really good pro, like 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 a like productive feedback from it. Um, but the big thing was the idea of like separate endings, and so I think I'm going to be extending the game a little bit. I'm going to add like another area, uh, another like side quest thing, um, and at least one more ending. And we get... Dude, Nostromo! What are my maps today, man? Christ. Other than I'm feeling spicy today. Good to know. Mr. Creeps, hello, dude. Uh, how's it going today? Pretty, pretty omen. Oh, my God. I don't think I've ever felt so complimented in my entire life. Where is the uh, people blushing here? Uh, Mr. Creeps, it is so good to see you, man. I'm feeling pretty... Not terrible. Oh, my God! Oh, <laughs> Oh, you can land that shit. Also, they get a fucking blind, because of course they do. Oh, that's clean. That's really clean. Okay, never mind. Down part two. That one is dedicated to uh, all the Giga Chants that are currently watching the stream. Also, they cleanse the, uh, what, ruin? Okay, I mean, fair enough. Uh, kind of mid-hit, not gonna lie, because I, uh, mainly because I hit it, that's understandable. So hold on, she's still there. Oh my god, that's fine. There we go. That's you, Frosty, that one is for you, man. Don't throw the power, don't, don't keep looping the tile. I want to do the funny hug tech thing. L let me do the funny hug tech, keep playing the tile, dude. Fuck. Come mind. Uh, see, that's why I love Double Eerie. You can land some, like, ungodly shit, dude. Like, like honestly, some of the stuff I can land with Double Eerie, I kind of take a step back. I'm like, should I be landing that? Probably not. <laughs> I'm not going to say no, though. You're not ready for this? No one's ready for this, man. Hold on. Oh, my God. Go back over here. Hold on, there's someone on my left. Uh, also, with that question or statement I asked you, I am good at the 90 degree angle flicks. Cool. I mean, 90s are the most important thing to learn anyway. Can I collide there? Pfft, no. <laughs> of course I can't, dude. Excellent. Who needs hug text when you can just do the bump logico, dude? And at your domo. Hello, man. I've had a sty for the past couple days and I've had trouble blinking. Yeah, I've been there before, man. It sucks. Oh yeah, see if you can get some medication for it or something, dude. Oh, but now I can bump into it. That's really cool. Oh, like, dude, shit like <laughs> Shit like that, right? You kind of hit it and you're like, oh, probably shouldn't have hit that one. But you can. Could you double back on that one and then do like a reverse 180? I mean, anything is possible with these add-ons, man. They're fucked up. Close. I was kind of banking on him just to shit in his pants and throw in the pallet. Uh, how many DPIs do I use? I use 6,000. Oh, fuck, dude. It's collision. So, looking down to keep off 180s, not really. I mean, it's it's good uh, practice to look down. But, um, on, on most tiles, not really. Like, all the looking down lets you do is get, like, a little bit... Fuck you, dude. Uh, they're, like, slightly closer to the object, so a slightly tighter flick. Oh, God. Oh, no. 
Hey, nice. Uh, how many DPIs does Lilith use? All of them. <laughs> I will take every DPI you have in stock, please, Squire. Hold on, that's a hit. Oh! <laughs> oh my god! Oh, that shouldn't have been a hit, but it was, dude. <laughs> oh my god. Ooh. Okay. Watch out, we gotta calm down. This team's gonna be reporting us for, for swing hacks or something, man. A brother in Christ. It's not good, is it, man? It, it really shouldn't be celebrated, but it's also really cool. A perfectly fair, of course. The worst part is that would have looked terrible on her side, man. I'm fully aware. Oh, nice one, Blaine. Really cool. Ah, uh, swing hacks. Yep, swinghacks.net. <laughs> Bluetooth are hip. <laughs> oh, gamers. On here. No one here at all. And yo, Tiger Copping. Hello, welcome to the stream. Uh, that is Gabe. That one almost connected as well, dude. Christ. Close. The distance? Oh, the distance is insane, man. To the point where it's actually kind of fucked with my standard blade. Muscle memory. Okay, pass down. That's a hit. Oh, unless it's not a hit, because I get stuck on nothing. I uh, can I play Huntress? I do have an uh, open build request today. Uh, for two gifted subs or 500 bits, I can play any killer, any build that you would like. Lilith, could I explain the difference between look angle and turn rate? I can do offer the game for sure. It's a little bit complicated. Uh, Cos was wondering uh, the difference. I see. I, I Yeah, I, I, I should be able to explain it after the game for sure. So can I play Blight on TV Mobile? I can. I'm not the greatest, but I know what can be done with Blight on Mobile. Ah! Typically. I was working on a guide that I still intend to release at some point, but uh, then life happened. If you want, you can play Huntress and you can use my build. I I, I can do uh, for the low, low price of 500 bits or two gifted subs. Or you can do it for free using channel points. Option is yours. Let's see games over here. Is that Gabe again? Gabe, I'm so sorry, man. I can't find your team. Hey, I just realized doubling gives you look angle, turn rate, and speed, and recharge rate. Yeah, it does. It gives you everything. Because the devs uh, presumably got really, really drunk and didn't know what they were doing. And they were like, let's just give him, like, a bit of everything, you know? Line game was uh, not effective. Let's see. M1. Okay, she is uh, more able. Nice. Excellence. Uh, do I know when the PTP will release? I don't know. Um, hopefully, after they realize that removing the hug tech is a terrible idea. Oh, shit. There he is. You have probably already answered this. Uh, if it's about blight in the PTP, yes. Uh, exclamation mark PTP blight, I think is what you're looking for. Bum, 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 bum. One gen remaining. They honestly might have this. Unless I'm a mind gaming god. Oh, f oh no, 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 no. Oh, that's bad. Never mind. <laughs> we got the flicks. Jesus. I honestly don't know if removing the hug tech is good or not. I don't think it is. And I think it, like, like more than anything, I think it um, portrays a pretty sad future for DVD. You know, because if they're going to be removing the hug tech, it means the Wesk is going to be affected means that they're going to change Oni. They've already changed Chucky. Big swing, sir. That's live. Pico Gen? No, dude. Oh, too close. I will not kick any gems. I will not beat my record. 
Or end the streak, I guess. Nancy Wheeler. <laughs> no, 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 no. Uh, Behavior better be giving um, us a dev update about the mid-chapter PTV before it goes live, lol. I completely agree, yes. So I still have to do the EU 1v1. Where's Nancy? Uh, nowhere to be seen. Uh, with the whole dribble bits, also hatch. Uh, sorry, the whole triple bit with DS, do you think they'll remove the animation or just when the killer picks you up, they can't drop you for five seconds? I mean, they'll, they'll just change the timing for it, man. Um, there, there's, there's no way the dribble thing from the P2P was intended. Thanks, the other side. I mean, I get it, but uh, bump logic is uh, pretty good on its own. True, but it, it, it does allow for less skill expression and ultimately less um, interactive, you know, gameplay from the survivor side, which is not a good thing, in my humble opinion. I think, like, ultimately, if you were to ask any decent survivor what they prefer going against, Hug Tech and Blight or Super Speed Bump Logic Guaranteed Pit Blights, I can't imagine many of them are siding with the latter. Oh, she kept holding W, smart dude. It's so far away. It, it, it's honestly a pretty hard map to uh, defend the gates on, for sure. Zip. I mean, a Chucky Scamper is hilarious that exists in 2024. For sure. How the, uh, the, the, That is the problem, though. Is that, like, the devs looked at Chucky's 180 and said, we prefer having Scamper in the game over a skill expression, you know, attack like, um, like his 180, you know? That's the issue, because going forwards, you know, Wesker's tech is going to be removed as well. Oni's 180 is going to be removed. Um, I, I, I mean, Billy is probably going to say the same, I guess. But like, I mean, forcing killers into more efficient but less interesting playstyles, and therefore survivors into less countable playstyles, I think is not healthy for the game, personally. Let's see. Uh, so we have... Also, we've got to update the other uh, Hugset command, because that's no longer true. Uh, so, yeah. <laughs> Whoops. A blast mine? What the fuck? You think I'm going to kick your gin? Okay, uh, GG's. I, I wish I was good Billy, to be honest. He's so hard to play. B Billy is tough, man. Billy has, like, a massive skill ceiling. Also, I believe, if I'm not mistaken, that is all of the builds done. So we can go back to running the classic Wombo Combo of nothing. Sick. I mean, the hug tech was kind of um, was kind of counterable. Any, uh, yeah, yeah. I mean, th that that is my point though, Jesse. Is the hug tech at least like so? The hug tech ultimately uh, did give the survivors some kind of um, some kind of warning it was happening. Right, you would see a blight and they would bump into something, move forwards, and then look down. That is more than enough time, like at least half a second, to tell what it's about to do. And so you as a good survivor can sit there and be like, what could he possibly hug in this instance, right? He can only hug flat objects. And so do you um, move behind something, right, that he can't hug tech to? Do you try and leave the tile? Do you try and, like, sit somewhere too close that he's going to miss? It gives you something, whereas pure bump logic is going to give you anything. Uh, C. <laughs> uh, yes, uh, Francine, thank you for the two months. Hope you are doing wonderfully, my man. Thank you. Time to explain the difference between look angle and turn rate. Oh, yeah. Okay, so, uh, best way I can explain this, honestly, is probably with a Game Boy, I think. Um, so, pretend the Game Boy is a car. A uh, similar kind of shape, right? Roughly. So, um, if you imagine that uh, you, you physically turning in a car, right, it's going to be something like this, right? Like, you are going forwards, and then you decide to turn left. You're going to start doing this. That's turn rate. And so, if I was going uh, normally, and I turned like that, Versus if I had increased turn rate and I could go like this, that would be a turn rate increase, right? It's, just, it's basically how long it takes you to actually get to that 90 degree turn. Uh, look angle is going to be, uh, I, I, I mean, effectively a car's ability to drift. So instead of going forwards, I'm now going at that angle. So I'm able to go like this, right? Because cars can both turn and also drift on an axis. Same kind of principle. So I'll, I'll, I'll try and demonstrate it. But it means that, like, if I wanted to just use my turn rates, it would look something like this, right? That's just my ability to turn. Uh, my 
look angle is going to be my ability to do this, right? I'm able to look in a direction um, and travel, like, with my camera in that direction without Blight actually going there. Uh, it does update over time, but effectively it means that you can then do um, much more efficient uh, shoulder bumps, and also you can keep track of people and chase better. It also means you don't have to pre-turn when you are going for, like, a 180. Stuff like that. Uh, also, Norm, by the way, thank you for the tier one uh, for two months. That is incredibly kind of you, dude. Thank you. Um, I hope that explanation makes sense. Uh, if there's anything else I can do to explain it further, let me know. No one here? Hold on, someone in building. Uh, no Shadowborn is blasphemy. Uh, Limbo is correct. Oh, sorry, not Limbo. Uh, Onyx. Uh, I am running base get Shadowborn. It's the same thing nowadays. Perfect, Parkos, man. Decent. I see. I was a bit confused as I don't play Blight much, and the in-game description of turn rate and look angle is a bit weird. To be fair, it, it is confusing, uh, and it doesn't really make a whole ton of sense. Yeah, effectively, your um, your turn rate is physically how long it takes you to turn towards something. Your look angle is how far you can turn your camera and drift. So, kind of like a car, I guess. Also, I hear a uh, boon downstairs. Oh, shit. I promise I'm, I'm not tunneling. That doesn't count. I was trying to chase the other dude, and then you just kind of ran back into me. A rip bozo. Uh, thanks, Lilith. I will use this knowledge to test my turn rates at going 180 miles per hour on a highway. Do not um, use Blight's knowledge in cars, okay? It's, it's, it doesn't work the same... Uh, no. <laughs> it's not quite the same thing. I will not be held responsible for any roadside accidents, please. I'm gonna throw that one? <gasps> she doesn't throw it, dude. That's insane. That was really clean. Holy shit, well played. But did I check? Uh, I don't know what that means. Great play from Nia, good job. Honestly, like, surprisingly, Nia's have actually done really well today. Crazy. Uh, Blight is not a car. I, yes, I repeat, I feel like it's worth mentioning, Blight is not a car. <laughs> it's not entirely comparable. Oh, dude, if she stay behind the bush, close. <laughs> Blight is a car. And, uh, yo, Johnny, by the way, man, it's good to see you. Uh, hello, welcome in. It doesn't take window. Uh, yo, streamer, yo, what's going on, Gray? Hello. Here's a bumper car. You know what? That is reasonable. Uh, but what if I rush and I go vroom? You know what, at this point, you know, whatever makes you happy, dude. Okay, so don't blame me for any accidents. So I feel like that was like base kit surge <laughs> or something. I'm not too sure. Uh, have I ever done win streak in a blight and how far did I get to? I'm still on a win streak. I'm at like, uh, I can't remember. I'm pretty sure the wit remembered the, uh, the, uh, the number last time. Like 17,000 something. Which is why we started running no add-ons because we decided it was too easy to win. In fact, it's been so long since I lost the game that I don't even know what losing a game looks like. Uh, 42,069, that's the one, yes. Thank you, Wits. The fact that you can almost hit that is insane. Uh, officer, you know why I pulled you over? Me, I was... <laughs> I was only lethal rushing, what do you mean? I have a double speed license. Oh, she's moriable. Oh, yeah, because we kind of did tunnel her a little bit, didn't we? My bad. I oh, my God. Stop with the gins. Give me a sec to mori this nerd, please. There we go. Generous, right, dude? Give me a fucking second, please. Big swing. <laughs> the gen has been done. 
But Lilith, you do not understand. My only purpose in playing this game is to hold M1. I must complete the gym. My life depends on it. My mom said I don't get any V- <laughs> My mom said I don't get any V-Bucks this week if I do not escape the match. Do not understand. Oh, head-on's kind of sick though, I respect it. It's upstairs, oh no. Well played. Gotta give him credit. That was pretty good. Uh, problem is, there is another nerd inside the building. Right there. And she falls to her death. Slowly. I'm talking about V-Bucks in 2024? Uh, I mean, personally, I'm not, dude. These survivors are. Jesus. Are you back on your face? Is, is everything okay? What's going on, Zori? Uh, what's, 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 what's happening? Uh, behavior is addicted to changing lights out on for some reason. I don't know why. I guess it's maybe like a like a weekly rotational thing. I don't know. Also, someone's still on that gen, aren't they? Fuck, dude. They've got to be on this gen. That's like 99.9 .9 million. Fuck. I feel like each member of behavior gets to have like a weekly go at changing lights out ons. Okay, they complete that one instead. I don't think they get the unhook though, which is good. I mean, unless he was down there, in which case he probably does get the unhook here. Maybe. Uh, they do get the unhook. That's a shame. Scratch marks going somewhere. I can't tell where. Oh, that's really cool behavior. That's wonderful. Thank you so much, dude. Uh, do I want to chase in House of Pain with the other door being that close? They have healed in the basement, though, which is good. Uh, you know what? Fuck it, dude. We're going to go over here. You snuff the boon? That's going to take too long, though, man. It's like an extra space bar that I shouldn't need to press. Dude, why have they got a door right next to the house of fucking pain? <laughs> oh, man. That's okay, actually. Hold on, there's two of them here. Four second recharge. Doesn't make it towards that door. He's going to try and bite a block. Like a nerd. And also not bite a block very well, because we're playing blights. Yep. Standable. Uh, door is almost 99. That's good. This uh, car you can't really survive on, to be completely honest. Oh, actually, you know what? Give him credit. I thought he'd uh, leave that one. That's crazy. Let's see. Leave him on the floor. We tried a good ham. I am still praying for a good ham one day. Let's see. Do you think? Oh, is that unbreakable? Oh, really? There she is. Uh, six second recharge. We do still get her before the exit gate. This is going to be close, though. They do have beamers, so I feel like they might be altruistic here. Shit. You can't body block a blight, you nerd, okay? Oh, dude, they got background player. Oh, they got background player. Unless they don't. <laughs> Sucks to be you, nerd. Do they leave, though, is the question. Hold on. I'm going to try something potentially really stupid here, champ. Let's see. Do they have the balls to not leave immediately? We're taking him into the middle of the map. We're going to drop him. Now they're like, oh my god! There's still a chance we can go back in and be altruistic. That's amazing. Ah, uh, but they have another... Hmm. I mean, we can ostensibly do it again. It's not worth going for another M1 yet, though, to be honest. Hmm, can I up there not really no angle on that one far as i can tell that's fine oh shit almost had it though let's see if i can go for an m1 by the hold on let's see that's good yes four second recharge let's uh, beam to the other side of the map oh both dude what kind of perk is that though dude that's insane down. 
Oh, did we get there? No, that was quick, man. Okay, part two, try it again. No, they're leaving! Oh, that was so close! Didact, it was Didact or a Wigglyph, I guess, man. That was exactly what they, what they needed there while playing. And, uh, yo, Hades, four months, dude. Thank you so much, man. Hope you are doing it wonderfully. So close, dude. Whatever perk they had there. Oh, it could have been Circle of Healing, actually. That could have been it. Except that probably would have been within distance. Almost really close, man. That was a sick game. Can we have, like, one map on Auto Haven, please? Like... <laughs> Uh, let's see. Medkit with anti -hem. Okay, head on. Made for this is interesting. It was Wigliff, dude. It was fucking Wigliff. Jeez. Uh, yo, look, if I have an idea for a vid, jump scare blades. Uh, like, cracked mirror blades? Uh, what do I count as a win for killer? Uh, I mean, personally, as long as someone is dead, then it's a win in my books. You can shout Wigliff at you, sir. It's kind of crazy, man. Like, you kind of forget these bugs exist until, you know, kind of until it happens. And then it's it's game-changing, man. It's crazy. My poor 17,000 win streak. Oh. <laughs> oh, no, it's true, dude. It's fine. I'm sure we can get back up to, like, at least 10,000 tonight. I mean, keep in mind as well that, like, each win counts for, like, at least seven in my books. Oh, yeah, I remember the first time I spoke in the chat and I came in protesting that there will be no Baby Bell slander. I still agree. Baby Bell is fantastic, and so does Cheese String and any form of, che of, of string cheese. However, I go back on that point because I tried this one, like, mozzarella string cheese in America. It was, like, really, like, rubbery, and it felt weird on your teeth. And feel fuck me too. <laughs> Someone is giving us the gauntlet of maps tonight, man. Christ. Someone over here, potentially. Yes, indeed. Oh, dude, it's stuck in the wall. Damn, close. My cheese curds. No, like string cheese. It was like a mozzarella string cheese. Uh, hello? Yep. Uh, calm spirit. Halloumi. No, it wasn't Halloumi. I can't really describe it. It felt like, oh no. Weird on your teeth. Re uh, Rebecca decided to, um, uh, I, I, I don't know, clean the kitchen, I guess. It does look pretty awful. You probably, <laughs> it probably does need some cleaning. Halloumi is like cheese if it was rubber. No, 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 but it was like worse than Halloumi. Halloumi is not that bad. Yes. That extra distance is so good, dude. And at your moho. Hello, my man. Welcome in. <laughs> my brother. Oh, yeah, that, that vault's the bug, isn't it? That? That's a shame. My brother. A brother? Okay, hold on. I've not heard that pronunciation before. Hello, my man. How's it going? Flippin', it is great to you as always, and to many, many more. Thank you, dude. Wait, is that another calm spirit? Two of them? In the same match? What the fuck? It's like cheese shaped, it's kind of like a stick. Yeah, but it's like peelable. I guess we go back over here. Oh, look, if you just finished a delicious kebab, that sounds so good, man. Enjoy. I have been on the uh, on the road to losing weight, so I've not been blessed with the kebab recently. Push him down. That's fine. That time is so good, man. Uh, eating a whole bag of string cheese at 3am is peak. I totally agree, man. Right? Like calcium, it's good for your bones. At least according to early 2000s science. The turn is vile. Dude, were you here to see the uh, flick we did on the Stromo? That was disgusting. I still can't believe why people are so afraid of ultimate weapons so much. I'm not sure, man. It does seem kind of strange. Oh, they're working on that, Jen. I see, I see. Yeah, flick. Yep. There's a uh, Calm Spirit Nerd Part 2. 
throw. Uh, no, I've got label on. Fuck you. Uh, I'll see your posy. Hello, ma'am. Welcome in. Uh, so I remember in like primary school, they would literally give us milk at break time. Yeah, and it was delicious, man. Everyone thinks I'm really weird for just drinking milk. I, 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 I don't see why that's so weird, man. It's delicious. A three calms for I think it might be a whole calms for Swift, man. Worst of the worst. Scum of the earth, man. <laughs> What's he gonna do? Nothing. Looks so good. Let's just drink milk all the time. Right? It's not that weird. Almost had it, man. Close. Yeah, the most uncalm squad. Yeah, I've never seen anyone less calm in my entire life. Okay. I thought they dropped the pallet. Chad Dwight doesn't run calm spirit. To, uh, yeah, so to be fair, uh, if anyone's going to get the hat to this game, it's Dwight for not shitting his pants. But the concept of running one perk. I don't know. Okay, like genuine question. Like, is calm? No, not 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 calm spirit. Um, is ultimate weapon like that common in your games? I don't see it very often. Uh, off the record, dead hard, step tick, something happened. Sorry, scratch marks. Uh, that's cool. She is. I know, you're Kasuk. Eight months, man. With the Broman, no way. Oh, nice. You saved me. Thank you so much, man. So many, many more. Well, incredible and handsome and cool. Haven't seen Ultimate Weapon in a while. It, it seems weird to me. It seems kind of over the top to bring a whole perk every game on the off chance that they bring that one perk. You know what I mean? Like, it seems kind of weird. Uh, is 3.5 year badge still the last badge? I I don't think... Wait. No, there, there should be a unique one for 3.5, I think. Cheers, Kate. Very cool. Uh, maybe they don't like playing against Doctor. That is fair. But also, like, I mean, how often do you see Doctor, right? Like, bring one perk every game on the off chance to see Doctor is also kind of weird. Uh, the builds are to, de uh, to deny info. They're on calm and distortion, which is fair. I'm not running any perks, dude. So, like, half the build is useless. Ah, oh, shit. I don't know where they are, champ. Oh, never mind. I take back everything I just said. Doesn't vault window. Doesn't vault the other window. Because he has that window. Okay. Uh, a little bit laggy, maybe? Let's see. That seems fair. Ah! The DH. In our high MMR, Weskers are common and they usually run the toxic perks. Yeah, toxic perks, like enduring, dude. Unrelenting, disgusting. That is for you. to come in and be that data guy. Nightlight gives us alt weapons being the 14th most popular perk with a 6.6% .6 appearance rate in killer builds. So folks really? are using it. Folks are using it, but I mean 6.6% .6 isn't crazy high though, right? It's not like old, you know, eruption kind of kind of level. But I thank you, Google. That's actually really good to know. Oh, so close. Was worth a swing. Gotcha. There's another calm spirit nerd. I'm in the opposite direction. Enduring is an addiction, and I'm addicted. It, it's a great perk, to be fair. Wait, what the fuck? Scratch marks. Wait, what? Huh? Punk? What? There's no way she got back inside that building. Anyway. Uh, calling ultimate weapon talk. Uh, uh, yeah, a toxic perk. I mean, 
I don't see how her perk, generally speaking, can be toxic anyway, but... Anyway. Uh, scratch marks are so bad lately. Dude, seriously. What is going on? And how do they keep making them worse? And are they aware of it? I don't know. I think knockout is toxic, but that's about it. I mean, even still, though, right? Can, can a perk be toxic? Really? Like, I don't know. Oh, that is wonderful. Yeah, I tried to, to uh, fix scratch marks. They broke it. I mean, it was fixed for a while, and then it just got worse again. Again. Uh, oh... Wait, DCs? That's bad. That's not good for the old altruism, dude. Uh, good for Kate, though. That's wonderful. Yes. Um, Nicholas Cage does the most Nicholas Cage thing I've ever seen and just leaves. <laughs> wonderful. Ultimate weapon. Space Pizarro. Box interrupt pig. Wait, uh, yo, Thrill, it's good to see you, by the way, dude. Uh, wait, hold on, wait, so, hee hee, ultimate weapon, face of darkness, box interrupt pig, we do a little hee hee hoo hoo. Okay, so to be fair, is, so, would you consider those perks inherently toxic, or is it more to do with, like, those influencing, like, like, uh, influencing or enabling a certain playstyle, and that playstyle itself is toxic, right? But the perk itself, I, I kind of struggle seeing toxicity in. I'd argue the ultimate weapon does have to uh, toxicity potential, but only if you're, like, interrupting with pig or Cenobite. Even then, though, is that, like, toxic as such? Like, it it's a dick move. You could consider it BM. I guess it depends on your view of, like, what toxic means, but, like, I, I, I don't know, man. Like, someone winning the game because they found a perk that synergizes with a power, I I I'm not sure if I feel like you can call that toxic as such, right? Like, like, I if someone decides to tunnel you, uh, five gens is it toxic or are they just trying to you know do the objective in winning the match by killing you you know a uh, background player is a toxic perk to the health of dvd i i would agree in that sense but like i i i still wouldn't say it's a toxic perk though it, it's it's you know imbalanced and oftentimes feels uncountable but like is the perk itself toxic also p400 squad let's fucking go Let's spend some points. Uh, the only things that are toxic are BMs. Well, see, like, so, so, um, in my humble opinion, okay, you know, again, this is all subjective. I'm not saying this is right. You guys are just as valid to your opinions as I am. In my opinion, there's not a whole lot that can happen in a game that I would actually consider toxic. Um, but even BMing, to an extent, like, if someone hits you on a hook, is it toxic? Not I mean, maybe, not really. If a survivor's teabagging you after, like, throwing a pallet in your head, not really. Also, Eerie Tag shredded notes. Hold on. With Shadowborn, Ultimate Weapon, your festive bee lights. Wait, Shadowborn and Ultimate Weapon. And so, wait, the festive bee lights, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, shit. Uh, next time, I guess. You're super toxic. Oh, really? Well, uh, sucks to be you because the reason why I play the way I do is because I was inspired by Mile Marker, actually. Uh, the only real toxicity in DVD is the end game chat. For sure. The, the only exception to that, in my opinion, is that, like, so I I if you're in a position where you have a clear, definitive power advantage that the other side can't do anything about, at that point, I think it's toxic, right? As in, for example, if the killer is uh, bleeding people out on the floor for no particular reason, right? That is toxic because the survivors can't do anything about it, right? Like, you are just kind of rubbing it in. In the same way that, like, teabagging generally, I would say, isn't toxic, but doing it at the end game. Eh, you know, because you've already won, right? The killer can't do anything about that. So, at that point, yes. Like, besides that, I don't really think there's... I mean, besides the post-game, obviously, the the end-game champ, I don't really think there's much you can do. Hey, yo. hey Mother's Dwelling. That uh, was a lion juice. Good to see you, man. Uh, God, only Shadowborn is um really nostalgic. Oh, only Shadowborn? True. It does feel nice to use it again. Going along here. One of the most hated maps. Every single map today, without fail, has been one of the most hated maps. We have had um <laughs> a gauntlet of shit today. Good gamer. Oh, no. <laughs> I mean, it works if he doesn't jump off the gen, I guess. 
kind of needed that for collision. Yes, you get hit with a Pocos. Sorry, man. Any complaints can be sent uh, directly to my lawyer, who does not exist. Wyatt? Uh, are collisions on the map bad, or is it just me? No, collisions are non-existent in most of the map. There's a bit of a ping on this map for some reason. Oh, I slipped right off of Salita. Yeah, she wasn't as collidable as I thought she was going to be. She does have a pretty big forehead, so I thought maybe we could, you know, collide on that man, but... She looks at you like, pinch the fuck. <laughs> just throw the power, you know? Here. I uh, went to stop with on banner still showing in the pockets overlay. I am uh boosted. I'm out. Yep. Oh big moonwalks, I agree. Dude, there is some lag going on here. Are we dropping frames or is that just in game? Are you British? You don't have lawyers, you have solicitors. That is also true, Mile. You're not wrong. Also, I was trying to explain that to um, Luna the other day. Stream scene's fine. I guess it is in game. Weird. It's also not like all the time. It's only sometimes, which is even stranger. Teleport. Weird. Ace has been on the cheeky cabbage, I think. <laughs> you know, I don't think you're wrong. It's just Blights. Gotcha. Uh, t well, hold on, wait, the, the TV licenses still get me about the UK. Yeah, I mean, it, it's it's often like a common joke, but you do need a license for pretty much anything in the UK. You want to watch TV? You want to own a TV? Gotta have a license for that one, mate. You want to consume oxygen? Gonna show me your oxygen license. Oh, it's just so close. Balance landing? It's a joke? What well, the the okay the oxygen one is a joke obviously but um close uh the the TV license yes was, yeah yeah, yeah that, that is real man oh, genius that was a really bad time to read chat well played she's kind of juicing TV yeah yeah I'm not sure if it still happens but people back in the day used to like come knocking at your door to check if you had a TV license <laughs> yeah. Oh, I'm not closing there. Juice alert. Yeah, she's doing great, man. Problem is, because it's um, Red Forest, I don't really have any objects around the main building to bump, uh, to bump into. She is lagged. That's very cool. Uh, show me your oxygen license or oxygen privileges are revoked. Sorry, man. I'll grab that for you next time. I don't have it on me right now. What, that miss? Okay. All right, dude. That's fine. You got balance landing as well, nerd. Oh, thank fuck. Yeah, there is like a weird bit of lag this game. I feel like he's... Oh, my God. Oh, what? Okay, hold up. Um, I guess he's experiencing it as well, maybe. What the fuck was that? Uh, <laughs> what? Huh? What is going on? It says that his, his his ping is fine though, dude. What? The DC tech, apparently. The hallucination tech. Ah! Yeah, that's really cool. So what is that boon? You know, rather pay subscription than call it a TV license. That, that fair, true. Dementia tech? I've never, I mean, what the fuck is going on today, dude? DVD truly is falling apart the seams. Gonna run back towards main building, of course. That lag is atrocious. Oh god. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, that ain't good. Oh, I can't even play it. Never mind, I'm leaving. Jesus. Lag switching? No, the, the, the whole game right now is laggy. For everybody. That ain't good. Is that Shadow Stab? Oh my fuck, dude. We got rock dude. We got Red Forest with Shadow Stab and Lag. Could this be any worse? What have I possibly done to deserve such treatment? Here. 
Hashtag bring back small blights. I totally agree, man. That was back in the day when collision actually functioned. Oh my god! Oh my god! And collision doesn't work, just to, you know, really add insult to injury. Oh, please collide, please. There we go. Who the fuck used to shadow step? Apparently Talita, dude, I guess. Or, um... Michaela, maybe? I'm not too sure. Come on, please. There we go. Do you think... Wait, hold on. <laughs> Do you think the lag is contributing to the scratch marks just not working? I don't know. I mean, are they rendered client-side or server-side? Altublight.com. That'd be such a great domain, dude. Oh, dude, she's so lucky, man, every time. Uh, no, thanks, Hades. Exactly what I need right now, man. Okay, doesn't throw the pallet because she has a window. Oh, but I can't hit her because there's lag. It's not here, apparently. I I'm not sure what should be connecting or shouldn't be connecting, though, to be honest. Oh, God. That ain't good. <laughs> not you, the medium vault. I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm trying, dude, okay? Even the more he's lagging. Excellent. Go back over here. I see a gamer. Excellent. Wait, hold on, wait. The best way to prevent piracy is to provide a convenient service. That is true. Also, regional pricing. There's a straight in the way. Fuck. If I had double eerie, maybe that would have connected. Let's see what is happening. She has a window vault. I have a... Oh my god. There we go. Uh, dude, you get Pocos so often, but that was indeed in range for hits. I feel like it was, right? Let's just check for adrenaline here. That's good to know. <laughs> good to know. Let's see what we can do. The doors are pretty far away, so maybe that's an advantage. Maybe. Or just to, like, really add insult to injury. She was dead anyway. Okay, that's pretty good. This is going to be at least a 3k. Oh my game, please. Oh, shit. A claw is indeed on the door, though, man. And she's injured. Oh, shit, that's a 4k. Oh, okay. All right, she just pops a step tick. That's cool. That's really fun and healthy for the whole family. Really cool. And she runs back towards main building, because of course she does. And uh, yo, Peppy, dude, that's so kind of you. It's been it's been so long, man. Yo, uh, if anybody has been gifted a sub, or I mean, simultaneously not, enjoy the emotes, the ad reviewing, the spiciest gameplay from one of the most handsome dudes on the planet. I really hope you've been uh, keeping well, man, and the life has been treating you fairly. Thank you so much, dude. Five billion tier one gifted subs. You are too kind. Uh, problem is, where did I down the other one? Main building, right? Holding W, you'd love to see a man, of course. Well, there she is, man. Found her. I uh, thank you so much, dude. That, 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 that is beyond kind of you. I'm mean, glad the adrenaline nerf doesn't apply to carry, so we can still do that. Okay, so I, I, I may have missed it, admittedly. Um, what happened to adrenaline like what's been nerfed about it oh <laughs> dude the parkour bm hit on the hook sick fine man thank you you are too kind uh it's why i think billy gets nerfed soon he's on the first place um 
We're calling to official stats from January 31st to March 11th. Is he really? Yeah, I mean, maybe he's been overtuned a little bit. Let's see, there was an unbreakable on Michaela. That's a that's a shame. Which servers weren't playing up. Dude, what the fuck was happening? Also, Z Storm P. Hi, dude. Uh, looking handsome and buff as always. Uh, geez. Dude, I have known Z Storm for God knows how long. Years at this point. B500? Yeah, man, the maximum. Which I feel is, like, honestly not that uncommon after the uh, Blood Moon event, because the blood points were insane, dude. It was, what, like 500,000 per match? A uh, question tech, sir? Wait, hold on. On a top hat? Ew, okay, fair enough. And uh, yo, Jonathan, people on hook don't get adrenaline anymore. Is, is that all that's happened to it? Because if so, I guess that's fair. I would have personally had the survivor become broken, uh, but that's, uh, you know, just me. And, uh, yo, Em, welcome in. Uh, did you play from a fellow P100 Michaela? And you've got the uh, 7TV sick looking username. GG's, dude. It was a pleasure going against you. Uh, can we get the Giga Chad cam for the P500? Of course we can. There you go. Festive. Oh, shit. My bad. Fucked that up twice in a row. <laughs> Next game. Uh, also, the speed boost is three seconds instead of five seconds. That That's also a fair enough. That's fair. So, hatch spawn? Okay, someone remind me, because I forget every time. Hatch is spawning at Killer Shack. It was a uh, pleasure playing against you too. My internet was not having it that game. I mean, dude, uh, as, as far as I can tell, I think everybody was struggling. I, I I don't think it was you. I think it was the server. It was like my bumps were super delayed that game as well. Sweets. This is actually a pretty fun map. And uh, Adrenaline doesn't wake you up versus Freddy anymore, which it should have never done, right? It never made any sense to have one specific advantage against one killer in particular who is already not that strong. Oh, James, uh, Hatcher Killer Shack. Uh, thank you. I will keep that in mind. Hello, gamer. I wonder if we could have had that with double area, maybe. Big throw. Cheers. This uh, is life. Do I just played against the LED? Was she a juicer? Should I be terrified? And... <laughs> and within four seconds of the game starting, Kay Denson has DC'd. Back to the campfire you go. That's really cool. Let's go towards Shack. On here. Maybe an LC wall? No. W mates, yes, very cool. <laughs> I see. I, I don't remember anything crazy, to be honest. You won, but it was close. I see, gotcha. Okay, well, uh, let's see if she can I'm do something against us this game. This way? Oh, she was there. Am I tunneling? It is a bot, though, so I kind of feel like it doesn't really count. Hold on, champ. Watch this Omega Super Mind game. Do we have a hook? We do not. Okay, hold up. No! She turned around! Oh, man, she's too strong! Almost had it, man. Close. My game in a bot? I mean, it, it, it did almost work, though, to be fair. Damn, next time. You know, having lag issues, but teleporting times as well. Oh, fuck. Okay, buddy. Okay, that's cool. You, yeah, I mean, we can slog. I'm never in slogging. <laughs> uh, what's my um, average DC count per stream? Probably like 20. Honestly, it's pretty high. It doesn't matter what we run. It doesn't matter who we play. I've had people DC against Trapper before, dude. What is going on? A sabang for a bot. You've, you've got to give him credit. I do respect him. Did uh, prevent the tunnel there. Uh, 
survivors have got to start learning that uh, throwing a pallet onto a blade after getting hit is probably not the best use of your uh, resources. Oh my god, oh! Hold on, chat. The hell am I, baby tech? What the f- Oh god, oh! Hold on! Oh god! Oh, I'm running! <laughs> okay, I think we're back in business. What the fuck? Friend lost- Yeah, to be fair, that, that, that wasn't my end. And then, yo, Sleepy, thank you so much for the Prime Sub, man. Uh, perfect timing. Enjoy the emotes, the ad for viewing. The spiciest gameplay, guaranteed. And uh, to many, many more. Hopefully, dude, thank you. Kate Jensen. We meet again. It's got lights? I, I guess so, yeah. I look for a blight in 2024 April? I Yeah, I guess so. This requires um very, very, very bad ping. And in your cola, I miss you, dude. Also, uh, looking looking great in that photo you posted in Discord. Uh, oh, hello. Jonah. Who would actively make the uh, decision to play as Jonah in DVD? I don't understand. Does he have a beam a chat? I'm gonna look directly forwards and pick him up. I guess the answer is no. <laughs> Odds? <laughs> I mean, it's, okay, to be fair though, he does kind of look like Jonah. However, I feel like saying that Otz is Jonah is um, a bit of a disservice to Otz. Oh, close. Okay. Uh, Jonah looks like your dad. You refuse to play him. That's fair. And again, Sleepy, thank you for the Prime Sub, man. <gasps> Yo! Beamer save up the wazoo. Nice one, Ace, dude. Good job. That's a long blind. What the fuck? That was smart. He did not panic. He held forwards. And he won the chase. Alright, Jonah could be a blind main. That is also true. It is possible. It seems unlikely, though. <laughs> Your mom seems to think so. <laughs> Still no one here. Crazy. And then your cheetah, hello. Uh, Chief from earlier was fun playing against you again. Last time you absolutely clapped me the first time I tried streaming. Yo, you were the uh, Claude in Mother's Dwelling, right? You had some immense chases. You played that one so well, the balance landing, right? Very well played. Or am I thinking of a different game? Hold on. Either way, I remember you being an absolute juicer. Just popping a stip tick. Gas Heaven. Oh no, you're right. Yeah, Gas Heaven. Um, yeah, you were the uh, the Legacy Cape. Uh, not Cape. Um, that doesn't exist. Uh, Claude. Can you not, please? Thank you. Lock, you do good ping. Oh, you shut the bed. The near was cracked. The near was so cracked, man. Although so were you. Oh, I kicked in there. Sorry, buddy. I'm just better at the game. Is that hard? Dude. I'm sorry. Sometimes you just gotta learn to, uh... I don't know, I mean, press E better, I guess. Ah! Gamers. Dead hard. Dead hard in 2024. Oh, I hit that? Um, the bottom of my, like, feet collision was... Are you actually running to the corner? Okay, Jonah. Really cool. Uh, Blank's, like, swing hitbox goes from, like, eye level down to, like, feet level. So as long as they're within that kind of vertical line, uh, you will connect. And the cool thing is, you don't even get the swing animation, so it does look like you can just kick them in the head. We tried once, and the second game in Lilith destroyed me. I'm so sorry, dude. <laughs> I'm sorry. Well, you had some great chases. Personally, I think you played great. Oh, God, no! 
Cheers, video game. I should have remembered that that tree does not exist. W? Uh, yeah. Kind of. Yeah. Are you showing us where not to rush? Oh, of course, yes. Yeah, PSA to any black players out there, do not rush into that particular tree. No! Ah! Insane E press. This guy's uh, using a keyboard. That's crazy. Although, it dies. Ah! <laughs> yeah. Let's see. Going to the lights. In fact, actually, can I get the sun and the fire barrel in the same shot? Probably. I mean, the doors are pretty far away. Uh, three rushes does make it a little bit easier. But they're not ideal. Uh, have they removed hug text completely in the new PTB? Effectively, yes. Um, oh, hey, buddy. Uh, yeah, they're, they're not really viable anymore. Oh, we missed that. Damn. It's been eight great months. Did he W? Did he run back in the same direction? Uh, going through Maine. I mean, respect to the other she's trying to take a hit here. Oh, lucky. That might be hope, actually. Then your karma eight incredible months with the incredible karma. Thanks so much, dude. So many, many more. Is that a smart idea, LOD? I don't reckon it is, dude. To be completely honest. Tiga. Smart play, though. Uh, chance of Elodie not making it back to the Exegate is slim. So she's probably there. Hold on, I'm going to try something. Potentially really stupid. But it might just be stupid enough that it actually works. Okay, I'm going to run over to the edge. And stay just far enough away that she doesn't have a radius. We're going to be out of 32 meters. See. It's gonna peek over the rock and just chill here for a second. Hold on. I I didn't see her run back in. I could have had that. Fuck! Wait, do you think she saw me? She probably did, right? Oh fuck. This shit makes me so anxious. It, it kinda does, but maybe we can win this one. Hold on. Hold on, chat. Let me cook. Hold on. <laughs> Yo, the psychological intimidation tech works every single time. That is the 4K. GG's. Got him. Dude, it, it works, man. How this work? Because survivors are way too cocky, man. If, if they think they're safe, they're probably going to attempt it, you know? Problem is, I don't remember where we downed the Jonah. Uh, he was in here, wasn't he? Oh, shit. Oh, hold on. Oh, fuck. Hold on. Killer Shack. Killer Shack. Killer Shack. Kill a shack. No, Jonah. Fuck you. <laughs> he tried it, man. He tried it. Cheers for uh, reminding me about that one, champ. Uh, wait, where did I get the weapon from? Uh, it's in the store. It's um not part of a set. It's just on its own. He's so close. He was really close, man. GG's. That right there is how you win the match. <laughs> Woo. <laughs> GG's. Just cut your losses. Nah, nah, nah. Never cut your losses, dude. If there's a will, there's a way. If there's a survivor that is way too confident, you're probably going to bring it back. Let's see. So, BNP, of course. Uh, Hope, Dead Hard, Distortion, Soul Survivor. Oh, I, I mean, I, I guess it makes sense with the blueprint. Uh, Dead Hard, Second Wind, Live, Quick and Quiet, Fair Play. GG's. Well played. Uh, make sure to add Ultimate Weapons Complete Shaq's Build Request. Yes, and also the Cosmetic. I do remember. Okay, so, you want an ultimate weapon, 
as the final perk, which is here. And then you want to put the green hat, the uh fuck, what was the Christmas combo? It was it was the, the leprechaun fit, but with the um jingle cane, right? I think. That one and that one, yeah. Uh, your pose here, Cyborg, wait, Cyborg Blight set would have been dope. Um, I hope he's next in the Biopunk series. Um, if anyone is Biopunk, it's Flower Guy. I completely agree. I think the Blight would fit perfectly. Although at the same time, I'm kind of biased. I think Blight would fit perfectly in every possible collection they have. Uh, that is the set. I've gone six hours. Uh, presumably. I mean, yeah, we've been live for four hours, so we may as well. Uh, watching your streams uh, makes me want to play Mr. Pinball. I like to call Blight this. I think you should, Amy, to be honest. I think that'd be a wonderful idea. So what are the new tryhard add-ons? I mean, double eerie, realistically. Uh, maybe like, Eri Tag, Alcring. After the update, I think... I don't know. It, it's hard to say. There, there, there are so many good combos on Blight currently. Like, double eerie is very, very strong. But also, like... I mean, after the update, yeah, things like Shredded Notes and um, Adrenaline Vial are going to be very strong. So, shocking how quick four hours went, right? It goes so quickly, man. It's concerning. Also, let me take a, take, take a quick drink chat. Cheers. Okay, let's go. Uh, yo, Wrecker's Yard. We finally get a map that isn't garbage. Nice. <laughs> and, uh, your Fox fan. It's going pretty well. Not too bad. Vibing, chilling. Chasing some, uh, you know, default Leons, as you do. Throw the pallets. And then die. I still remember that 1v1 on Wrecker's Yard. We're going to do another one uh, soon on EU servers. At least we have to do it before the uh, hug tech gets removed. Marry me, senorita? Wait, hold on. <laughs> I may have missed the memo, to be honest. Uh, hello, gamer. Oh, you do miss the old green speed and uh, adrenaline. I, 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 I totally agree. Dead. And she's on the floor again. Was that cane? Uh, I don't know if you can get this cane anymore. It was um like a bonus to, buy, to, to buying Oryx Cells in December for the Christmas cane. But again, keep in mind, you know, the devs are not a fan of uh, FOMO. No siree. Uh, Leon, what the fuck are you doing? A little for the Christmas skin. Of course, dude. And uh, loot. yes, you are correct. It's not a full outfit. It's just a cane on its own, sadly. What was the last, like, Blight cosmetic we had? We had the one with the recolor from the Rift. And I guess before that was the Cat Blight? That was ages ago. That was wrong survivor, but I'll take it. And, uh, yo, Raph, welcome in, dude. Are you, uh, wait, hold on. Just made the Grim Blight look, and it's good. Uh, tell me what set it is. This sounds cool. Uh, also, Olu, uh, joke aside, um, I mean, you know, fair enough. You might not be the biggest fan of the devs. You might not like their changes and the FOMO and everything. I don't think anyone needs to die, though, right? I don't think it's quite that serious. Also, there was a near here. I think the devs are doing just fine. At heart? You. <laughs> Dead art. So, <gasps> beam a save. Now nah, I've got a live one. Hit a sample, though. Hey, I wish we got a version of the Billy Rift outfit for Blight. Uh, Super Rift would go. Oh, it'd be, it would be so sick, man. Oh, I guess they die. Yo, no way do we convert that. That would have been so sick. The old standstill tech. Looks every time. Oh. 
Yo, dude, he's still. Actually, really respectable. That's a great counter. And uh, yo, Poseidio, thank you for the log, dude. That's very, very kind. Enjoy the stream. Uh, slip my mask, dripping mystery robes, and mech staff. Uh, remind me, I'll try that next game. That sounds cool. Some weapons there for more support. Oh, yeah! Hold on, forgot about that one. Cheers, dude. Let me go open a locker. Hi, Dad. There we go, sick. Though ultimately you're not wrong, it is kind of there for more support. Also, watch this chat. You ready? Bounce. All the way around Shaq. Wait, and she held W? <gasps> no! She held W! What the fuck? My spice! My credibility is the spice lord. <laughs> Dead. Never mind, we got our uh, spice license back. You've got to give them a reason to use comms for in this game. Oh, by just continuously abusing it? Yeah, true. What is, like, theoretically... It doesn't have to be a good build. What is, like, theoretically the most screamy... Or, like, scream-oriented build that you could possibly run? Double Eerie. Yeah, Double Eerie would have had that. Oh, no, she held W against my hog tech. I would have never guessed it was that easy. <laughs> Fair enough. Want to pin this so bad? I think you should, man. And that is a, uh, a, a, a pretty fair uh, message to pin. Uh, scream oriented. Yeah, like, what, what is the build that would provide the most screams? I guess besides playing Doctor. Like, something that would scare people into running calm through every match. Here? Yeah. Actually, I take it back. There is someone here. Like both members of the team are over here. That's cool. Three sixteen. Bound probably. Yeah, true, true. A cane is horrendous. No, take it back. This cane's fantastic. What do you mean, dead heart? Yeah, maybe. No, possibly. I was uh, a little bit intimate. <laughs> Oh no, Bill has a beamer. Yeah, very cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Deathbound lost a weapon, infectious pain res. Yeah, yeah, pain res does cause him to scream. That's true. He runs into the basement with balls of steel. I mean, you, you can attempt it if you want to. I mean. Basic BT is a bitch. <laughs> you can attempt it if you want to. Take it back, Hades. It's all good, dude. Also, Bill, you're still downstairs. I imagine running a full screen build and someone running Dramaturgy. Well, Dramaturgy um, and Scene Partner, right? Oh, what? Dead Odd? She's running Dead Odd. Hold on, champ. No attempt to hug Zack, and she's probably gonna hold W. <laughs> Never mind. She held W in the wrong direction. I'm not Sable bringing Blight's best map. I mean, yeah, admittedly. I mean, she is kind of base for doing so, though. Oh, no, other direction. There we go. I smelt the man. She was already in deep wound, was she? Oh, no, she was. Unless she mended. Good hatch. A uh, fun fact. The scream specifically is the thing that procs scene partner. So if you run calm spirit, it becomes an empty perk slot. Oh, really? So there's like anti-synergy. Was it Mellow Man? Uh, no, it was Dead Heart. I guess she, she uh, mended at some point. Uh, Windows made for this. Dead Heart Adrenaline. Hope, Adrenaline Light, Windows. Prove thyself, Windows, Adrenaline Light. I'm, I'm seeing a lot of um, similarities in the builds these days. It's almost as if there were like nine perks in the game. Of course, Scene Partner was the thing. Yeah, I, I, I always forget what it does. 
it's like typically speaking if, if it's a nicholas cage perk it's normally drama surgery that i'm seeing right he had that other one as well that i've also forgotten completely a thwack as well true yeah thwack's not too bad i guess infectious is the most likely one to proc consistently besides ultimate weapon grim blight yeah what was the combo you had it was the mechanical stuff right Let's see uh it was the slipknot head as well as the dripping mystery robes what the fuck is that one uh oh that combo i mean it's pretty good admittedly i do think the slipknot mask works best with the prestige body um yeah i mean a solid eight out of ten i'd say also i'm gonna be running a double eerie because fuck these guys and also nothing else uh what are my thoughts on the hug tech being removed uh th there is a link that's very uh very kindly been provided by posy um just because we do talk about that quite often i made a um or the, the, we, we 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 clipped a portion where i was discussing my thoughts on it so hopefully that one uh is most of what you need I haven't been here in a while. It's all good, man. As long as you're keeping well, that's all that matters. It's good to see you, dude. <laughs> you look badass. Thank you, Mr. Hades. <laughs> Very kind. Uh, face the darkness. Infectious, often weapon, and maybe jolt for a lot of screams. Uh, yeah, I mean, would jolts be as consistent with screams as something like uh, pain res, though? I'm not too sure. Maybe. Uh, yo, Lilith, uh, how do you feel about the Blight buff? Uh, yo, what's going on, MLG? I'm really looking forward to the Blight buff. I cannot wait for him to be given a gun. Delicious. Uh, is the guy still responding to me after I blocked him? Uh, I'm not too sure. Uh, I'm not sure who you blocked, but from what I can tell, uh, I think the answer is yes. Uh, Jolt could potentially have a lot more value than Pain Res. Possibly. So are we thinking Infectious, Jolt? Oh, fuck, dude. What, what have I done to deserve this? Like, why have we had such bad maps every time? This sucks. <laughs> Uh, anyway, I guess we just get on with it. Classic, thanks, Lilith. No worries, Google. Um, <laughs> anytime. Ace of Darkness, also true. Uh, here. Yeah, kind of. Throws the pallet and then runs into a wall. Um, didn't expect anything else from the lorry. Uh, ew, swamp, disgusting. Also, maybe live here? Oh god, yeah, that's cool. Nice. I don't want to chase her anyway, she smells bad. Only pre-drop. You gotta remember, Onyx, she is competing for that $5 Fortnite V-Buck card. Yes. What's a question that I don't think anyone has ever considered before. So, is one V-Buck called a V-Buck? Is it spelled with a K-S or an X? Because the plural would be V-Bucks, right? Would you consider it a singular V-Buck? A uh, nice background play, you nerd. Okay, good attempt. Does she get it off the side? She does! Now, the greatest part of this is that we drop her, and then we down her again in like four seconds. Unless scratch marks are non-existent, that's always fun. Oh yeah, cheers behavior. Very nice and uh, easy to follow. There we go. Like an in-law thing. It would be a single V-Buck. I, I, I'm not sure why that just sounds weird to me. It might just be the fact that I've never heard to it be referred to as a V-Buck before. Also, yo, hold on. Do not pass go. Do not collect 200 heals. Bro, I swear this map gets harder to see every day. Is it actually getting worse or am I just getting old? <laughs> I can't tell. 
Uh, finally, someone running Sabo speed add-ons. I mean, it, it's been a while, but I respect it. Oh, shit. Where's the unhooker? Sable, I'm so sorry, man. Blame this on your team. Whoops. It's not you at Swamp. Okay, okay. I'm, I'm glad to hear that it's not just me getting old. Because, like, goddamn, it's hard to follow these scratch marks. Well, I think in of money terms, you have a buck and bucks. True. I, you know, again, I, I feel like it's just because I've never heard someone refer to it as a single V-Bug before, you know? Game's old? I mean, compared to Jahari, not really. Oh, pff, oh God. The scratch marks are getting worse, man. I swear to God. Oh, where did she go? Uh, uh. Yep, yep. Okay. Jesus. I yell that if I'm struggling with survivors who do a particular dodge, uh, where they dodge left or right and then run towards me, is it the same as shoulder flicking? Uh, yes. I, I mean, shoulder flicking will work for any kind of wiggle or spin or... I mean, as long as you're within hitting distance of a survivor. Uh, and they're also not uh, significantly lower than you, I guess. That was a pretty good play, actually. Uh, we'll connect. And then, yo, no way is that Swayze with a fancy name. Hello, dude. Ah! Yep. Yeah. Jahari is ancient. Uh, <laughs> Jahari is pretty old, man. Admittedly. But he's also really, really cool, so we get away with it. Uh, Jahari did sit next to Jesus in second grade. Also true. He's uh, been around the block a few times. <laughs> Oh, come on, come on, convert that bad boy. Ah! Oh, yeah, boy, sick. Crush deck was kind of naughty. I, I wasn't expecting him to do it, but admittedly, similar kind of problem that Artist has is that, like, those hills are pretty vertical. Ah! Uh, your Luxord, is that the Little Thoman, Blight Drifter, and Hand Cam Professional? Uh, say no more, that is me indeed. Down to a T. Ah! Oh, shit. What do I have to work with here? Nothing. Come on. I love Jahari, even if you grew up in the, um... Pally <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Sweet. Okay, one down. Three gems remaining. That's pretty good. Uh, that's main building being worked on. I didn't try. <laughs> Dude, I mean, it, 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 it kind of feels bad because he's not even here, but it's still really funny. Uh, didn't Jahari draft the architecture for the pyramids in Egypt? Um, that was like 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 into his career already, you know. Like that that, that was one of his um senior jobs. You know? <laughs> yeah, that's a great example um of the uh, shoulder flick, by the way. Jahari watched Jurassic Park and got nostalgic. <laughs> oh, bless him. He's really not that old, right? Like, yeah, you know, he may have been around, you know, when the Covenants were developed, but he's not that old. I'm not running Shadowborn. I mean, to be honest, these days, I don't run anything. I run add-ons, and that's about it. Damn. Hold on. Oh, he's here. I see. Okay. We've got some dead hot gamers. I right, Jahari's going to love the thought. I really hope that someone sends it to a man. Some some pretty good jokes, honestly. Right, Jahari is the only survivor of the, um, of the meteor hitting Earth. <laughs> that, that was significantly after he'd um, developed a career as an architect. Sending all of these to him? Please do, Posey. And a yo, 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 what's going on, Zan? It's so good to see you, man. Hello. That rhymed. I'm not a rapper. Also, by the way, funnily enough, so in the new PTB, um, I mean, most collision has been fixed. You know, if you want to collide with the trees or anything like that, it does work. Except for this fucker. Uh, for some reason, um, it doesn't work now, and it doesn't work in the new one. It is beyond redemption, I guess.
Okay, now we have the impossible task of finding Hatch. Uh, yeah, what's going on, Laurie? Will that new viewers be ignored all the time? Uh, no, not, not at all. Um, I mean, keep in mind, you know, realistically, I have uh, two eyeballs. And the eyeballs can only read uh, so many messages. And I, I, I try and get to as many as possible. I do not um, specifically read the messages of people that are subbed or people that are new. I just read whatever I can see first. So if I do miss something, feel free to post it again. In fact, if anything, honestly, if I, I mean, I mean, honestly, like if anything, the messages that I always read the most frequently are the ones from new chatters. If I see like the um, pop up saying new chatter, uh, those are always the ones that I try and um, stick to the most. Or needs eyes on the inside. It, it, it's really tough, man. Like, over the past few years, I've developed the ability to, like, separate my eyeballs like uh, chameleons. You know? <laughs> so each of my eyes is, like, a, like, you know, always at, like, a perpetually weird angle. Uh, GG's game is well played. Justice for Posey. Wait, hold on. Post the first time chat. Yeah, go on, dude. Yeah, I dare you. Okay, cool. My question was, why you only show one hand on the hand cam? Um... I mean, theoretically, I, 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 I could have two cameras um, with both of them. I could also just move this hand here. Um, maybe. That's not a bad idea. You, you honestly got a good point. Um, the, the honest truth is that, like, the keyboard hand isn't really doing that much. Uh, it's the hand cam. It, it's, it's the mouse cam uh, or the mouse hand um, that people are mostly looking to learn from. Good hand cam, not hands cam. Also, really good point, dude. Yeah! Okay, now we'll go for the uh, the classic Lilithoman Blight, that bad boy. The 7.7 .7 piece be a W or L for Blight? It's it's really hard to say. Is it a W for Blight, as in, in general? Uh, no. Is it a W for people that enjoy playing him, right? Is it a W for me? No. Is it a W for Blight's effectiveness? Yeah, I, I, I'd probably say so. Right, again, keep in mind that when Blight first released, he didn't have a hug tech, right? Like, that was only in 4.7 that the hug tech was introduced. Um, and so ultimately, like, it's not getting any worse for him. Like, like you can still down people. Uh, you'll just be forced to go for bump logic, which is way more likely to down someone. It's way more guaranteed. And there's less you can do as a survivor to counter that. The problem is that it's way less fun on both sides. So, like, is he worse than he was before? No. In fact, if anything, I would imagine that over time, and you know, I, I mean, I mean, after you know, I mean, let's say like a year after the um, update goes live, his kill rate is probably going to go up, but his player rate is going to go down. RPD time, dude! I love RPD. This is when you guys are like, "Wait, Lilith, you love RPD? That's crazy!" <laughs> I want to put PDB uh, PD Blight in the title. You, you're not wrong, but also, when was the last time anyone read a stream title? You know, I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure we had titles before saying, like, in all caps, like, this is happening. And people still asked about it. Uh, someone arrest this man for saying such a thing. I'm sorry, Beatles. Probably 1902, probably. That was a wild year for the DVD Comp Olympics. RPD is actually not a bad killer map. It's really not, man. It's also arguably my favorite blight map in the game. It's a little bit challenging, I do agree. You know, and the doorways and stuff do make it a little bit tricky. It's really not too bad. Just requires a, a bit of practice and a bit of patience. If you read the list title carefully, it says Ultra Tubbo, not Turbo, does it? Wait, hold on. I'm being gaslit. No, it doesn't. I just double checked. Oh, fuck. That's been My bad. Uh, who is going ultra turbo? Me. I am doing the ultra turbo. Ultra super speedy turbo uh, giga tunnel. Supreme. The fourth. Okay. I've got to go to Germany. Lilith says, um, wait, says they're not great tattoo artists. Wait, hold on. What? Wait, that's not what I said. I said the opposite. 
I said all of the best asses just happened to be in Germany. Well, the last time someone read a stream site, so we were challenged um, by the other uh, base swift. Oh yeah, I remember that dude. Yeah, yeah, the bitch ass swift. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Wasn't the stream title like um? Okay, so a uh, bit of story time for anyone that wasn't there. I think this was probably about two months ago, roughly. Um, my stream title was just simply the blight your swift is scared of and someone was so fucking offended <laughs> they were like actually Lilith no I'll have you know uh, me and my bitch are swift we could destroy you we're not scared of anything come scrim with us right now and then I asked them I was like okay dude get your swift we'll load into a custom game me and your bitch are swift and they were like no actually Lilith um they're all sleeping right now it's like <laughs> It's like, bro, like, what, 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 it's not that big of a deal. Perfect, oh, man, nice. That time, yeah, that one, dude, insane. Oh, I'm a tattoo artist based in Germany? Oh, I wish, dude. Then I'd be good at something. Sleepy ass swift, bro, it, it blows my mind. I, 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 in my, you know, three and a half years streaming career, I've never once had someone be that offended by such a simple and seemingly um, clearly joking stream title, you know what I mean? They're um, asleep, I swear. Oh yeah, clearly, yes. I promise, they left there asleep and totally not shit in their pants. Oh, she did do the fake though. That was pretty good. A little of ruined his ego in one sentence, yeah. And then he just got really mad and kept complaining and complaining over and over again. Uh, officer, I didn't know they exist, I swear. <laughs> also, okay, Nia. Uh, which one is that Jane? Wait, Jean? Jane wears. Um, I don't know. Maybe it's a new one? Admittedly, I'm not famous for paying that much attention to the survivor's clothing. Unless it's like a really good set, you know, like Dwight's paddle set or something. They okay, sprint burst into the killer, cool. Um, is it at the store? I don't know. Uh, maybe it was a Rift one. Maybe it's a recent one. I don't know. That one is a recolor from a few Rifts ago for St. Patrick's Day. Well, they, uh, uh, clearly Google is the arbiter of all information. I can't imagine they're downstairs, are they? Well, they are. Fair enough. Do our tattoo artists in your country have similar restrictions to, to, the, to what they have in Germany? Um, what are the current restrictions? Do you mean, like, the, um, the whole, like, recent ink thing that happened? Like, color restrictions? Dude, she, uh, we did get the dead heart, though. To be fair, I'll take that as a partial win. Yeah. Oh, oh, fuck us. Uh, ink and Nono German symbols. I mean, uh, more than likely the same. I can't imagine there are many good artists that are willing to tattoo that one on you, to be honest. Um, the ink thing is like a European problem. Um, it's not really that big of a deal now, though, because most, uh, you know, kind of ink manufacturers have just remade their stuff and used um, appropriate you know, ingredients and whatever. Kind of abide it by their laws. Just don't complete the gen. That's really nerdy. Don't complete the gen. Uh, by the way, I have a cool, fun Jahari fact for you. Uh, what is your Jahari fact? I would love to know. Head on. Okay, we've got a, uh, a swift here, dude. Uh, what's there any lead problems from the ink? Uh, lead problems? No, not to my knowledge. Uh, if there was, I would be fucked. Also, <gasps> no, they got champion of that one perk. So you're not the gamer I'm chasing. Hold on. Here he is. No, to be honest, I mean, I'm, I'm not too sure what the problem with the inks was. Um, I don't think I've ever heard of anyone really having any massive problem with the ink unless they're like allergic to it, you know? 
No! Oh, I got... <laughs> I got hold! No! Fuck! Drinks red 40? Yeah. Well, that's embarrassing. Zass would be proud. He probably fucking would be, man. Oh, my God. Sending that to Zassy. Don't send it to Zass, though, okay? I'm ending stream and deleting the VOD. That never happened. End stream. Yeah, end stream, delete the VOD. Never happened. Nah, 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 nah. I don't know what you're on about. Okay, there is a big hitbox over here. Ho, ho, ho. Wait, can you hit over that? I mean, auto aim seems to think you can. That's pretty cool. Got that. I'm just going to run back out here. Yeah, not the greatest with three rushes, admittedly. Yeah, I have to drop my lurk um, status to say I saw that. No, no, you didn't, dude. Nah, nah, nah. You were lurking. And enjoying the string from the shadows. <laughs> Dare I'm in disguise. It probably is. Yeah, and his um, secret offline Max MMR account. Excuse me. Yeah, I agree. I mean, and, and to be fair, bought her more time than just throwing the pallet, so. I don't know. Like, Germany was rightly very sensitive about the symbol, like the censored Wolfenstein. Oh, yeah. I mean, it would still be the same thing. But, like, I can't imagine there are many countries in the world or any reputable uh, artists that would be willing to tattoo that one, you know? Like, Germany is admittedly, understandably, you know, specific about it, but, like. I can't imagine it's a very common thing. As a member of the Shadow Lurkers of the Little Thoman stream, I saw that as well. No, you didn't, dude. Nah, you were taking a sip of your beverage and decided... I, I don't know. <laughs> you blinked and you saw something. Gaslighting is uh, my middle name. The shadows, Yeah, the Shadow Wizard money gang. Of which... Uh, Oh shit, they got the unhook. Damn. Oh, is he is the only current member. Okay, we have a Nia Carlson doing Nia Carlson things. Yep. Um, I don't think oh wait, hold on, there she is. I was gonna say I don't think she's on the door yet. Uh she had dead harder, didn't she? Yeah, hold up. Never mind. She is too slow for my immense speed. I kind of want to let the Jane live, but she only has one hook stay. Oh, wait, no, she doesn't. Never mind. She has two. Great timing. Great play, though. Actually, not that bad. I wasn't expecting her to get stuck in the corner. Jeez. Uh, even though I didn't make Blixel, I just uh, made the variants. Um, yeah, some pretty sick ones. We're still waiting to use the um, 100k one as well. But if I heard you go, no, wait, wait, whoa, whoa, hold on. Who messaged Zass, though? Fuck off. Zass, though, enjoy your lurk, buddy. Um... Snooze and lose. See you later, right? <laughs> nah, 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 nah. Don't tell Zasta to come into the stream after I get fucking hold. Oh, that's so embarrassing, dude. No. Right, to be fair, it wasn't my fault, okay? I run upstairs. There's a hole. I see blood next to the hole, okay? I presume that they've jumped down the hole. As I'm falling down the hole, I see, uh, what was it, Elodie, right? Prick. Uh, <laughs> Sat there looking very smug as I fall to my uh, demise. It was not fun. Why did you message Zass though, dude? Did you have to do that? It was Cree spray? Was it? <laughs> the worst part was I swung as well, man. Oh, that must have looked. So I mean, it must have looked so good from her pers perspective, though. Wlady? Oh, one hundred percent, man. Yeah, yeah, based. Excuses, excuses, you're washed, Lilith. Okay, dear, but you know what? Because of that, I'm starting a 1 million win streak. I am never losing another match again. Okay. Grim Embrace, Pain Res, no weird. Right? Fuck these guys. And a uh, double because why not?
Could almost go with a blood water, man. Did you have the other knee that hold you? No! <laughs> no! Chat, please, someone ban him real quick. No! Uh, hey, what's going on, buddy? Uh, geez, that was incredibly well played. That was pretty based. Uh, also, I'm joking, by the way. I'm not actually running something like that. That makes me feel physically ill. Gross. Anyway. Uh, rip me, Jane. Yo, crazy. GG's. Some really good chases there, dude. Uh, what did I miss? I overheard a sarcastic... Wait, a, a sarcastic good luck in reference to a tat and the hole. Wait. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> okay, hold on. Two completely different uh, conversations that probably shouldn't be merged there, to be honest. Oh, look, did you know Jahari starred in a movie called A Man Before Time? It's a parody of a, of a Land Before Time. It stars Jahari and his pet Velociraptor as they journey through time before he ends up a mutant in some British guy's basement. I didn't know that, dude. We'll let them in blight, Dan. Yo, Greta, can you confirm uh, that you totally didn't see me get hold in the last game? Because, chat, far as I'm concerned, if Greta didn't see it, then it didn't actually happen. Uh, thank you for the 10 months to many, many more. Thank you, dude. Other device or what, huh? Oh, that, that's exactly what I'm saying. I, I don't even... <laughs> I don't even know what a hole is, dude, okay? Does hold mean? I, I, I wouldn't know the meaning of the word hold. I, I, as far as I'm concerned, hole isn't even in my vernacular, dude. Uh, so what? That's what I'm saying, Shade. I, I, I didn't see anything. You guys are crazy. Oh, you miss the short blight sometimes? I miss him every day, man. Short blight was so cool. You could, like, not see other cars and stuff. Sick. What did I come back to? Uh, something about me and holes. Uh, probably best to not get involved in that one, Onyx. I am speed. Here we have a... Wait, is that the same Nia? When did that outfit release, by the way? Was that, like, a super new one? I feel like I haven't seen it very much. And at your mile with a gifted sub to Jer Wait, is Jerem here? Please don't tell me Jerem's in chat. That would have been really, really embarrassing. Can you delete clips? <laughs> Can I just wipe that from existence? That'd be so cool. At uh, mile, thank you for the gifted sub. Jerem, if you're there, buddy, enjoy the emotes. And I hope you're doing well, dude. I don't need to at this point. That, that, that is fair. I still feel like we should delete all evidence of this stream from ever happening, though. There she is. Found up. I need to outfits from the, the the last deep rift. Also, so it is pretty uh, new, I guess. Nancy. Uh, she has the reaction time of a tree. <laughs> uh, the Barbara Streisand effect incoming. Probably, yeah. And uh, yo, Hyper. What's going on, Haggis? Good to see you as always, man. So I'm not trying to tunnel you, Nia. I'm so sorry. Where's the other dude? Not too bad, dude. Um, we're going to be back to normal schedule as of next week. Uh, this week was um, a bit of a rough one, but, you know, we're hanging in there as best we can. And it is good to be back, Hyper. It's good to see you again, man. A uh, cheeky little hook in the corner. Don't mind if I do. It's going to strut my way over there. Bit of a uh, bit of a moonwalk. Uh, uh. I've been ahead is the last rift. Okay, hold up. That's good to know. Oh, uh, shit. Maybe here? Yeah. Oh, the top is from her last um, outfit release. The pants are her green rarity pants in the store. I see. So it's a combination. Onyx is a uh, near aficionado. There's a calm with the build. Perks, Friends of the End, Nemesis, Fight of Chase, Lith Pachua, and Eerie Tag Vio's Journal. Sick. Last embarrassing. If only had the, the uh, Infinity Gauntlet to get rid of those who saw it. I mean, we could always just delete the VOD and the clip and just gaslight everyone to think that it never happened. That's effectively the same result as the Infinity Gauntlet, right? I just can't believe you messaged that stuff, dude, right? Like, I, I can't believe it. 
I'll just put that rock there for near. Oh yeah, I've uh, recently taken up um, rock growing as a new hobby. Fan. Uh, I'm gonna go for you since you are not Deathhook. That feels slightly unfair. Good hit. Oh, you want to see a jump scare, Blades? Karma, we can absolutely do that, man. Tree has collision. So, kind of wild that you can do that. <laughs> it's kind of crazy how um how much you can get away with by slipping the devs a crisp, clean 10, you know? Like, hey, can you guys, like, conveniently put a rock, like, on the tile? The next time I play Yamaoka. Cheers and thank you. Sure. Sweet. Okay, next up is more gamers, presumably going for the unhook. And by the way, chat, just to confirm. That doesn't count as tunneling. Okay, I went for the other dude first. Ah! Oh, sick. Uh, $10, I had to pay them 200 for the twins buff. <laughs> what kind of deal do I have? I mean, the, the, the honest answer, the short one, is that they're all blight mains. Well, they're ultimately not against helping me out from time to time. Also, what am I watching? You are watching Survivor Destruction on Friday Night Lilith Omen Stream. Big spin, there you go. Oh, that one does have some progress. <laughs> I got you guys. <laughs> Air horn sounds, bro. <laughs> yeah. uh, someone's over here. Over forwards and death. Not even close. Not not even remotely, dude. Didn't even tap it. Uh, do I think the the Iriadons need a nerf? Um. The, the, the balanced, fair side of me says, yes, um, the I'm having a great time and Blight's really fun right now uh, says no. But it just doesn't lose. We can't lose, man. Survivors are too bad. Okay. Understandable. I see. <laughs> Damn, you had me there. <laughs> Maybe one day. In fact, um, if all goes correctly... Um, and to plan, we should be doing a subathon at the end of the month, and the final goal is going to be to kick a gym. Uh, favorite blight skin? The one I'm currently wearing. It's the, um, True Blight Head, the Prestige Body, and Iron Bone Cane. I think it is a sick combo. I don't feel guilty messaging Zasty. Also, end of the month is like 30, uh, 31st. Um, it would probably be like the latest Thursday in the week, I guess. Going somewhere. I don't know. Uh, the final goal is to, to kick a gym. Not going to happen. Which is kind of the way that it's supposed to be, though, right? It shouldn't really be realistically obtainable. Now, yo, Pablo, it's so good to see you, man. Welcome in. Also, I see crows. I see unhooks. <laughs> yo, great play, though. That was a smart little dodge. Awesome job from the, uh, the near... Wait, you mean to tell me only having three rushes isn't really a downside to make them balance? Uh, what? I mean, that's kind of what I'm saying when I say that the devs don't really know how to balance this guy. Like, and, and, and it's kind of funny because, like, this is theoretically the polar opposite of what the original Eerie Tag did, right? The original one, or, you know, kind of original after the change. <laughs> uh, dead, I guess. Um gave you infinite rushes and people lost their mind they were like oh my god um surely blight with infinite rushes is really busted and way too strong 
So the devs are like, okay, I understand. Let's uh, just take away the rushes. Instead of five, he has three. Not realizing that the old Eerie tank was pretty bad. And less rushes is typically good. It's, it's bizarre, man. I feel like the dev team needs like a consultation blight on their team. Here's the tough part. Where does the hatch spawn? No one knows. It's a singularity candy, man. Uh, three is like the perfect number, too. I totally agree, man. Three feels fantastic. Like, two would admittedly be pretty low. Um, four would feel too much like standard blight. Like, three with six second recharge is fantastic. Hatch. Fuck. Uh, the original Eerie Tag is in my heart. I, I miss the Eerie Tag. It was so dumb. The fact that you could down an entire team with the Alkring in, like, what, 25 seconds was admittedly pretty busted. But also, it was really sick. Uh, could it be behind main? That's the main building. You sure? I don't feel like it was main building, was it? Hold on. I mean, presumably, she's teabagging it as we speak, but, like, I'm kind of curious where it is. Outside, oh, it was in front of main building. I see. Mr. World Record attempts, same. The World Record attempts were again really dumb, and I, I I understand why they were moved. But um, yeah, back in my day, man, back in my day, Blake it down an entire team in twelve seconds. Hey, I didn't test Blake on the PTB swamp. Is the swamp collision consistent in any way? Yes, it's really consistent. Um. Besides shoulder bumping, shoulder bumping does have more of a, uh, more of a different effect than it does currently. But like straightforward, which is bump your face into objects, it's pretty much 99.9% there. There's maybe like two total uh, collidable, you know, kind of faces that you can't bump into. But besides that, it's amazing. I guess going through main is probably the most efficient way. And uh, yo, come cowshed 1v1, come 1v1, bro. <laughs> what a username, dude. Uh, the other day, a group of survivors told me I was holding the game hostage because you were camping the hatch. Yeah, but you've also got to remember, those are survivor mains. Um, and like I was saying, I mean, modern science hasn't quite progressed to the point of understanding what goes through a survivor main's head. There are some very strange takes in DVD. Uh, is she going to attempt it? There she is. The old gamer. Okay. In fairness, she almost had it, man. Super close. Uh, back in my day, Clown only had purple bottles, and he liked it. He didn't. It was garbage. <laughs> I was about to say, it wasn't great. Although, I mean, admittedly, the, the yellow bottle doesn't really do that much. But it's, it's, it's a nice bonus, for sure. I mean, dude, back in my day, you could mori someone on first hook. That was really cool. Although, if it's enough, technically a buff because of the collision being way better. Yes. Just kind of my point is that, like... The, the update is very, very bittersweet. Uh, it's way more bitter for me personally because I can't do what I find fun with Blight, as in hug text, moon rushes, crazy, ridiculous flicks and, and bullshit, right? Um, however, his uh, bump logic, which is always and will always be the most efficient way to down someone, is now significantly better than it was before, right? Also, there was a build, right? It was a Scratch Mirror Blight, I think. It was Eerie Tag and Vigos, I believe. Um, it, it's significantly better. And so, in many ways, Blight is actually going to be uh, more efficient than he would be currently. The downside is that there's way less opportunity to do interesting stuff, um, and Survivor's going to have way less opportunity to dodge you, presuming you know what you're doing. Actually, back in my day, Shaq had two windows. Oh, God, yeah. Oh, <laughs> those were the days, dude. So, friends to the end, Nemesis, first of Chase, Lethal Pursuer. Okay, hold up, hold up. Let me get some perks in there real quick. Lethal is page 5. You wanted Nemesis, which is also page 5. Uh, Friends to the End is page 4 or 3. Uh, no, it's too complete. Hold on. Wrong perk. Here it is. 
Also, furtive chase, which is also there. Convenient. And also, skin is the ferryman. Cool. And a yo, 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 docs. It's good to see you as always, man. Also, Kit Kat Chunky, the legend, the one and only. Uh, it's so good to see you. Hello. Uh, it's that Iriad on Blight who does funny Blight maneuvers. That is us. That is literally what we do. <laughs> the jump scare Blight. Yeah, I kind of feel like we should go to Midwitch, to be honest. A classic. Uh, what back in the day made me play DVD? I mean, DVD is ultimately a horror game, and I love horror in any medium. I'm obsessed with horror movies, horror games, um, anything spooky or filled with zombies or, you know, whatever. Um... Uh, also, uh, by the way, uh, Kybiv, Welcome in Chance, and uh, what is this? Finn Smoke Blight Packs. I don't know what that... <laughs> YouTube chat is wild. I don't know what that means. Um, he, he he was just really, really... Wait, hold on. No, sorry. Okay, not Blight. Uh, what made me play DVD in general? I mean, Michael came to the game, and I was like, wow, playing as Michael is really cool. Um, it, it was just like another multiplayer horror game at the time, though. And then I just kind of stuck with it because they kept adding chapters, and there was cool stuff, and... I think what really made me stick with the game is when they added Pig. Because um, although I don't really play her much today, uh, I'm, I'm a massive Saw fan. And so seeing the teaser for Pig coming to the game was mind-blowing. I was like, oh my god, that's like the sickest thing ever. You know? I uh, decided to move over to Switch instead. I'm so sorry, man. I try to read as much um, YouTube chat as possible. But uh, welcome to this channel. Excellent. Uh, the horror scene is my life. It seriously is, Rose, for sure. Like, I mean, any form of it. Specifically, zombie games are, like, my favorites. But, like, you know, multiplayer, single player, VR horror, anything, man. If it's got anything to do with horror, I am probably interested. Um, Ada just casually runs outside like there's not a, an eight-foot killer behind her. Fair enough. Are you going to trade? A strange decision. I uh, saw X opinions. Um, besides, it was really good. It was really good. In fact, I think it was probably top three of the best ones, I think. Um, I did have some problems. I'm trying to remember what they were. It was a little bit convoluted and weird. Also, scratch marks, huh? Scratch marks, where? Mm hmm. Fair enough. Oh, she didn't vault though. Good fake. I'll play, my dude. Ooh. There we go. Never mind. And our creeper passes. Dude, back in the day, yeah, yeah. I uh, would be very reluctant to admit how many shit creeper passes I'd read back in the day. <laughs> You haven't seen a scary movie in like five years? Dude, there have been some great horror movies in the past like five years. Dude, 25 consecutive streams kick out. Why are you so cool and handsome? This makes no sense. Oh, what? That was inches away, dude. Okay. Rip bozo me, I guess. So she's really fast. Okay. Yeah. Uh, the best horror movie's come out uh, it's come out in the last 10 years is Pray for the Devil. I have not seen that one. Uh, can you remind me on Discord or something? I would love to check that out. That sounds sick. I think a huge thing for horror in general was, I mean, Jordan Peele. I think Jordan did some... I, I'm not a fan of all of his movies, but um, I think he introduced something very unique to horror. I think he, he does a fantastic job of storytelling. I was inches away. Not the first time I've heard that, bro. What? <laughs> and at your Seth, uh, I'm new to DVD. And just got blank trying to get any. Uh, you're trying to get better. Any tips? Um, is there anything specifically that you're struggling with? The best tip I can give you for learning blight is to um, keep in mind how his hitbox works. As in, like when you're swinging to hit survivor. So at the very beginning of his swing, we're talking a couple frames. The hitbox is massive, and it's effectively impossible for someone to dodge it. 
but it only lasts a couple frames. So you've got to make sure that when you swing for a survivor, you are like physically touching their hitbox. If you swing too early, um, which is sometimes necessary because you're doing a flick or something, but if you swing too early, you are quite likely to have a survivor do what we refer to as a wiggle, just where they kind of move side to side and that very wide hitbox becomes a very narrow one and you miss. Um, if I can find someone, I'll try and demonstrate it, but I don't know where they are. Well, I did a uni analysis of Jordan Peele, and honestly, an amazing filmmaker. Oh, for sure. I mean, I, it was kind of like his first, like, big one, but, like, I, I, I still feel like Get Out is one of the best, like, maybe not, like, straight horror, but, like, I don't know, thriller-style movies of the past, like, 10 years. Plus, Candyman was excellent. I think the only one that I remember, like, not entirely vibing with was Us. I don't know, like, my, my, my one big thing when it comes to movies or games or anything is, that, like, I really dislike predictability. If I know what's going to happen, I find it really hard to enjoy it. And, I mean, no, no spoilers if you've already seen that one. But, um, yeah, I kind of predicted, like, the whole big twist of the movie within, like, four minutes. <laughs> and it was like, oh, okay, that's, uh, that's cool. It's like that, for example, Seth. Like, you want to make sure that you are, like, pressing the attack button um, as soon as you're, like, touching the hitbox. Uh, Megan was also hilarious. Was that Jordan Peele? Nah, I, I didn't like Megan. I know a lot of people did. I thought it was pretty crap, actually, to be honest. Also, Noodles with a 45 stream streak. Fuck me, dude. That's insane. Thank you, dude. You are incredible. Uh, unpredictable movies are absolute boss. I, I totally agree, man, right? Like, I'm, I'm not expecting there to be, like, some ridiculous twist. I mean, it's fun when there is one, but, like, I'm, I'm not expecting it. I just don't have the entire thing be predictable from the beginning. It's why I often don't like superhero movies, because those are, like, the most predictable of any of them, you know? Like, watched the recent Evil Dead. The recent Evil Dead was also really good. I think the most recent Evil Dead did a good job, like, um, keeping that kind of, like, slightly comedy vibe, I guess, to the, you know, kind of not super serious thing, but also being a pretty hardcore horror movie. Uh, what are my thoughts on Tucker, uh, Tucker and Dale vs. Evil? What a classic, man. It, it's not quite up to the god tier level as, like, um, Shaun of the Dead for me, but it's, like, a, it's right below it, man. It's incredible. Come on, come on, come on, come on! Yeah! Double fatigue. I think uh, some tropes can still be pretty good, even if they are predictable. Uh, sometimes, it depends though. If it's like, you know, uh, a nod to like some classic thing that happens, you know. If, if it's a nod to like, you know, uh, slasher cliches or whatever, like, fair enough. But like, um, what was that one movie that came out? Relatively recently, was it called Barbarian? where you had that, like, um, mutant girl thing in the basement. <laughs> Insane that hard. Jeez. Great play. Barbarian. Yeah, that one. Yeah, that was garbage, dude. I'm, I'm really sorry. I know a lot of people love that one. It did really well. Um, having Bill Skarsgård in that movie was a crime. He had, like, no actual part in that movie, and his character was meaningless, really. Like, the ending was so predictable. And then, like, they tried to do this, like, grindhouse-style, like, switch at the end, like a Tarantino-style thing, but it just didn't land, in my opinion. And then, like, I mean, the whole bad guy, I mean, kind of a spoiler here, but, like, the whole bad guy, you know, like, the old guy that did all the, you know, horrible shit, like, that there was no, like, redemption for, like, that character, like, you know, finally facing his match or whatever, also head on. Oh, no, just, just dead. Unless you're in that one. Unless I am dense. <laughs> Never mind, dude. Very overrated. I, I didn't enjoy that film at all, man. Like, it and, and then it switches to, like, another character, um, who was the guy from Dodgeball, which is pretty cool. But, like, his side of the story, like, he was a dick as well, and so I didn't really root for him. I don't know. Such a weird film, I completely agree. It was uh, really uncomfortable to watch low-key and not good, scary, uncomfortable. Yeah, totally agree. It was just weird. And it didn't have any, like, you know, 
um I'm not expecting every movie to have this, you know, but typically movies have like a cool roundabout ending that brings things back. And that one just kind of ended. It was like, okay. And then like the one character that we were supposed to be rooting for, or something the hats over here, ended up being like a dick or something. I could just want to hurt it. Uh, terrifier opinions. I mean, to terrify is like kind of the opposite. Like even if that one is predictable, I mean, it's, it's dumb slasher fun, you know? Like, that 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 one is kind of what I would agree with in, like, if you're just going for cliches, then it kind of works, right? Jeez. Uh, what movie were we talking about? Uh, Barbarian. Um, I, I just, I didn't vibe with it at all. I thought it was pretty garbage. Have I heard about or played the game Darkwood? I, I, I got some emails from them, dude, and I still haven't played it. <laughs> I feel really bad. Um, no, not yet. Also, Singularity. Thank you, Limbo. There he is, looking handsome. Now that movie was shit, it was, dude, right? But, like, I mean, like, not everything that is predictable is bad inherently, but, like, like when key plot points, like us, for example, I'm not sure if that's... Is us old enough to talk about without being, like, like demonized for uh, giving spoilers? I'm not too sure. Like, that twist was so predictable, man. And also, like, the whole premise of it didn't really make any sense i'm not sure how they all survived on uh very few raw chickens <laughs> um yeah i don't know what but that was the only jordan peele movie i've seen that i was not a huge fan of although a lot of people love that one so maybe i'm just wrong there also bill boy is going with a classic wombo combo a brutal surge barbecue and grim did i watch no one will save you uh oh shit um no, I don't think so. What one, what, which which one's that? Uh, also, singular. I'm gonna try and find an Ebony more if you. I give a Nope a watch. Nope was the one uh, in the desert with the aliens. My memory's not great. I think that was the one. I remember having pretty mixed opinions. <laughs> you got games on your phone. <laughs> You were sad. Have a wonderful night, man. Appreciate you as always. Take care, dude. Yeah, that one. Yeah, um, that was a few years ago. I I remember feeling pretty mixed on it. I remember feeling like a lot of things were questionable, um, and the plot points were weird. I didn't think it was that bad though. Uh, horse move with with aliens. Yeah, that's the one. Yeah. I can't lie, when the mutant naked woman jumped off the building at the end, the whole cinema laughed. Which is what I'm saying, right? Like, fair enough, I guess. You know, but like, like they were clearly going for like a Tarantino grindhouse style, like, switch at the end. You know, like, very a la dust till dawn, I guess. It didn't land, though. The whole thing was just kind of shit. <laughs> but again, I mean, someone might think it's the greatest movie of all time. Maybe I'm wrong. You know, fair enough. Okay, Disturbed Ward. Oh, you love the audio design. The audio design was great. I mean, the visuals for the most part, like, the, it looks pretty good. It was just everything else. Wreck was such a good zombie movie. Wreck was awesome. Uh, the second Wreck was also really good. Uh, after that, we don't really speak about it. Mm. I'll try and prep some stuff for later. They're likely towards Shaq or over here, I guess. Or not. Wreck 3, Recopolix. Yeah, that one. Yeah, we don't discuss that one, dude. She is near. I'll take that. A Dutton gentrified Wreck Sag. Yeah, it was such a good movie, though, dude. What a weird idea for a sequel. Hello, you. No, where's that Viku? Hello, my man. Very fast, Walt. I feel like Singularity is one of the only killers that can actually catch up there. That's crazy. Huge. Dead zone that is her dead. How's it going, Viku? The man, the myth, the legend. Live again, what a giga chant. Yeah, coming from you. Bravo, bravo, Singularity has no right to be this cool. 
I've seen the 2023 Thanksgiving. I remember seeing it. In fact, that one was, um, I think, one of the adverts when I saw the Five Nights at Freddy's movie. I think. I haven't seen it, though. Was that any good? Out of my way. You should, you should have watched the movie Velocipasta. Are you seriously assuming that I have not already seen Velocipasta? Do you think that low of me, dude? Go on, dude. Vault the pallet. See if I can. Nice. Uh, yeah, Velocipasta and um, Shark Exorcist. If you're a fan of that one, watch Shark Exorcist. It's a masterpiece. Well, counterclockwise might not be it, though. Uh, close enough. Decent. Uh, wait, hold on. Only real ones for things... Uh, wait, Sin, Thanks Killing. Was that the name of the movie? Is it worth watching? Very good play from here. She did kind of use the power, though. Shark, what? The Shark Exorcist. It's simultaneously the best and worst movie I've ever seen. Like, I, I genuinely can't tell. Wait, wait, no, no, not Thanks Killing? Wait. Wait, no, which one? I may have missed that one, my bad. No. That's the turkey one. Wait, wait, the turkey one? Wait, what? Oh, my bad. But yeah, um, I, I, I genuinely can't tell if Shark Exorcist was supposed to be that bad or um, if they just had no idea what they're doing. Like, for example, there's this one time in the movie when there's this guy taking photos of, like, a girl that's sunbathing, like, real creepy-like, and then it's never mentioned again. <laughs> like, not, none of those characters are ever mentioned. It's so bizarre, dude. To kill a turkey? That sounds so good, though, dude. Cheers, uh, hey, that's very cool. Loved uh, Nicholas Cage's lines in Winnie's Wonderland. Agreed. And I think, like, kind of brings up a discussion. Like, for me personally, there are, like, two forms of, like, good movie, right? Like, whether or not it was a, you know, objectively good movie, it was well made, it had good dialogue or good storytelling, good pacing, whatever. Or whether it was fun, right? Movies can be one or the other. Like, maybe controversially, I thought that, like, Oppenheimer was kind of in, like, the first category. I thought it was a very well-made movie, um, but I probably wouldn't watch it again, you know? Fuck. Where'd she go? Hold on. Scratch marks? Scratch marks? What the fuck? Uh, fair enough. I presume DS being forced here. I'm not too sure. Were they going to try and go for a locker save? <laughs> I respect the attempts. Oh no, we've got that weird high-pitched sound bug. Annoying. Oh, the whole team's here. Fuck. That's awesome. I think Skilling is a real piece of shit. It's not even funnily bad, really. I mean, it sounds pretty good, though, right? Like... That was clean, dude. Dead heart? Wait, Thanks Killing 3 might be the worst movie ever made. There's three of them. <laughs> that sounds sick, dude. Also, running background player with a medkit is a very unique choice. I wonder if she's changed items or something. I think she realized the beam wasn't working. Also, what? Oh, scratch marks, my dude. Okay, that's fine. Okay, near over here. Yo, 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 gamer. You think I get that, man? Nah, not quite. Although, hold on. She runs back into me. That's genius. Trash mask being shit as usual. Yep, yeah, as per usual. The 
Surge. I know I shouldn't have picked him, but I guess I can. Gene secured. No shorts for me today. Nia has no face. Yep. <laughs> yep, Nia's face is gone. Uh, distortion effects, scratch marks, uh, thoughts on blight changes. Uh, estimation mark, PTV blight, I think is what you're looking for. There you go. It's Jova. There's only things killing one and three because the whole joke in the second movie is that it was so bad it never aired and became the third movie. So, so the second movie does actually exist. Like Postal 3, I guess. I've been uh, stuck expecting good filmmaking from every movie I see. So uh, kind of making the movie going experience a bit frustrating. I really should allow myself to enjoy movies, not analyze everything. Which is kind of what I was saying when it came to like my two different, like, um... Uh, I'm trying to think of how to word it. My, my, my two different criterias for like whether a movie is good or not, right? It, it can be a good movie, but also not that entertaining. But also can be a bad movie, but really entertaining, right? Like, um, Willy's Wonderland, I think, is a really good example. Like, I don't think anyone's going to argue that that is, like, some kind of masterpiece, right? But it's really, really fun. You know, you go into it, you're not expecting that much. You know, the cinematography isn't amazing. The music's great. It's just a fun movie, right? But then you can also appreciate how there's a good movie that's well-made, it's well-acted, you know, it's well-produced, but it's also just not necessarily a fun movie, right? Which isn't necessarily to discredit it, but... Was that pathing kiddo? I don't know, dude. Um, survivors or something. Oh, what's the gamer over here? I guess they're over there now. Ha <laughs> ha Wait, there's no way. Do I get this? Do I get this? So close, dude, almost. Actually, over there. Near Carlson. I played. You know, running back towards the window against Singularity is really good counterplay, actually. Fuck, well played. But you don't even watch movies. I respect it. I mean, I, 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 you know, admittedly, I've seen a lot of, like, horror movies and stuff. I'm not super into movies as much as I am with games. The like, games, I play all of them, you know? I think the, the only, like, big, like, zombie game that I've not played through at the moment is, um... Uh, Days Gone. I still have to play through. Hey, I couldn't have Nick Cage talk in it because it would have cost too much for him to speak, so they kept him mute. <laughs> you know, funnily enough, you're probably not wrong, actually. I'd imagine it would have cost significantly more to have him, to pay him to read a script, you know? Or to learn it. At World War Z. That, that was pretty good. Wasn't that the one that had, wait. No, that, that was the one with, like, the ridiculous number of um, zombies, right? Uh, Outlast was my entry to video game horror. That's such a good one to start with, though. It's such a good game. E. My name is Ada W. On God, and I must run the E. No more W's on God for you, though, dude. Still like Zombieland? See, I mean, again, I think Zombieland's like... Okay. It, 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 it's honestly like a really good example like short of the dead to me is a masterpiece and like it's a really well made movie but it's also really fun i i wouldn't say that zombie land is necessarily the most like masterpiece well made movie of all time but it is also really fun the second movie i didn't like very much sadly something great, great is about to happen wait no that's fact it was mentioned in an interview really no way. It's actually fascinating. I mean, I'm, I'm curious to know how much Nick got paid for that movie in general, because they, they can't have had a huge budget, right? Surely. It's fun. The second one was okay. I wasn't a huge fan. Two three matches. Uh, what is it? 5.15. Um, probably two. We'll see how quick the next few matches are. GG's. 
Uh, Zombieland was funny more than scary. Oh, for sure. And like the comparison between Zombieland and Shaun of the Dead is really good. Because Zombieland is like a horror movie. It releases a horror setting where the comedy is just the characters being dumb, right? Um, whereas Zombieland is that the setting itself is inherently funny, right? Zombieland 2 was cringe though. Yeah, like... I don't know, that there, there were several points of that movie that I just didn't understand. Like, why did they introduce so many zombie types at the beginning and then not have any of them come back? That was weird. Uh, wasn't the budget the reason Nick uh, didn't say a single line in that movie? A apparently so, yeah. Apparently the budget was so low that they couldn't actually pay him to do it. Which is crazy, because I can't imagine uh, Willy's Wonderland with voice lines. You know, it would be weird if he spoke. Wait, Zombieland and Shaun of the Dead were boring and bad, in my opinion. <gasps> what? Wait, wait, hold on, Onyx. I've always respected you as a person with generally good takes. How can you come out with such an objectively L opinion? That is insane. You didn't like Shaun of the Dead? What? Huh? Hold on, it's April 1st. Wait, what the fuck? So good. It was like one of the best movies ever made. It's a masterpiece. Like, the, the, the comedy in that movie is genius. Don't L opinion. I'm, I'm sorry, Onyx. Coming into my stream and telling me that Shaun of the Dead is bad. <laughs> what the fuck? L, Smog, I, I completely agree, man. Absolutely. So boring, L opinion. <laughs> it was so boring, L opinion, you Shaun of the Dead was ass. Okay, Onyx. Okay. Not all of us can be born with good opinions. I'm, I'm sorry, dude. I think Hot Fuzz is better than Shaun of the Dead. Um, wait, it's better, but Shaun of the Dead is very good. I, oh, dude, the, the problem is, I mean, like, inherently, like I was saying, like, I am just a zombie fanatic. I love zombies. I love horror. Also, Midwitch, let's fight. Oh, it's the same build as last time. Whoops. <laughs> Into the shed for him, I agree. Remember, don't ban me. It's really, it's, it's really tempting, Onyx, admittedly. It is right there. Okay, we're gonna scare the shit out of some gamers real quick. Let's see if we can swing. With band limbo. Now that's appealing. Ooh. That's an M1. <laughs> no! <laughs> I'm sorry, Onyx, you have been banned. <laughs> I prefer Zombie Land. Over Shaun of the Dead, bro! Chat, I'm not sure what to say here, dude. Who are we banning? Okay. Um, I mean, especially from someone up north, actually. I, I, I'd be very curious. Chen, what, what is your honest opinion on Shaun of the Dead? Especially versus Zombieland, and also versus Hot Fuzz. Oh, shit. Hold on. Oh, my God. It is a Chris Redfield. The Boulder Punch Man. I'm thinking about creating an app to help new players with builds and which survivors and killers would be helpful at the start. That sounds like a wonderful idea, just please don't flood it with ads. Is Shaun of the Dead slander is blowing my mind? Right, Luda? What the fuck? I, I, I was pretty happily under the opinion that everybody thought Shaun of the Dead was the best movie ever made. What is going on? Uh, do you ever think about how Chris Redfield is currently 48 years old? As in... Like, based on how old he was in RE5? What do you mean, like, canonically in, like, RE... Um, oh, I can rush. That's really cool. Cheers. I think Borat is the best film ever made. <laughs> Dead. You've never seen Zombieland. Hot Fuzz is mid. Okay, but surely that, surely that it is a banger film. Thank you, Sham. Based on RE1. Well, compared to, like... I mean, did he look like 40 in a uh, village? No, not really. You know what? I'd never consider that, Mile. Hot Fuzz is mid man. <laughs> this man needs an ambulance. <laughs> oh, we've got some controversy tonight, man. Oh, come on, Midwitch. Oh, hold on. Oh, my God. Never mind. That was entirely intentional. I am just too good at the game. I try and make a mistake, and then we still end up killing them. Ah! Sniped. Ba -ba -bam. 
the Hoffa's slightly beat Shaun of the Dead, but both are classics. I, 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 if someone came to me and said, Lilith, I think Hot Fuzz is the better movie, right? I, I wouldn't be against it because ultimately the two of them are masterpieces to me. You are comparing two very good forms of media anyway, right? I think I, I'm just slightly biased. Also, he killed himself. Nice. I, I'm biased because I just love horror movies. I sworn someone was there. I think it just depends if you uh, prefer horror action. For sure. I, I I would still happily say that, like, Hot Fuzz is a 10 out of 10, though. Over here. Uh, Chris looks great in Village. He really does, man. In fact, I, I, I honestly feel like Village is the best that he's ever looked. I'm a woman and I'm entirely correct. What in the Hot Fuzz one? I'm, I'm going to stay out of this, this, this uh, discussion. This is about to get heated. <laughs> and are your traps on? I'm, I'm presuming you're a big fan of Shaun of the Dead, right? Um, enjoy the emotes dad for viewing the spiciest gameplay of all time. And I have a wonderful day. I appreciate you, dude. Okay, no one uh, on this gen, I guess. Uh, is that the blight main little foeman? Is that Kalena? Holy shit, how's it going? David. Close. Oh, it's a balanced landing. I can see he had a plan here. Now, the RE5 boulder punching bastard Chris is where it's at. I'm, I'm, I'm not going to argue that point. That it is also pretty cool. But he doesn't have the cool jacket, you know? The jacket in RE Village was kind of sick. Hit slap to the face. Oh, look, if I was the pyramid head the other day with a trial, and now I'm here all the time. Wait, the... Oh, shit, Jack. Welcome in. It is good to see you, buddy. Uh, you know what films are great? Train spotting and filth. I've never seen filth. Train spotting, I would agree. Also, Donnie Darko. I love how, like, one point started, like, a movie discussion for, like, 30 minutes, man. It's great, <laughs> it's great dude. Uh, the worst Chris has to be an RE7. Oh, w without a shadow of a doubt, man. Like, he, he, he doesn't look like Chris. He doesn't sound like Chris. He doesn't act like Chris. I mean, the only reason they put him in the game was because I, I'm pretty sure they got to the end of, of producing RE7. And they were like, oh shit, this has nothing to do with, with Resident Evil in it whatsoever. So they just decided to stick in like a couple notes from Umbrella and also stick Chris at the end, you know? It very much felt like a last minute thing, you know? Let's see. Uh, Vulsing window, there is no window. That's kind of based. Yeah. Uh, Biohazard should have ended on the small boats. I think... Yeah. I mean, I mean, having, like, the revelation that the grandma was the, the bad guy was kind of cool. Also, there's no hook here. Oh, shit. Um... Okay, you might survive. If she runs back to the bathroom, I literally can't do anything here. Let's see. Does she take a right turn? A questionable decision, I respect it. <laughs> Midwitchery, yeah. <laughs> In fact, one time, um, shit, okay, some of you might remember, we had this one match on Gideon, where we had, I I'm not kidding you, um, like literally zero hooks on the bottom floor. And so survivors that died down there, I, 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 I couldn't hook them. I've never seen anything like it. Get all hooks upstairs, yeah, for sure. It's insane. I've had midwitch. I don't think I've had like zero hooks before, but I've had like one at the bathroom and nothing else on the bottom floor. Also, RE6 Chris just um, finished saying he'd never trust Umbrella just to join Neo Neo Umbrella. Yeah, I I, I mean, to be fair, I presume uh, Capcom decided to just pretend that RE6 never happened, which I do respect. Okay, what do we have? Oh, my triple distortion. I guess that makes sense as to why we never saw anybody with friends. So three distortions. Windows times four. Bingo. Windows. Windows. Bingo. 
Uh, we got some resilience, adrenaline, bond, soul survivor. Um, I think, honestly, they were very good teammates. Hold on, champ. We're gonna start nothing for no particular reason. Are they still there? Hold on, wait. Who's complaining? Dizzy Amy. They're an epic game store. That's crazy. What did they do wrong, exactly? Don't do that. Huge tech hold on the instigator. Of course, dude. Still there. Oh, he left. Didn't even have a discussion. Now I'm never going to know why those were two useless teammates. That's ridiculous. RE6 is the best RE game. Onyx, I, 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 I can't tell if you're just being a, contra <laughs> a contrarian now. You come into my stream, tell me Shaun of the Dead is a bad movie and also RE6 is the best one. Are you kidding me, dude? Actually... Your base you, that, that that is not base that that is like a, as far from base as you could possibly get like imagine the distance from like england to australia right pretty fucking far away now imagine putting like another like planet like inside of the earth and so you had to go double the distance that is still not far enough dude onyx said re7 is ass. onyx is just in one of those moods today you know um <laughs> <laughs> Also, see you later, Parks. Uh, thank you for the bill, by the way. That was a lot of fun. I did it twice. Uh, do I like the new RE games like Village? Uh, yeah, I mean, I, I think the RE7 is one of the best in the entire franchise. Um, I think the RE2 remake was a masterpiece. RE3 was a little bit sad, but it wasn't the worst thing ever. I'd still rather play that over 6. Um, Village was good. I don't think it held up to like seven. I think it meant it, it went a little bit too far on the action side of things, but it was very memorable. Lots of good characters and stuff. Um, the RE4 remake is arguably one of the best games ever made, period. Like, honestly, like, like genuine word of advice. If anyone is looking for something to play this weekend, um, and you're into like horror games, if you've not played RE4, it is, it is absolute perfection. Um, it's not like super ultra horror. Um, it's like kind of action-y, but it, it's pretty tense. It's, dude, everything about it is amazing. Halfway in RE4, it's, it's so good. I'm pretty sure we completed it in one sitting on stream, I think. RE4 remake was bad. <laughs> Onyx, get out! <laughs> what? Uh, can, can someone unban Onyx? I feel really bad, actually. Onyx is really cool. Uh, whoops. What the fuck? RE4 remake was bad? What are these L takes, dude? Uh, Onyx, welcome back. What the fuck? Those opinions are minging, bro. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, that is indeed a gamer. With drama, Uh, the original RE4 was my childhood. I agree. I'm crying, bro. <laughs> Onyx, how could you do this to me? You are no longer invited to my birthday party. I need to get back to the RE4 remake. Uh, I need to get back on Mercs there. I, to be fair, also need to play Mercenaries, and I do need to play the Ada DLC. Ah! The Onyx, I'm sorry, dude. My birthday is... Like, if you want to come to my birthday party, you have to, at the very least, appreciate the fact that, you know, RE4 is the greatest game of all time. Dwight? No, it is not. Okay, Onyx... What are, like, like, genuinely curious? I, I, I can't tell if you're memeing or not. What are your top three favorite games of all time? Oh, dude. Like, top three. Hold on, chat. Watch this bad boy. You ready? Ah! Oh, yeah! <laughs> yes! <laughs> Sorry, Dwight. You are just shit at the game, man. Oh, dude. Absolutely annihilated. Sucks to be you, dude. <laughs> anyway, on the hook, you go. Ah! Candy Crush? Oh my god. Yep, Candy Crush, Raid Shadow Legends. Yep. Uh, surprised he went into the alcove there. Wait. Oh. Oh yeah, plot twist. Uh, how does he do it? I don't know, man. If you want the honest truth. Uh, also, Dwight's pretty upset, I guess. Fair enough. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Teabag me all my like. You're the one that's bad at the game. Um, the, the honest truth is I have a really dumb idea. And then I do it. And sometimes it works. <laughs> Nothing personal, kiddo. <laughs> Back over here. Wait, hold on. 
Uh, can I get to that? Close. Onyx is the leader of the Shortly Dead and RE4 Hate Club. Uh, they're also the only member, I presume so. Where's Onyx's message? Hold on. The Evil Within's your favorite? Oh my god. Okay, so like, admittedly, I know a lot of people love that game. Uh, also, Lewis in YouTube chat says, I just farted. That's wonderful. I'm proud of you, dude. That makes me really happy to hear. Um, I've, I've lost my train of thought now, man. I have no idea what I'm on about. Uh, you gonna roll that one? Nope. Like, I, I, I'm not the biggest fan of Evil Within because I feel like I was lied to. I know it was a long time ago and it kind of makes me old, but like when the teaser first came out for that game, it looks amazing. It looks like, um, I don't know, it was so like grim and like dark and horror. And then every mission after the first one ended up just being uh, action. <laughs> Better out than Lewis. <laughs> Boy, don't walk on my gen, Dwight. Not again. This poor guy. I do feel bad for him. He's been kind of shit on. Wait, hold on. I'm going to try something else. That probably won't land, but it might do. Let's see. Do you think he runs away? Either one, two is better. I do agree. No, I could have hit that man. I didn't think he'd vault the window. So close. Spare the tweets? No, if anything, he's going to be featuring in my uh, in tonight's episode of TikTok Montage. Uh, if we, wait, hold on. The Evil Within was trying so hard to be um, Ari in the trailers. Google, I'm, I'm so glad that, that, that someone is old enough. <laughs> is old like me to remember. Yeah, it was really trying to be, but it looks pretty good though, right? In fact, actually, okay, here's a question. What do you guys think is the most, like, over-promised, under-delivered horror game? The most, like, um, overrated, I'm trying to think of the right word. Like, like, what game do you think was the most disappointing horror game of all time? So I felt like a really particular one that you guys might not even remember. <laughs> Dead <by> Daylight? <laughs> Evil then? I mean, it, it's up there. I wouldn't say it's the worst, though. Vampire Rain. Oh, dude, that makes me so happy. Remember Vampire Rain. We must get to the rendezvous point. <laughs> rendezvous point. <laughs> it did have a charm to it, admittedly. But yeah, I remember playing the demo um, after seeing the tr the uh, teaser for that one. I, you know, thinking like, wow, this is going to be the greatest game of all time. Yeah, Vampire Rain was was a fascinating game. Uh, sure, that's fine. Uh, at least the protocol didn't live up to expectations. That's fair. Outlast 2. I've heard a lot of people say that. Outlast 2 seems to be way more uh, divisive than the first one. Um, I loved the first or the second Outlast. I know a lot of people didn't. That's why it wants to kiss. He really does, man. Evil Within, Vampire Rain, DVD, uh, TCM. Th that That's fair. I, I do feel like my expectations were way too high. Or at least it didn't deliver. I wasn't super impressed with TCM, which is a shame because I love Death 13. And I, 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 I love the franchise. It is Evil Within is the worst game ever. Shit, I'm totally not saying this because Onyx is the worst opinions imaginable. That's also fair. Let's go in the middle. Okay, so th this is going to be really specific and I feel like only a very small handful of you guys are going to remember this game. Um... Probably the most disappointing game of all time, I think. I I'm gonna have to Google it to find the name of it. Th th there was a horror game that was released on the Kinect, the original Kinect on the Xbox 360. Um, and for the life of me, I can't remember what it was called, but it was looking incredible. In fact, I feel like it was the only horror game to release on the Kinect. It like like it put you in the game and like your like movements and like you would like physically hit the zombies and shit. And it ended up being absolute garbage. Like the worst game imaginable. Rise of, Rise of Nightmares. Yeah, that shit, dude. I remember being so excited. I pre-ordered that game. And I was like, man, imagine being like inside the horror experience. Wow. And then, yeah, it was it was absolute garbage. Rise of Nightmares. Do you remember that one? Oh, shit, just punched the microphone. Yeah, absolute garbage. 
you had to like like so so for reference it was a first person shooter um where you were the controller and the way that you moved in that game was by standing on one leg and having the other leg go forwards. You had to balance the entire time you were playing that game just to move forwards. If you wanted to turn left or right, you had to like move your like one of your shoulders forwards to like insinuate that you're turning. So imagine you're there, there's a zombie coming to attack you, right? But you, you wanna make some distance, you wanna turn away from it. So you lift up one leg <laughs> and turn a shoulder to move at like a snail pace away from something that can move 10 times quicker than you. I, it blows my mind. I genuinely don't think there is any way that game was ever playtested. And like, dude, like, if, if someone was like, if, if someone was like a disabled player that was excited for that game, like, oh my god, you were fucked. I uh, gotta hit the stanky leg to dodge unspeakable horrors. <laughs> but like, I, I, dude, it was wild. Was it Valnex? Uh, more than likely, yeah, I'd, I'd imagine so. I mean, I was disappointed the PT never released. True, but I mean, PT itself was PT though, right? I think I've only seen the Cheryl one time the entire match. Uh, we, yeah, we've never actually chased her. Um, she has three hook states remaining. So it is my, it, it, it is my mortal condition to make sure that she does not escape this match by any means. Uh, connect crawl so VR could run. You're not wrong. Nice one, Cheryl. That was really cool and base of you. Chats, feast your eyes on what is possibly the coolest player in DVD history. Uh, they use the connect as a disability aid now. Uh, much better, uh, much, much better at that than the gaming peripheral. Oh, for sure. I've, I've, I've heard that and also there's like this particular like controller that Xbox came out with that seems to be really good as like, um... As like, wasn't there like some like random controversy recently? Because like, like, like you know, obviously a lot of disabled players aren't able to play with the same controllers that that you know people do conventionally, right? Wasn't there some controversy that like Microsoft wasn't going to allow you to play with third-party controllers that would just wipe out like every disabled person's ability to play anything? Like, what is going on, dude? Also, chat. It is indeed time for the hour, so get your points involved if you want to win some. Devour bad opinions. Uh, dope opinions or nope opinions, Onyx. <laughs> I bet Onyx feels like a star right now, dude. Uh, Nillary, I'm a dude, okay, but you know what's happening Monday and Tuesday and Wednesday and Thursday and Friday is uh, more of the B Square best vibes on Twitch. Also, uh, Nillary, uh, at some point, I know that I've been pretty awful with it recently. I mean, obviously, there's a lot of stuff been going on. We do need to play some uh, COD Zombies. I attempted some more. Um, what was it? Uh, Mob the Dead recently, and I am very rusty. Uh, what did I think about the Dying Light series? So, weirdly enough, maybe someone can, like, uh, inspire me to play the second one again. I loved the first game so much, dude. Um, it was amazing. It was, like, it somehow took the concept of, like, parkour and zombies and made it work. Um, the map was amazing. The soundtrack was incredible. The visuals were really good. Um... It's also really good in VR, by the way, if you want to try that one. Like, that game was immaculate. And then the second one came out, and I didn't really get into it for some reason. I'm not sure why, but like, I I, I just, I don't know, it wasn't that appealing. Yo, oh, Marcus, why are you so handsome and cool? Um, that is so kind of you, 750 million bits. Um, you, you, you must have like almost unlocked all the emotes at this point, dude. That's crazy, thank you, Marcus. Hope you're having a wonderful day, man. Yeah, the server ward. I feel like we always play the battle here. I uh, don't play the second game, so not lose respect for the first game. But see, the thing is, I've heard a lot of people that love the the second game. And maybe I should give it, you know, kind of give it another try. Another one, actually, not horror based, but another game that I didn't really play that much was um, Dishonored Two. For some reason, I remember loving the first one. I platinum that game, and then uh, yeah, didn't really get into the second one. Favorite streamer, yo Marty, it's so good to see you, dude. Hello. Ah! 
That's very kind of you to say, man. What's my happy Friday? Okay, well, that's not good. Uh, one's been cleansed already. So I tried Sonic 2 and made it so frustrated. Did you love the first game, though? Am I not crazy for thinking that? I think also, like, being selfish, I just loved Corvo. I'll slip another $5. Uh, survivors cleanse that shit, bro. <laughs> Is she smart? Doesn't drop the pallet? Cool. You want me dope? Because no offense, Onyx has, uh, has had some L takes. You're not wrong, dude. I could believe the most L takes I've ever read. <laughs> Scanned out the ghost achievement. Uh, was was the, was that the one where you never got seen? Because uh, same actually. I remember um, completing the whole game. It took me hours, and I had to do it again. So it was bugged. Six hours times a weird thing. It goes so quick, dude. It's nuts. It's so strange. Like, you know, streaming six hours of DVD, it was like nothing. Like six hours on a plane. Oh my God, dude, it's brutal. Oh, the full style from is so difficult. Yeah, it was cool though, right? Like imagine having a game that you can, you know, physically complete without ever actually being seen. That was a really cool selling point. Yo, gamer. Ah! We're thinking about PT again. Have you played PT in VR? Because if you've not, you should experience it at some point. I just something feels weird because it's a game about killing, and then it makes you feel bad for killing. Yeah, I, 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 I did always. Oh no, not that way. Not that way. No, 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 no. I always kind of felt like the morality system in that game was strange. Like, I mean, I mean, ultimately, everyone in the game was a bad guy, right? But it kind of made you feel for doing what seemed like good things to bad people. Uh oh, shit. Scratch marks. Okay, Devour has now popped. I'm going to go over here. I'm going to open the locker. I'm going to hook and I'm going to run away. So I can make sure that no one's cleansing shit. Also, uh, yo, dude, Olive Garden breadstick. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, running double iridescent. That is compound 33 and iridescent light tag. Yo, nah, nah, nah. Get off my bones. Don't touch my bones. Do not even consider touching my bones. Do not fathom the concept of my bones. Uh, that's my issue with The Last of Us 2. They guilt you for killing um, dogs. The dogs were actually mauling me. Yeah. Yeah, it always seems weird. There was another game that I remember. The morality system being kind of weird. I can't remember what it was. Bioshock? Oh, shit. Am I within devour distance here? If I vault and I stay on the other side of the window, I am within devour distance. Oh, she doesn't make it to the pallet, does she? Nice. The window. I mean, theoretically, uh, I'm going to go check those bones over there because I don't trust them. No. Fable. Fable as well. Yeah, Fable always had a weird morality situation going on. Was that dead hard? Was that styptic? Get off me bones. Don't touch me bones. Go unhook your teammates. Otherwise, you will objectively die. What are they doing? Still to this day, it's, it's always just been the weirdest counter to me. To, to, to think that survivors think the best method of countering devour, which ultimately will kill your teammates, is to kill your teammates. <laughs> right? Like, they seem a bit strange to me. Okay, so pick up on uh, Yui. That's good. That's good. Uh, based on the uh, based on the fact that we have four hook states remaining, um, I don't think any of these guys are on death hook. A uh, person who played Ellie grew up in my city. Really? No kidding. That's sick. As in, like, in the game or the series? 
Oh, okay, now we run away. Check the bones, no one over here. It's just me or the scratch marks acting strange. Yeah, they have been for a while. Um, they seem to display very delayed and also in very strange positions. They, they, they often are, you know, on ceilings or walls or things and they're not very helpful. It's one of them. Uh, stop playing Blight No Skilled. You are totally correct there. Based opinion. Although, if you don't mind me asking, uh, which character do you play? Uh, how's she doing this sweet Luna? She's, she's doing alright, man. Uh, she's going through a lot right now, but yeah, she's doing good. Can confirm, chat. That is indeed Devour Dope. Fairy man is different. Fairy man is different. I agree. Oh, I got the hatch. Damn. GG's. Sorry, Onyx. You lose this time. Good day, sir. Let's see. So, uh, Stipsick, it was indeed. Uh, with made for this and off the record and deliverance, which I feel like I didn't get. GG's. Uh, alert. Smash here. Parental guidance. Overcome. GG's. Chat, sadly. Uh, that is the end of stream, but, I mean, happily, uh, Dope did win. Um, it is Friday, we're not gonna be streaming tomorrow or Sunday, but we are gonna be back for five streams of the spiciest gameplay. You guys know the drill on Monday. Thank you, everyone, for being here. As always, it blows my mind. You guys are the greatest community on the planet. Blight Man, I'm gonna miss you as well, man. Um, Haley, Shan, Marcus, Zoe, Lime Juice, Shan again, uh, Shade, Isle, uh, all the legends in chat, if you're lurking, if you're active, if you, if you just followed, if you're watching on YouTube, because you're absolutely based. Um, have a wonderful weekend. You know, make sure to do some cool stuff. Order some beers. I don't know. Order some pizza. But make sure ultimately to stay safe. I appreciate you guys. I very much care if you are being dude. And uh, yeah, much love, dude. I'll see you guys on Monday. Let's go find someone to drop a chonking raid on, dude. Can't wait till next stream. Honestly, same, man. Let's see who is currently online doing stuff. Actually, I think I know where we're going to go. Uh, we are going to be dropping a raid on a good friend. This is uh, Twisted Visuals. Um, he's a survivor player. I mean, he kind of plays both, but he's insane on survivor. Probably one of the best players you will ever see. Um, so yeah, go over there. Enjoy the good vibes. The spicy survivor gameplay. And, uh, yeah, say hello to our uh, Twisted Visuals. The good dude. See ya, see ya, see ya, see ya.